It's a new year, so that can only mean one thing. It's time for those new year resolutions. And it's the perfect time to start a new hobby. Jewellery Maker, Sewing Street and Hobby Maker are here whether you're starting something new or advancing your skills on a current hobby. With all the tools you need to start, as well as expert demonstrations from our great guests. Are you starting a new hobby this January? Share your new makes with us by tagging Jewelry Maker, Hobby Maker or Sewing Street using the hashtag New Year New Hobby. And watch us every day from 8am to 1pm on Jewelry Maker. On Hobby Maker, 6 to 8am and 1 to 6pm. And 8am to 1pm on Sewing Street. Jewelry Makers, this coming Wednesday, it's Claire McDonald's birthday show. Make sure you tune in for what will be an absolutely amazing five hours of treats. We have a mega bundle of soldable accents and gem setting bracelet kits. Your deal of the day is the beautiful blue chalcedony. Plus, anybody who buys during the show is in with a chance of winning a goodie bag worth over a hundred pounds so make sure you tune in join the celebrations for claire's birthday oh here we are always arranging ourselves aren't we <laughs> <laughs> literally good morning Good morning. It's your birthday. I'm going to party like it's your birthday. Ah. I'm going to sit Bacardi. Oh, that would be nice. Yes, please. Yeah, I'd, I'm, I'd not like sure I could, I, I'm not Bacardi. sure I'm at 8 o'clock in the morning. No, I'd be all right. That's OK. <laughs> uh, it's Happy your birthday. Happy birthday, Claire. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you very much. I mean, it's not your official birthday, is it? It's not, no. Your birthday's on Sunday. My birthday's on Sunday. And you're doing what? I don't know yet. <laughs> I You've don't got all know. lovely surprises. I don't know. Oh, yeah. you deserve Wait it. and see. Wait and see. But yeah. you deserve to be pampered and spoiled. Thank that's you. For sure. Oh, thanks. Well, speaking of pampered and spoilt, how <laughs> lovely is today's show? Oh, I know. And the I fact know. you've got balloons as well. I don't oh, know. Yes. That. Pretty. Pretty yeah. pink balloons for your birthday. Yeah. Um, today's show. I know. I Completely feel like. jam packed. I feel like I, I, I worked with worked with lovely Sam upstairs, and he's let me pick everything that I love. These are a few of your favourite things. Mm. I love that sterling silver bangle. Oh my goodness! Are you ready? Get ready for this. Okay. Feel that? Is that solid? Yes. Oh my goodness! Is this coming up in today's show? Yeah. Oh my, that's lit. You can make this and there's no soldering. So I could do this? Yeah. Oh, How heavy. It feels lovely, doesn't really it? Really heavy. And it's not hollow. No. So that's not going to buckle. No. And this is coming up at nine o'clock. It's coming up at nine o'clock. Along and this one. And this one. Look at this one. Let me see, let me see, let me see. Ah, oh, Claire. You're so good, aren't you? Look at, oh, look at them. Oh, and that's solid too. Yeah, that's solid too. How, oh, look, you could wear them together, Claire. Yeah, and then this one as well. Look at this one. Hang on, there's more. There's more. There is more. There is more. Oh, I think we've got more goodness. sterling silver today. Some Whoa. might even say it's almost a sterling silver day. I think it could be, couldn't it? So when we say a few of your favourite things, <clears> this <throat> truly is. It is. Truly it is. is. And then we've got some of my favourite gemstones as well. Oh my goodness, gemstones, Claire. Yeah. The most, you, well, I'm going to show you your early bird firstly, because these are coming up within Ooh. this hour. <coughs> Excuse me. And um, of course, you can shop ahead. You can pre-order on yours as well to guarantee your success. These <gasps> are the most amazing, beautiful amethyst cushions. Um, wonderful, <coughs> soft, pastel, you know I always describe it as a lovely, a lovely peony pink. Yes, they that are is reminiscent stunning. of the finest quality kunzite, don't you think? That's what Ross is saying in my ear. How beautiful would they be? In Claire's... I was going to say in the hands of Claire McDonald's. Yes. Yeah, cause in my pocket. In, well, well, Claire, you, would, you might think, and when I was prepping for <coughs> the show, most certainly I was thinking that there was going to be one. 
I was thinking there's only going to be one, but I missed the pack of three that it actually says on, the, on my star by sheet. Um, you might think that you have to invest somewhat in those. You definitely I would say don't. So. so much so, I have to say, Ross, producer Ross in my ear is going, oh. Ooh. Oh. I assume, Ross, you are referencing the early bird deal. Yeah, yeah, Ooh. yeah. Um, oh, Ooh. just start shop ahead when he, when he does that. You know, like, you know, like a builder goes, <sighs> but normally that's because the price is going to be high. Ross is doing it because the price is going to be low. Yeah, well, that's good. Yeah, it's the opposite with our Roscoe. Good morning, Ross and Adam. Uh, How are you doing? Poor Adam's a bit poorly today. Oh, no. Are you OK, Adam? Yeah, right. Oh, he's got the most pitiful cough. <laughs> Have you got a cough? Is that it? Or have you got lurgy? Have you got the lurgy? Yeah. Aww. Yeah. Poor thing. I hate a cold. They're rubbish, aren't oh, they? Oh, yes, they are. Absolutely Completely rubbish. Completely and yeah. utterly rubbish. Yeah. Anyway, I'm still not done because I want to show you these oh, as well. Oh, look at these. One of my favourites. I love Praiserlite. It's so beautiful. That lovely, delicate, minty green. Gosh, they're beautiful. Also coming up in today's show, um, I'm gonna just, I'm just gonna literally just show you all these gorgeous, gorgeous things that we have surrounding us. Claire, I mean, oh. seriously, all these lovely sterling silver components that are included, beautiful. Oh pearls my word! That are included in today's show. I mean, we've got, we've got an hour as well with Dave of stunning blue chalcedony. Oh, oh it's gonna be absolutely amazing. Ooh. We've also got, I know, loads of blues <gasps> and ours. Just check this out. I'm gonna. Scooch it over this beautiful tea bar. We've got a tea bar of dreams today. Oh, look how amazing these pearls are. <laughs> <laughs> Can you carry that on a bit longer? Oh, the voice of an angel. <laughs> Did you like that? I loved it. <laughs> Well, I've been, I was in Wales yesterday, so, you know, it's the oh, most balance yes, rubbing off on yes, me, isn't it? Yes, it? it is, it is. They, everywhere yeah. in Wales, they do sing. My brother and I went out for a coffee. I, whenever I go down to Wales to see my family and my friends and whatnot, I come back and Tom's like, oh, you're, ultra, you're extra Welsh out today. Yes, I start that happens, my, my, yeah. My, 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 your my, accent my, is, my yeah, accent it's is lovely. Situated. So we went out for a, a coffee, Rich and I was like, oh, I, I do sound really Welsh. It's it, nice. I like the yeah. Welsh accent. Oh, I me too. It's lovely. Me too. Um, <clears throat> anyway, yes, got those closeout deals on those amazing pearls. We've got the last opportunities of your beautiful seraphonite. We've got the most unbelievable strand of malachite. These are all coming up in this hour, so you can shop ahead. You know how to do it? It is all the W's at jewelrymaker.com. Um, uh, we'll be doing the world fame a little bit later on, by the way. Um, <coughs> click on watch live. We're just having a few technical issues of the wall of fame. Bear with us. We'll try and get that rectified. Scroll down and you'll see all these beautiful goodies. Oh, oh look. I know. Oh. I know, I know, I know. Some of which will be going even lower. Oh, oh I was wearing look those those. the other day. Oh. Those uh, Zuru-inspired Oh, lovely, earrings. lovely look. Oh, lovely look at all these pearls. Beautiful. There's the malachite. Oh, those Wait a minute. That malachite says $24.99. That malachite, Roscoe, said $24.99. Sterling silver with pearls. pearls. Oh, Black diamonds. diamonds. Oh. I gave Did you write? Oh, look, look, look. I know, honestly, loads on your butt. And it's a pretty big butt. <laughs> Only available until nine o'clock, so make sure you do check out your baskets, okay? Or until stocks last, quite literally. So, And some of those items are already selling out, so you, I, I jump on it. Jump on it. Get cracking so you don't miss out on your opportunities. Yeah. Right then, Claire McDonald, your birthday show. Um, what are we going to start with? What are we going to start with? Don't forget you've got a beautiful, beautiful showcase um, <gasps> of your um, of your Calcedony. They are already flying out on the website, said our Roscoe. So there you go. There you go. There you go. Um, she's very excited today, is our lovely Claire. Um, FYI. We've got, oh, yes, 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 yes. Ross, which one? Which one? What do you mean all three? Do you mean these? You get them? Yeah, because I just assumed, I assumed, Ross, shouldn't assume, should you? <laughs> Hang on, because now it just, what's in here then? And these? Oh, 
You're getting all of that. Ooh. Coming up at nine o'clock, we're going to do a close-out deal on these naturally coloured purple and peach pearls. So you get the fireball pearl, you get the beautiful half-drilled trio, you get two strands of natural. Look at the luster on those That's pearls. That's incredible, isn't it? And you get the pretty bag as well. Um, I'm going to show you the price point of these. Yeah, seriously, that's so Ooh. low. That should be that should be the price for either, either, or. I'm going to say it should either be the price of maybe this, or it should be maybe the price of one of those strands. Um, um, unbelievable closeout deal. I'm just going to give you a little bit of a heads up. That's coming up at nine o'clock this morning, so you haven't got too long to wait for that one. Loads of sterling silver components if you're desperate in desperate need. Um, loads of beautiful gems and treasures and birthday girlers. Sell by our lovely Claire McDonald yeah. as well. Um, sounds to me like it's going to be a pretty perfect Wednesday morning. Yes. Oh. <laughs> apart from the fact that I <laughs> apart from the fact that I can't Dan these are my usual ones I, I can't I can't use these here we go oh, oh. <laughs> hang on let's just do this let's just do that shall we there you go I can't use those tweezers oh was it a bad a, a bad workman blames his tools and all that? That's yeah, that's one hundred percent what I'm doing right now. Blue lace arcade, but ching could have been so much worse though, Claire, couldn't it? It could have. Could have been. But ching, but ching. Yeah, it could have. Could have, have. <laughs> could have got Dan. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay. Uh, the queen of your agates, of course, beautiful blue lace with these wonderful, almost rolling cloud-like formations that occur naturally within this gemstone. Stop it. Stop it, I know, I know. I've been doing it 10 years, you'd think I'd be able to use a pair of tweezers, <laughs> wouldn't you? I've got 27 opportunities and straight away people are getting involved. Good morning, I hope you're all well on this Wednesday morning. It's quite chilly, but I did notice it's getting much lighter in the mornings now. Yes, I didn't think it was as cold this morning. No. No, it was foggy though. Typical when I literally very bought myself foggy. the thickest coat in the world. Ever. Oh, have you? <laughs> <laughs> and now the weather's going to change. Now the weather's going to change. Like, it's it's so thick I could barely drive. <laughs> you know, like, I feel a bit restricted in this, but I was very warm, nice and toasty. Oh, lovely. Twenty-seven opportunities available. And I think our Roscoe is going to give... I mean, we're at 9 99 You get a pair of calibrated sizes, so you know what you're getting. They're lovely. Look They're at the markings on you. them. So lovely, aren't they? And totally and utterly natural. Uh, <coughs> your blue oh, lace agate... Wow. But I was about to say, blue lace agate is ordinarily one of the more considered varieties of your agates. Oh. A, because it's natural. B, because it's actually very limited in its quantity and its supply these days. Um, do be mindful of, uh, of blue lace agate, which is a dyed agate. And yeah, that's fine, but um, technically speaking, it wouldn't be genuine blue lace. It's already over allocated. Well done. And a very good morning to you all. Pauline, Janet, Jennifer, hello to you. Elizabeth, hello to you. Rachel, Claire, Liana and Peter. You do need to check out those baskets, those cheeky baskets. Gosh, that's an incredible price. And we have got, um, in the 12 o'clock, we have got um, lovely bezel strip. Yeah. Oh, sorry, sorry. It's definitely me, Claire. I think I've got the drop seats today. Um, so Which you could work use beautiful. this. Yes, yeah. And so we'll go through that in the masterclass, we'll, how to work with um, so at 12 with the best. Yes. 12 o'clock today. Amazing. That's sterling silver. So imagine them for completing a beautiful nice, sterling yeah. silver ring. Um, is, there an, is there an issue on the website? Check out your baskets. Everybody's got it in their baskets, but I can't see you tipping over. As of yet, which makes me make concerns me. I'll leave it with you for now. Remember, they are massively over allocated already. Let's do what? Sorry. These are oh my goodness oh. me. There is only one. Is this the strand that Tom bought me the other day? It look. I, f I feel like it is. It looks very similar to the strand that I actually picked. Oh, up. that looks lovely. Um, totally it? natural. Hello to Nancy saying happy birthday for Sunday, Claire. You shared your birthday with my grandson. Uh, oh, how do Mizale? Mizale? How would a pretty? Oh, do you think it's Michael? Yeah. That might make sense. If I, it might just be my pronunciation as well. Um, it will be two. Aww. Aww. Um, I can see similarity in you two. Yes. 
<laughs> there probably is many, many similarities, <laughs> are Nancy. Uh, um, happy birthday. Uh, hello to you, Jane, saying good morning, Alan. Happy birthday, Claire. I hope you have a beautiful Aww, day. Oh, thank you so much, Jane. As That's beautiful really as you are, Claire. Oh, thank you. You deserve it. You really thank do. Um, we've got lots of messages thank coming you. through for you. Happy birthday for Sunday, Claire, says Graham and Donna. Ah, oh, thank you, Graham and Donna. Yeah, cheers. Yes. She doesn't know what she's doing yet. It's a surprise. Yeah. I love that. That's yeah. so cute. Ooh. Very romantic. Um, is it, keep them coming through, everyone. Happy birthday, Claire. Um, here's to a day as special as you, Aww. says Rachel. How lovely. Oh, I might cry today, I think. Oh. Of happiness. Yes, ha happy, lovely. Happy it's tears. So, it's so nice. Do you know what Ross just said I then? I heard him. He is, he's awful, isn't he? <laughs> He, is. he said, keep, just, those, keep those messages coming through. I, I so have tears in my eyes probably most shows. When a nice text comes in, I have to like look down a bit. I know, it's, it's nice. They're happy tears, though, yeah, aren't oh, they? Yeah, not, not sad, sad Not like, oh, sad <laughs> that was a horrible... No, it's lovely. Well, Ross is saying, uh, yeah, people are really do you, nice. Ross? He says he cries about once a day. It's good for you. Well, 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 but happy tears, I hope. Yes. Yeah. Mostly, of course. Showing emotion. He cries out of kindness and niceness. Yeah. Do you know, I think it's I think that's lovely, Ross, and it's nice to be able to show your emotions. You know, it's nothing to be ashamed of, is it? Yeah. I get I get it. I think particularly as I'm getting older, the sm like I can't watch things like The X Factor or Britain's Got Talent. I always end up oh, an yeah. blubbering yeah. wreck with things like Susan that. Susan Boyle and Leona Lewis make me cry every time. Every it doesn't time. matter how old those every auditions are. Every single time. Yeah. Yeah. Do you know what? Crying because of acts of kindness. Yes, I get that too. That's lovely. Yeah. That's really lovely. Yeah, people are lovely. Look at the colour on these. Can you imagine? Can you oh. imagine being the custodian of such such an intense ultraviolet colour? This is the one that you are going to be betting, getting, literally the one that I have um, here in the studio. It is exceptional. You've got perfect spherical round pearls here, naturally coloured. These aren't bleached and dyed. You've got an amazing metallic luster. Can you see mm. that kind of like oil on water? Um, all produced from those amazing, that amazing mollusk. Now, one in the world, one in the world. I'm imagining this sort of knotted maybe with a really beautiful, I don't know, rose gold maybe? Rose gold magnetic clasp That'd be or nice. something like, like that? The, the pinkier side to it, yes, yeah. We're at 2999, which in all honesty is a great price. However... I don't think Ross is going to stay there. No way near, he says. It's, a cl it's the last opportunity. Let's do a close-out deal. How about we remove one of those digits? Should we take the two off the front? So it's just nice, under a thousand yeah. pounds, three figure. That's. I mean, that's amazing. That is amazing. We'll never lose sight of that. Oh, there is only one. I know what digit that's you're moving. Unbelievable. One person in the world will be successful. Previously, this has closed at 399, which is still absolutely awesome. One of you will get hold of this today at that closeout deal. Again, just imagine it, visualize it knotted with silk, visualize mm -hmm. it with, I personally would always go with gold, but that's all personal choice, of course. Um, and then at some point, get it valued and appraised. So many of our lovely audience do do that and uh, are very kind in sharing their valuations um, for people that maybe haven't yet purchased pearls from us here at Jewelry Maker. Um, hello to Candy saying, happy birthday for Sunday, Claire. I'll see you at your birthday workshop. Oh, love Lovely candy. Oh, lovely. oh, can't wait to see you. Oh, Thank you. Birthday Thank workshop. You, yeah. um, hello, Mary in Yorkshire saying happy birthday, Claire. Have a wonderful day. I had my 50th on Saturday. I've just recovered. <laughs> Bless you. Good work, Mary. <laughs> yeah, well, well happy done. Birthday. Mary, doesn't that, it happens, doesn't it? It just takes us longer yes. to get over. Yeah. My brother and I were talking about this yesterday. I was saying, like, I don't know. It's not a case of I don't like alcohol. Alcohol doesn't like me anymore. No, you sort of get to a point, don't you? Where yeah. You have to, you weigh it up, but then you know what, you know what's going to happen. Drink like glass. Mary, you know, you just got to I try and drink glasses of it. wine. Uh, I was going to say glasses of wine in between drinks. <laughs> in between the spirits. <laughs> is that what you did, Mary? That's where I'm going wrong, isn't it? Glass of water, that's what it is. <laughs> that glass of wine in between drinks is not helping. It's not doing the trick. 
<laughs> oh, oh, dear me. Um, this is the last one. I've got Jean there, Suzanne there, and Sorry there. Oh, it's the look last at that. one. I don't have enough for all of you. I'm sorry, ladies. So um, do get it home. Use your 30 day money back guarantee. Hello, Nikki, saying good morning, L, Claire, and Fab JM team. They certainly are. Oh. Happy birthday, Claire. Sending lots of love from our. Oh, Nikki lots and of love back to both of How you. How nice Thank is that? That's Hello, really Nikki, lovely. my darling. Thank you. Four of you are in for this final one. Is there an issue on the website? No? No? Okay, we're all good. Sorry, unfortunately, I only do have one available, so I can't give you the two that you have in your basket. Jean's discussing on the phone lines, as is Suzanne. One of you will be successful. I'll keep oh, you updated gosh. on that one. How amazing, how exciting. Um, and if you miss out on that one, don't worry, I do have another opportunity of pills to bring you as well. Shall we do the selenite? We'll do it in order. So you've got oh, ascending, ascending sizes. Oh, okay. Not uh, descending. Ascending. Oh, I was, I was descending. I, was, I said uh, it wrong. No, I was just saying the opposite. No, I did say it wrong. You were right. Oh, ascending. That was awful because I wasn't trying to correct you then. I was just saying the opposite. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> But you were right to correct me, though, anyways. So I wasn't so. correcting you. <laughs> it's all good. I don't mind if you do, you know. In descending. So I had to think about that. It's way too hard. <laughs> you know, sorry. I don't think my brain's quite with it as of yet. What is selenite? A, it's magical. It, 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 you look at this gemstone, you can see that amazing magical presence about it. Oh, selenite, yeah. let me just read you the, the, a brief history on this beautiful gemstone, because I'm going to assume um, not, not everybody knows about selenite as a gemstone. We don't see it very often when it does, it sells out. Selenite is a specific... <laughs> Specific variety of the mineral gypsum named after the ancient Greek goddess of the moon, Selene. Uh, the Greeks especially appreciated the beauty of selenite, even making windows with the stone. The gemstone received, received its official name uh, from J.G. Valerius in 1747 when he wrote... Mineralogical geo, that, yeah. Gypsum, as a general mineral, has been valued since as far back as the Egyptians, uh, where it was used for decorative purposes. One unique use of selenite is in the Santa Sabina Church in Rome, a large arched window built in the 5th century and made from sheets of selenite, not glass. Uh, after large amounts of gypsum were found near Paris in France, a mineral uh, material sorry, known as Plaster of Paris was created. Plaster of Paris is gypsum that has been chemically altered to extract the water within. It's also uh, said French farmers use raw gypsum as a soil additive. But as a gemstone, stunningly beautiful. And I know loads of people that are particularly into their metaphysical uh, um, beliefs will love this gemstone as well. Selenite is most closely associated with the crown chakra, which represents wisdom and spirituality, as well as the third eye chakra. The colorless beauty and translucency of selenite is often attributed to purity and peace in both metaphysical beliefs and color theory. Where am I? Sorry. Uh, selenite is excellent to use when meditating or trying to achieve mental clarity, as it is believed to compel the person holding it to be honest with themselves. Oh, how lovely. Yes. I didn't know any of that. That's it's, lovely, isn't it? It's, it's, like, it is mesmerising. It is. I didn't know any of that detail. And it's even wonderful. without those beliefs, you might not necessarily think, OK, uh, you know, you can see all of the words that I'm about to mm. say to you now. Mm. Um, because um, healing with selenite, we mention words like serenity, purification, peace, meditation, universal uh, consciousness, Clarity of thought, purity of heart, universal love, integrity, spirituality, uh, psychic development, forgiveness and positive thoughts. You can see all of those lovely attributes, can't you, within this gemstone. It's fascinating because that's not coated. There are tiny microscopic platelets within this gemstone that are giving you that wonderful moon-like mm. chatoyancy in the gemstone. This is the largest of the strand. We're at £49 for a, for a graduation from 8 to 10 millimetres. Roscoe, how many have I got? Because time is ticking. Nine. There's only nine available. And again, let me just show you them all together because if you wanted to create the most beautiful Marla, I think this would be amazing, wouldn't it? Um, I'll bring you the next sizes hereafter. £29.99. Oh, I'm tempted by this strand. 
Oh, it's not even nine no, o'clock in the morning and I'm thinking about shopping. Mm. Because this, I picked up my black jade out by cones the other day. Oh, I think this would be oh, lovely. Yes, yeah. Fabulous monochrome. Yeah, it? love it. Um, okay, let's bring you now the eight millimetres, seven to eight millimetres. What kind of price points can you expect for selenite? Um, well, there's, you know, an elastic bracelet, just simply a stretchy bracelet just here. Six to nine inches. You're talking 29 pounds. Could you make that? Absolutely. Easily, yeah. And, and, and you're going to make at least two of those out of these strands as well, especially if you're going to add some sterling silver components within. We're at 49.99, but you know we're not stopping there. It's, it's, it, look at that. There we go. There's that, that church in Rome that we were talking about that literally has the selenite windows. Look at the glow that you see. It's, it's, it's incredible. Absolutely incredible. There's the selenite windows that we were talking about. Do you notice how it takes on that really lovely bluish like color? £24.99. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. And you can get hold of it today in a beautiful gemstone. Right, last one. Let's bring you now six to seven millimeters in their size now you're going to get today selenite at a price point that we should never ever 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 do um but we're doing it anyway have i got limited quantity of the six to seven millimeters so it's this one here there's about 30 says ross so a Gosh, bit more than that. the other strands it's stunning it's absolutely stunning and and we're looking at it in its worst possible lighting conditions when you see selenite actually outside it literally glows we rarely ever see selenite full stop really um particularly in the rounds how lovely would this be to complement maybe be again uh, against some of your lovely jadeites mm. or some of your lovely pearls or maybe as i said maybe contrast it with something monochrome 19 pounds and 99 pence wasn't it only last year that we launched selenite yes i feel like it's in not, rounds yeah it's not very long no it? we haven't had we had it we didn't have it in strands we had it in those towers didn't we yes things like that yes but we didn't really have it in the strands now we can wear it yeah gorgeous oh <clears throat> Beaded clasps, beaded clasps that we launched the other day. Let me see, let me see. Is it this one? With the pearls? Beaded ones. Are I don't see. Front? Is, it those, is it those at the front? Oh, those. There we go. Thank you. I didn't launch these. Oh, I was going to say. I was going to say, have I, did, did, did I sleep through that show? Oh, I like Oh, these. they're very Van Cleef, aren't they? Are you getting all of them then? Oh, they're lovely. Um, 200 of these flew out on the launch. I've got the final 29 opportunities. Um, like I said, oh, I put them all out on the desk, shall I? You do get all four of them as well. So it's like a lovely little, uh, like a hook class. So uh, they connect against one another. Um, they've got that lovely beaded bezeled edge, very Alhambra-esque, don't you think? These are really not, wow, that's brilliant. Look at the gram weight there, 4.886 grams. That's five pound per, uh, per pair. We're gonna take the entire set under 10 pounds. I've got the final how many? 29 left. Yeah, these were launched with our, um, with our lovely Vix Saturday just gone. Um, these are like lovely earrings as well, aren't they? You could, Cause you've got all, all nice pendants in there too, if you wanted to split them. Yeah. You could absolutely wear them that, as individual pendants. Work. It's lovely, isn't it? Yeah. And they're going to be so much easier to actually put on. Um, yes. Yeah. Than say a bolt ring clasp or something like that, because literally you've just got to hook that mechanism into place and then let gravity do its thing to hold your jewellery. We've got the final, well, under 30 remaining. I've, I've said the price promise, guaranteed today, lovely jewellery makers, under, um, under £10. That's a lot of sterling silver for a single figure price tag. I can't use those tweezers. They're, hang on, let me have a little look in these. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Found them there. They had they they were a bit they were a bit chunky yeah, those trees are so better, aren't that's they? better yeah, isn't it? End. There we are. These are you are ready? Lovely. Beautiful detailing, oxidised as well to really make that sterling silver pop. Wow! <gasps> Wonderful. Wait, that's two pound fifty each. That is because I love seeing. It's lovely to have, isn't it? You know, the one uh, class that have got gemstones in and really, really ornate. I really like these. That is that. Is that quite a simple beaded detail? Yeah, that simplicity. Yeah. And that's how they would go. I would personally close that over a little bit. There you yeah. go. Just like that. 
I mean, how lovely is that going to be in That's really bracelets nice. and necklaces? Yes, yeah, both. Or as you said, maybe customising them in a pair of earrings as well. These flew out on the launch on Saturday. You have the last remaining quantity, £2.50 for a sterling silver class. How awesome is that? Um, but expect them to be a sellout to, on today's show. You have literally until the top of the hour or more realistically until uh, stocks last because there's a lot of you there. Good morning, Northumberland. Helen, Isabel, Christina, Lincolnshire, Dorothy, Jacqueline Maker and New uh, West Midland, Susan, Janice, Christine, Denise, Tracy, Neil and Linda, Amanda and Tracy. There's a load of you there. Um, and people are multi buying as well. So 29 does not hang around, does it, Claire? It doesn't, no. Doesn't it hang doesn't. around. These are really nice. How really lovely nice. would they be alongside maybe your blue lace calcedony? Really, really nice. Blue lovely. lace, sorry, yeah. your blue calcedony. Yeah, really nice. Um, two left of the bangle. What bangle? Oh, the old mech. Are we doing that? Oh, amazing. Um, we're going to be bringing that to air now. Less than 10 remaining of this beautiful sterling silver uh, bundle. And you're getting four of what I'm actually holding within the tweezers. Just 30 minutes to make your confirmations, not just with this, but on every item that we are bringing you in the eight o'clock hour. Now, two. That's it. Two in existence. Olmec blue jadeite bangles. Once those are gone, they are completely gone and it would be very complacent of us to assume that we could get it again. Um, it comes, it does come beautifully boxed as you would expect something of this rarity. Oh it's a solid, you, you should have one. I this. love this. Birthday treat for yourself. Treat yourself. Because look, I mean, look at how beautiful that blue is. Um, I say that because, Claire, you've got the old Mech Jadeite uh, have. ring, haven't you? I have, yes. Oh, and a stretchy. And I've got a stretchy nice. Very nice. Very nice. Look at you all decked out in your old Mech Jadeite. I know. Um, lucky you. Totally and utterly natural. Now, the rarity of a bangle, we normally associate to uh, to Burmese jade. Um, and real, real, in all honesty, that's because we haven't really got a comparison for your Guatemalan jade. It's not often seen in your bangles from that location. Um, this would have been carved in China because obviously that's where the master carvers are. But the challenge with the bangle is, 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 is extremely high. Um, you know, the loss is gigantic. So they lose a lot of the jadeite tr whilst trying to carve a bangle because you've got to remember you've got to you've got to cut all this area out in the center by hand. Even if we were to stop at £1,499, that would be amazing. It is nowhere near the price point though. We are going to take it into three figures. Just two of you will be successful or one if you're actually multi-buying. Um, in the world, we've only ever had 25. So just consider that for a second. And you are one of 25 or less people that actually own this old Mech Jadeite bangle. You know, when Louis Vuitton do limited edition, they don't do those numbers. No. You know, um, this is so, so, so rare. And that, I don't know how many people in the world have got Guatemalan Jadeite bangles. Probably very, very, very few. Today, you can get hold of it for 799 or alternatively uh, use your 0% interest split payment, £199.75. I can see you on the phone line, Maker. I can see you there on, uh, with it in your basket on the app. Sorry. Um, there is enough to already be a sellout. Definitely definitely worth um, having this valued and appraised at some point. Um, it's natural, beautiful blue colour. It comes solely from Mother it's Nature. Just, it's just treasure, isn't it? Don't it you is. Think? It's like, a, I love the story behind it. I mean, the fact that it's stunningly beautiful as well, the glow on it, the colour, everything. And then you think about the skill involved in, in, in making that. I just, I do, I always see them as that, that is a, it's a, it's a, you know, you're basically wearing art, aren't you? It's like a sculpture. Art, theme. absolutely, absolutely. Gorgeous. I'm going to leave that with you. Good luck to you all. Um, I, I get it's a considered purchase, however, not for what you're getting, truly. Um, okay, I've got the last available opportunity of your beautiful goddess of mercy, the Guan Ying. Again, this is literally hand carved. You said the word earlier on. This is artistry at its mm. finest. Mm. Look at the quality of the jadeite. But then we should expect that quality of jadeite when you have such skillful, uh, skillful carving. This is literally done by hand in an abrasive manner, the same technique and way that was done literally uh, hundreds of years ago. Um, we launched this on Friday with Dave and it completely sold out for whatever reason for whatever reason two fell back into stock it's too special to have within our vaults hence why we're including it in um, in 
in today's show. We did notice it's not just the goddess of mercy, it's also the Ouroboros too. Oh, yes. Um, right. yeah. yeah, literally oh, yes. around the outside. Can you see? The, the Ouroboros, by the way, is a, a serpent-like creature that eats, is eating its own tail. Um, it's basically uh, reminiscent um, of the circle of life. Um, you know, oh, so much life, meaning, death, isn't rebirth, there? And, yeah. And symbolism in, in one piece, <laughs> that's incredible. It's just absolutely, the detail in this piece is amazing. We are going to match the launch price that we brought to you on Friday. There are only two left. That speaks volumes, doesn't it? And this is one of those pieces that literally could potentially be gone um, in a matter of a week. £149. I know our graphics don't say it, but you've actually got lavender colours in here. Um, you can see that beautiful wet light translucency. That's the quality that you are looking for when it comes to your beautiful jade eye and all hand carved by the most skillful uh, um, artists in the world. I mean, the, uh, yeah, it's, it's miraculous. No two will look exactly the same if you are, if you, if you are looking at um, the one in my hands and the one on the recording. That's because they're natural. You know, if they did look exactly the same, A, you would say they're not hand carved. Um, and secondly, you would definitely uh, question whether they're impregnated with a dye. I've got one one left, one remaining opportunity launched on Friday. Good morning, Richard. Hello, lovely. I hope you're well. There was only 47 ever carved in the whole world. So we are talking about extreme rarity. So work of art is 100% is 100 the term uh, to use with that. I'll leave that last one with you. Amazing. I do have the Guatemala. Oh, Claire McDonald. You made a stretchy bracelet out of this, did you? 10 millimeter rounds. Oh, oh. I'll tell you what, we'll do the strand straight afterwards. Sorry, put it away, Claire. Because <laughs> these are quite limited. Sorry, Claire. That's okay. But you could absolutely put these in alongside, you know, you've got some really lovely kits coming up a bit later They'd be on. Perfect, wouldn't they? Perfect if you Ooh, just wanted look one at those. pop of Guatemalan jade. Look at that colour. You know, if you were to look, uh, imagine textbook Guatemalan jade old neck blue, it's what's on your screens right now. So Uber exclusive. What was that, Roscoe? Sorry. We've always launched these at the price on your screens. These are 10 mil in their size. Claire, for your birthday, yes. can you use you as an excuse? Oh, yes, please. Righto. Yeah. Should yeah, we do an extra special birthday deal? Shall we? The lowest ever price is happening in 60 seconds. They should be 149. Should be. Massive deal, says Ooh, Ross, or like that. Sound that sounds it, yeah. exciting, doesn't it? Yeah, when my, uh, uh, Ross, when Ross starts going, oh, yeah, massive deal. <laughs> you know it's going to be exciting. Um, well done to those of you that have already made their confirmation. Sorry, Roscoe, how many did you say we had? Seven. Oh, you're going to need to be so quick. It's, it's all really exclusive, isn't it? It's a... I suppose it's going to be, isn't yeah, it? It's yeah, going to be with Guatemala yeah. and Jay. Can yeah. you pass that lovely bangle that you had all those lovely little charms? Yes, yeah. Because I'm just imagining maybe some of the uh, some of these actually suspended from that, or maybe even oh, wow. on it. Yes, yeah. How nice would it be on <gasps> it? Yeah, how lovely. Through the drill hole. You could, you could leave one area of the sterling silver wire yeah. not textured, so yeah. it goes through the actual drill hole itself. Beautiful, yeah. How nice would that be? Oh, that's lovely, isn't it, with the sterling silver? It's a one-time deal, and you've got 23 minutes at this price point. Remember, they've always closed at 149. Massive deal. Oh, it is. It is. Oh, it is. It's half price, pretty oh, much, wow. isn't it? Goodness me, Elaine straight on in there. Well done, Elaine. Uh, sorry you're there as well. New customers on the phone line. I only had seven. Only had seven. Oh, these could be the earrings to your mm. suite of jewellery that's building that very nice. nicely. It is, isn't it? In fact, there's the necklace and there's the pair of earrings, Claire. Yeah. Perfect for your suite oh, of jewellery. Yes, your yeah. treasure, as you call it. My treasure. It. The it lost is. treasure of what? I, I just, I love the story. It's a, I love it. 450 years this gemstone lay. I lost, know, yes. literally lost. Yes. We knew its existence, but we didn't know where it was. That's fascinating. And you can look at your Guatemalan jade and think, oh my goodness, this, this gem literally inspired, well, well, it's, it's 
founders, though the rediscoverers, literally uh, inspired Indiana Jones as a, uh, as a character. Fascinating. Um, and it has been displayed in the Smithsonian Museum for uh, many years for its amazing enigmatic beauty. Shall we do that strand? I kind of teased you with it, not intentionally, but I did. Um, in fact, Claire, there we go. Let's have a little look at your beautiful bracelet. Oh, my word. That's lovely, Claire. Isn't it beautiful? You've, oh, you've got like a little heart locket on there. I've got something special on there. I'm road testing it. Are you? Yeah, keep your eye out. Is that mm. some coming soon? Do you know what that reminds it me is. of? You know when you see the padlocks on... Um, on the, yes, yeah. Yeah. Am I along the right lines, maybe? Yeah. Am I thinking something towards Valentine's Day? Uh, yeah, sort of around then, yes. Maybe? Yeah. Ooh, lovely. Yeah. Well, if you want to recreate Claire's beautiful bracelet, here's the strand to do it. You've got literally 120 carats here of wonderful natural blue old me oh my goodness me do you know sometimes words aren't necessary when you look mm. at when you look at this uh, gemstone up close and personal you can appreciate all the qualities that we aspire to when it comes to jadeite has it got translucency absolutely has it got intensity of color absolutely has it got a fine texture definitely otherwise you wouldn't see that lovely luster we're going to do this in one price crash because we've only got four six of you Seven of you, eight of you have got it in your baskets on the web. I'm intrigued. Wow, that's very low. They're big. They're it's amazing, big. isn't it? You're talking about 10 mil sizes. And it, it, it's a, I don't know, it just has, it has something, it has really, really does have something about it as a glow like nothing else. I think it's a colour and then the glow. Yeah, there's literally two gemstones that I can think of that have this, this kind of colour and appearance. And that's Grandidurite mm -hmm. and I'll make Jadeite. And if this were Grandidurite, you'd be talking it's, it's, about... Uh, that's fortune. it. You would never get... It, not in this size, no, isn't it? No, no. And it's lo uh, this, is, this is lovely to wear. Absolutely lovely to wear. Beautiful. I've got two... Oh, one. One of them left. Who's going to get that last one? I'll leave it with you because time is ticking. You've got, what, 19 minutes to make your confirmations. Uh, I, this is the strand I own. I bought this one a while back, a couple of, um, I recognised it straight away, the quality of this strand is insane. Um, and I said it, and this is why I've been completely honest and said, look, look, um, these, are the be these are the best pills I've ever seen. And I still stand by that statement. They are the best pills I have ever seen. Um, I have this, and eventually, I've bought the clasp, eventually I will knot it. Um, or maybe ask someone who's a bit better than I am to do it. And I will take it to a jeweler's to get valued and appraised. Do you see where Look I'm coming those. from, Claire? They are yeah. the best pearls I've ever seen. Yeah. Perfectly spherical, totally natural, flawless in their nacre. Um, we're going to go straight down to the best price that we can possibly offer on these. They're beautiful. I have this strand myself. Yeah, that's less than I paid. That's amazing. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. I mean, they're almost golden, aren't they? Yeah. I'll, I'll come golden. and knot those with you. They, they'd be a joy to knot. They'd be absolutely, aren't yeah. They? And the, can you imagine the piece of jewellery when you finish? If I if I feed you and yeah. give you yeah. wine, <laughs> yeah. I'm or there. Bacardi, because clearly you like <laughs> Bacardi. <laughs> yeah. Um, would you? <laughs> I absolutely would. It'd be. It'd be. That would be a wonderful Have you ever to seen work? pearls no, like this no, before? They are there is only one, and this is the one that you will be getting, jewellery makers. £699. Sorry, you can do this, my lovely. Um, imagine it. Visualise it with silk. Imagine yeah. it with... And I personally, personally believe it should go on to gold mm. because of the grade of the pearls. Mm. You know, it would be almost a shame to put them with sterling silver. No disrespect to that precious metal intended. And I get it costs more money. Go on your auction sites. Use the places like eBay and places like that to get a vintage class. Have it valued. I encourage you. And I know, again, it costs money. Um, much like, listen, I'm the same. I have, to consider, I have to wait to buy the class. I have to wait to get something valued because you know um, it's a considered amount of money but it's so worth it because again I've worked with pearls since I was in my 20s and I've never seen pearls mm, like that yeah, well amazing. done well done well done well done um, have I got what sorry a reel of chain I certainly do Ooh, wonderful oh this would be lovely with your uh, with your with your kits good, yeah absolutely it will these are a few of your favorite they definitely things. are yes they are look at that luster Claire 
Oh, why cards. would we buy sterling silver on a spoon? Because you, so you, you can choose the length then, can't you? You can determine whatever you're going to do with it. So, um, you know, if you decide that maybe, you know, some of the love, like the larger pearls, you might want one of those on a long line necklace. Nice. You might want to uh, layer up. Um, you know, if you're, if you've got, uh, you're doing a commission maybe for somebody who's particularly petite, you, yeah. you might need to do something a lot shorter than the, than the average length. And it just gives you that, you can decide, can't you? Absolutely. I mean, if you go into any um, jewellery workshop, they'll have chains more than likely mm. on the spool rather yeah. than by yeah. um, already complete. Um, because you can customise them for sure. And they, I'm noticing, Claire, because these are diamond cut cable chains, you've got that nice um, area for you to attach maybe your shepherd hooks um, or your jump rings or solder directly onto. Absolutely. You don't have to solder, though, is my no, point. No, no, not at all. I'm just thinking with all the, the solderable accent, accents coming up, I mean, can you imagine you could just do make yourself little pendants so I put them on the on the bangle you could do individual oh, lovely. charm pendants uh, um, you know and pop them on there lovely absolutely beautiful anklets as well yes Great anklets. Anklets. yeah yeah um, available for 15 minutes lovely jewelry makers make sure you do check them out um, I'm gonna bring you again a pair of earrings that I have I very nearly wore to that event on uh, last uh, oh, on Friday you look just like gone. a princess thank you you look thank so you. beautiful do you have a lovely time it was lovely yes tiring I bet. It's an intense. It's just really intense. Yeah. Um, I was a little bit out of my comfort zone. Well, you, you didn't. A you, little bit. You hid it well because you Bless looked you. like that was exactly where you should be. You look beautiful. But I love these and they would have, wouldn't have looked out of place no. um, at such well, an sparkle. event. But at the same time, Claire, imagine those with a pair of jeans and a, and a mm. shirt or something like that. Just so cool. Um, so these are inspired by the amazing designer, two sisters um, who are half Sicilian, um, half Brummy. Um, and it's got quite the celebrity following, the likes of Her Royal Highness the Princess of Wales is a big fan of Suru. Um, these are actually very, very similar to the ones that I have in, in front of me. You've got a beautiful Biwa pearl and they're surrounded by these, love, bejeweled if you like, by mm. these beautiful crystals. I love these earrings. I know Carol loves them as well. I know you love them, Claire, mm. because you can wear them to so many different, um, so many different sort of occasions, I think, in styles. They go to an amazing jewelry make a price tag now if you wanted her royal highness's uh earrings you can get those you can get them um off not her you can't take hers probably that's not a good idea <laughs> a bit rude. um but you could buy them if you like from the um from suru themselves they'll cost 145 pounds isn't it lovely to see the royalty wearing sort of more accessible jewelry yes yeah um, you say that, you say that, that £145, still a lot of money. But if you shop with us here at Jewelry Maker, they're not even £40. We're not even stopping at £39.99. They are so lovely, these earrings, and they're beautifully finished. The back is stunning it's as well. So good, isn't it? I mean, costume jewellery prices, that is. That's a genuine yeah. pearl that yeah. you've got in there. It's the final few of these remaining, though. Good morning, Alice. I hope you're well. I think that, is that Alice? Our Alice. Oh, we don't know, is it? Oh, I hope so. I hope so. We love as well. Alice. We love you, Alice. We miss yeah. you, Alice. Yeah. Um, if uh, right now there's an Alice going. <laughs> <laughs> But we love you as well. Um, Maker, well done. Maria, you're there as well. I don't know if Carol's bought these earrings, but she needs to do it sooner rather than later if mm. she hasn't. They are so gorgeous. Um, I just, uh, uh, yeah. I'm not generally speaking a silver wearer. I prefer the gold colours, but I just couldn't miss out on these. Make sure you do check out. They're available for, what's that, 13 minutes now until um, or until they sell out. Well done. Okay, are you ready for the most fantastic early bird? Um, not one. Not two, but three beautiful pastel feminine pinks mm. in the finest quality amethyst. This is perfect for our lovely Claire's birthday show. They are You've been shopping ahead and pre-ordering on these. They are sheer perfection. The look of a kunzite in another amazing gemstone. Up next is your early bird. <laughs> going to put this white piece of paper behind because then you can really appreciate the quality oh, of these colors <gasps> two sibling gems now I'm going to start with the green but oh, you can wow. shop ahead and pre-order on your pink oh, they are gosh. items number one and two 
and they are both going lower than what is on your website. I mean, consider that though, that's £10 each, if, even if we were to Amazing. stop here. How unbelievable mm. is that? But let's start with your beautiful Praiserlite because Praiserlite is a, a, a variety of amethyst that has this really beautiful, soft spearmint green. It's a type two gemstone. So the reality is when it comes to Praiserlite, you should actually expect inclusions. Uh, <clears throat> you should actually expect inclusions. And yet here we are looking at a trio of, of, of pure eye clean yeah, natural absolutely. Yeah. stones. Yeah. We rarely ever get it. When we do, it always flies out the door. It's got this really lovely, fresh, uh, 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 a, a minty green, isn't it? But like almost mm -hmm. like a silvery light presence. Take a little look at this recording because you have got the most beautiful, flawless clarity. You know, at every single facet, I'm not seeing any haziness. I'm not seeing any black inclusions. I'm not seeing uh, um, any windowing within each and every single one of these. I mean, Claire, one of those with your bezel strip, say, mm -hmm. um, is the most incredible statement ring. It'd be gorgeous, wouldn't it? Absolutely gorgeous, yeah. And you could do your prong setting as well with wire work. And I, I think with, with you know stones at that size, you know, they're, sometimes it can be a bit right. intimidating if it's the teeny weeny ones. These are really workable, aren't they? Yeah. You know, so it's a wonderful, look at that. Ah, <gasps> I, oh, I could never. I can't believe we're going lower than 29.99. What a collection. That's 10 pound per stone. And they are going lower. On the next price crash, I'm gonna tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna half it. We're gonna half it. That means these are now, five pounds per beautiful, genuine praiser light. I'm gonna just grab one of these on a pair of tweezers so you can imagine it, I feel like, as a um, a finished piece mm. uh, a finished piece of jewelry. I mean, this is the stuff of dreams, isn't it, Claire? Yes, um, it is, yeah. If, ever, if, and it is if, if we ever had praiser light on our sister channel when I used to pre present on there on a regular basis, um, it would be maybe in a showcase, <clears throat> they would always absolutely fly out because, you know, straight away, 29.99 just for that one stone is absolutely incredible, isn't it? But you don't just get the one, you're getting all three. Look how beautiful. Look at that. You know, it doesn't get any better than that, does it? doesn't get any better than what's on your screens right now. I will move that little pl plastic container. Sorry, that's my, my, my fault. Five pounds each. I'm all over these. I love it. I think it's absolutely beautiful. It's glistening and you've got this really soft, subtle, almost uh, Pareba tourmaline, isn't it's wonderful. it? wonderful. Almost Pareba tourmaline. Look at like the green. gold as well, Al. How lovely that looks. Beautiful. It looks expensive, doesn't mm, it? And yeah. perhaps it should be expensive. We are talking about a rare Mother Nature gemstone. We are going lower. How many do we have of these, Roscoe? We've only got 50 of your praise like green amethyst. It's always very limited. Um, and again, we should expect there to be inclusions when it comes to praise light. It's a type two gemstone, so it should have like a haziness, a bit like your emeralds, I guess. You know, we expect Le Jardin in the emeralds. We should actually expect it in this stone. And yet here we are looking at three stones of perfection. In four seconds, it's going even lower. I can't believe I'm saying that out loud, but it is happening. I had 50 available opportunities. Would you team these along Side, those beautiful pink amethysts that yes. are coming up on the back of the uh, of this opportunity yeah most It'd be definitely lovely, wouldn't they yeah oh it's an incredible price mad. isn't it absolutely incredible and i just think i think with these you know this is a this is great for if even if you, you don't want to do anything with them you just want to have them as you know in a collection but if you do make you know the fact that they're uniform sizes so yeah. if you do commissions or you need to do a suite and or you know so if, if you made a piece of jewelry and somebody said I, I love that can you recreate it you've got the same sizes exactly. over and over again which is really really useful. and we don't get that luxury all the time no, we do don't we? because often no. we bring parcels yeah which are lovely and you know when you get that assorted size and that's really interesting as well but if you need to know the size and you want to replicate something for example if you are doing a setting and you want to make them you know you're measuring out this is ideal for that isn't it but just to have, they are just beautiful, beautiful. I don't know, know if I'd be able stone. to part with these though. They're kind no, of, I know. This, is, this yeah. is the kind of gemstone that I would wear. But that's why you'd have to basis. get two, isn't it? You'd get two packs. So wait, we're talking then... about how much each? Four pounds? Some, just over four pounds per praise light. Well, you, if you sold one, you'd make, if, if you multi-bought, you, you'd, you'd make your money back, couldn't you? On, you've got two packs of them. 
Yeah, yeah, because you wouldn't sell one you at twelve ninety nine, would not, you? Absolutely not. No way. Just because we no offer way. them to you at this price point doesn't mean that you have to pass them on at that same price. Um, again, totally natural, beautiful quality, eye clean, uh, green amethyst, twelve pounds and ninety nine pence. Well done, Yvette. Hello to you, Andrea, Wendy, Maker, Essex, Richard. Hello to you, Susan, uh, London, Malcolm. I can see you there. Make sure you check out. You've got six minutes. Where's this morning gone? Goodness me time is flying by time is absolutely flying by um okay oh, oh. how quickly do you think these are going to sell out um i've got how many two four nine and i guess it should we shouldn't be surprised that jem buyer has just stepped in the gallery these. he's got to be precious about these oh <gasps> clear look oh my gosh oh look Oh my oh, wow. goodness. Mm. Hand selected from India, says Wayne in the, ga oh, the gallery. You've done an amazing you know, job, I, Wayne. I just said, Wayne, I, it, I guess it's not a coincidence that you've stepped into the studio with something like this. I would be precious about these as well. I mean, oh, look. Oh, does that look? A single penny. Oh, that, 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 is, that is perfection, isn't it? A single penny lower than thousands of pounds. <gasps> look, look, look. How beautiful. That romantic, soft... It's, it's not quite Rose de France, where you've got this really beautiful, delicate pink colour, often one of the most favoured colours of your amethyst. So beautiful, so feminine, and you get all three in a cushion cut. These aren't small stones. We're talking about, in terms of calibrations, what are the sizes, Ross? 12 mil. I'm just going to give that one a little bit of a, po uh, a polish because actually I've noticed my big fingerprint on there. Um, so that's not ideal. I've got... Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Here you go. Oh, my word, Claire. Look at the quality of these Trying stones. so hard not to resist. Not to, not to just snatch them all away. Look uh, at that. But, you, but you've got the perfect <gasps> components for these, haven't you, today? We're at £10 per oh, cushion. Wow. They are, I mean, just shy of five carats each. They're big statement solitaires. Immediately, we've got people multi-buying. Um, I don't know what I'm thinking of. You know, uh, Rachel, who works on our sister channel, she's just launched a pair, um, a, pair uh, a collection, um, some lovely earrings, um, and they all had kind of cushion-cut stones. I don't believe she had pink amethyst in that collection, although she, I'm sure she would have definitely wanted to. Um, teaming alongside maybe some of your natural colored pearls or with mm. the bezel strip that Claire's going to be yeah, talking about yeah. and showing showcasing um showing you within her kit hours even if if i'm trying to give you as many hints as i possibly can we were to stop here it would be absolutely incredible but lovely jewelry makers we've got four minutes three minutes now it's just ticked over on this hour um we are not Aww. stopping there we're at five pounds per just shy of five carats each that's, That's unbelievable. And knowing that your each individual solitaire, Claire, which, of course, you get three of, mm. has been hand-selected by... Has he, has he gone? I'll say it now, then. Actually, one of the best gem buyers that I've ever worked with. Ah. Truly, 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 truly. Hand-selected. Look at those. I could do a few more price crashes. I can't believe I'm saying that out loud. But... We're not going to mess around on this one. We're going to do a 60 second clock. And at the end of that minute, I'm going to say it out loud. They're going under 10 pounds, oh. under 10 pounds. This is where if you want to get into gemstone setting, then get them now. Um, if you are thinking, oh, gosh, they're so beautiful, but I can't. Yeah, I don't know how to work with them as of yet. You could be bezel these, couldn't you? Yes. Yeah, you could yeah. use them in your calibrated mounts. Absolutely. Claire has the kits coming up within today's show to teach you how to create the most beautiful, beautiful cocktail rings. I've got 232 opportunities. They are all going to sell out. I buy loose stones and just keep them. I just keep yes, them. Yes, because they're lovely. They're lovely to just have and to look at. Because I know that oh. when, you know, when, when, when I'm gone 
I can just visualise it now. My two girls going, oh, tre literally treasure. Yeah, treasure. All these beautiful loose cut stones. And they don't know that I'm going to be paying less than £10. That's £3.33 pence per pink amethyst. February's birthstone. So literally, we're almost in February, aren't we? Today, and today only. This is madness. Absolute madness. Oh, I said that out loud, Ross, didn't I? It is done. That's Five incredible. Five carats almost for 3.33. Can you believe that, Claire? How beautiful. I know. Yeah, see that again. Oh, look at that. It would be, do you know, that's engagement ring worthy. I can yeah. imagine that on the hand of a celebrity. Yes. Can't yeah. you? Yeah. How beautiful is that? You know, just a classic prong Tiffany S setting, maybe with some accent stones with your bezel strip. I think would be yeah. Beautiful. And I and I have I've, I've bezel um, I've used a bezel strip on faceted stones before, and it, I I really like it. it works okay. really well, really well. It's lovely, and That's at that okay. size, it'd be great to do. You've also got the practical side of things because obviously this is quite a large stone. Bezel strip will actually protect it too. Mm. Um, yeah. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. But if like me, you're literally purchasing with I don't I don't know what I would do with mine. I'd probably just keep it, just literally keep mm. it the quality that it is. And one day maybe um, um, look at actually say gemstone setting. But even if it did sit in my in my stash, that literally is treasure of the finest quality. So many of you there all around the world getting involved. We had over 200 of these and they're absolutely flying out the door. And um, that beautiful romantic pink. That's the thing. It's not a candy floss pink, is it? Um, it's, it, it is a, a very feminine Kunzai S pink. Um, we've got one more deal that we're going to try and squeeze in within this hour before we literally remove every single item. So it's given you an extra couple of minutes to secure yours. If you've pressed your option one on the phone, you're all good. Don't worry. We can definitely guarantee you one. If you're looking for multiples, that's where the challenge actually comes into play. If it's in your baskets, though, not guaranteed to you. I'm going to leave it with you. Um, yeah, oh, sorry, it's got my got oh, hand cream on that one. Um, should we do another under £10 deal? Oh, yes. Even though... No. You've got a huge parcel. Now, what we're going to do... We're going to do 60 seconds to drop to your price. You know it's going under 10 This is your opportunity. And then we're going to do a second clock to end the show. show. Oh, <clears throat> so in one minute, this is going under 10 pounds. Oh my word. Yes. And then you have a minute to get hold of it. You've got beautiful oh, black root up. You've got your sargonetic <gasps> strawberry quartz. You've got beautiful amethyst, citrines, garnets, a real selection, a wonderful collection of stones. I can see sapphires, I can see topaz, I can see serenite, rutile quartz. Um, Hessonite garnet, the quality of these stones are impeccable. I know that you've seen um, some lovely gem setting with Claire in the past. You could do tube sets, couldn't you? Yes, tube setting would be ideal, wouldn't it? Because they're, they're all round, so varying sizes. Well, you take. Go on. I was thinking of the little lockets as well. Oh. I mean, they'd be beautiful there, wouldn't they? With that, that you know, because you've got the assortment of gems. But definitely tube setting, yes. It inset into pearls. I was going to say that was you did that on our last show together, didn't you? Yes, yeah. So it, these would yes. be perfect to yes, go into would. your pearls. They would. Um, something like this oh, that's coming yes. up at nine o'clock. Can you imagine setting? one of those coloured stones, oh, well, all of them, to be fair, you can yes. set them in all of them. Yeah. Um, how unbelievable. These are coming up alongside two beautiful strands, literally on the other side of the break. Are you ready? Under £10, as promised. And then you've got 60 seconds to make your confirmations. So that's not just for this item. That's for every item that we have brought oh, you gosh. so far this morning. Eek! You've got to go, yeah, you've got to be quick. Yeah, you got to look at those quick. colours, Al. <gasps> Unbelievable. Abs One of those stones at 9 99 I think, is yeah. absolutely yeah. awesome. You know, you can get those beautiful pink amethysts and this parcel of multicolored gemstones for under 20 quid. That's incredible, isn't it? It is. And there's still so much more to bring you. If you, um, if you love the idea of working with your precious metals, we've got the perfect lady who happens to be a birthday girl today as well to, sh to walk you and talk you through um, all of your amazing techniques. Make sure you check out for not just this item, every item that we have brought you thus far this morning. They are only available until this clock literally runs out. Remember, you've got those beautiful curls, uh, curls pearls coming up just after uh, this very short break. 
don't go anywhere, Claire, and I'm back after this. Check out! Oh. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. It's a new year, so that can only mean one thing. It's time for those new year resolutions. And it's the perfect time to start a new hobby. Jewelry Maker, Sewing Street and Hobby Maker are here whether you're starting something new or advancing your skills on a current hobby. With all the tools you need to start, as well as expert demonstrations from our great guests. Are you starting a new hobby this January? Share your new makes with us by tagging Jewelry Maker, Hobby Maker or Sewing Street using the hashtag New Year New Hobby. And watch us every day from 8am to 1pm on Jewelry Maker. On Hobby Maker, 6 to 8am and 1 to 6pm. And 8am to 1pm on Sewing Street. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, this coming Wednesday, it's Claire McDonald's birthday show make sure you tune in for what will be an absolutely amazing five hours of treats we have a mega bundle of soldable accents and gem setting bracelet kits your deal of the day is the beautiful blue chalcedony plus anybody who buys during the show is in with a chance of winning a goodie bag worth over a hundred pounds so make sure you tune in join the celebrations for claire's birthday is a fan of pearls. Claire, it, it still is the gemstone that I buy the most here at Jewelry yeah, Maker. Yeah, they probably has been the case for me, um, probably five years, mm, if not they more, are stunning. if not more. Um, and I know I say it every single time, so do forgive me, but I think it's one of our greatest strengths here at Jewelry Maker, our pearl buying. The, the quality of the pearls that you get here at Jewelry Maker, please know, that what we show on the graphics in terms of the price point is not reflective of the true value or worth. Not at all. You know, uh, and I try as best I can. I can only ever share with you my own personal experiences. You know, I, I'm not qualified to, play, to value items. Um, however, I have worked in the industry for 24 years. And 24 years, goodness me, where did that time go? Um, 
pearls being really one of my greatest passions. And I can only share with you the price points that I've experienced throughout those, uh, those years. And I can tell you what you're about to see are considered, genuinely are considered. And that strand, for example, that I was talking a few moments, uh, uh, a couple of minutes ago, you know, that would have been tens of thousands of pounds in the jewellers that I worked at. I know it's very different and we've got different platforms to what your average uh, sort of retailer or jeweller has actually got. And that's fine and you price that accordingly. But as long as it's not, what my point is, as long as it's not what we offer, you know, that that's beyond wholesale in most cases. This is irreplaceable for us to buy at what you're about to see on your graphics. Now, just before I get into the auction, everything from Claire's amazing kits are on pre-order, so you can actually shop ahead and take a little look at those. Um, also, anybody who buys today from nine o'clock onwards is in with a chance of winning Claire's birthday goodie bag. Ooh. Yeah, so you don't get it. Oh. <laughs> oh. One of our lovely, one of our lovely. Oh, okay then. Get it then. Okay. And that's worth in excess of a hundred pounds. How amazing oh. is that? Oh, there we go. There you go. So, Brilliant. And there's no, uh, to my knowledge anyway, there's no price limit. Anybody that literally shops between now and the top of the show is in with a chance of winning. When are we announcing that winner, Roscoe? We'll find out. Um, maybe the end of the show might even be tomorrow. We will let you know. We'll get confirmation from the team. Um, what, do you know what's in your goodie I bag? I don't know. I don't know. Lots of goodies. I would think so. Yeah. yeah. To be fair, our goodies are pretty... They are good. Goodie bags are good, yeah. aren't they? Yeah, yeah. Um, anyway, okay, let's talk about beautiful pearls. Now, um, once upon a time, pearls were, of course, formed completely naturally without any culturing process, and they were literally one of the most expensive gemstones on the planet. Because as you can imagine, you've got to literally free dive and sort of scour the Earth's bed, uh, sorry, the, 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 the ocean's bed, to see if you can find an oyster that has a pearl within. And that obviously, that didn't happen very often. Mikimoto developed a technique, though, where we cultured pearls, uh, farming them effectively, um, where the process was initiated. Now, that's wonderful. And, of course, you can get salt water in your South Sea, your Tahitian and your Akoya pearls. And you can also get freshwater pearls. Um, freshwater pearls, gone are the days where they're, you know, all of a sudden you kind of look at them as almost like a, a lesser a, a, a lesser quality pearl because in actual fact freshwater pearls are uh, revolutionizing the pearl harvest at the uh, pearl market at the moment so for example you can very difficult to do you can hybrid certain mollusks to produce a certain color of pearls it's not guaranteed it's not a specific science but you can hybrid pearls however Every so often, every once in a blue moon, um, the mollusk will almost push the pearl that is within um, to the circumference of its shell. When that happens, um, all of a sudden that pearl doesn't take on the sort of normal, more, more usual pure white color. It takes on the darker colors of, uh, of the rim, if you like, of the mollusk itself. Here's a prime example of that actually happening. And this was in the headlines, everyday clam open to reveal rare purple pearls. So yeah, I mean, how amazing mm. is that? That it was literally, that was found purely by chance, not within, uh, <clears throat> not within a pearl harvest. But that color itself, do you notice if it had been maybe, I don't know, a couple of millimeters to the right, it would have been a white pearl. It's crazy, isn't it, when you think about it, that the chance there. The chances. Yeah, yeah. And, and, and when we're harvesting, we can't say, right, I want the pearl to form there. It, it, we can't yeah. do that. Um, you just have to hope, I guess, that something like this happens. So naturally colored pearls like this are astonishingly rare and an anomaly of nature. And we spoke to, our, we've shared this with you before, this actually was, I think, about a year or so ago that the, the, they sent us this message. Some of our pearl suppliers um, who started offer us, offering us natural pearls, we've gone back to them, and obviously we want more. We always do. It's jewellery maker. Um, and this was their reply. To replace pearls like this in the current climate isn't impossible, but it is very expensive. Strands of this grade are likely to retail around $10,000 today. Next year, we could be looking at double that with the way the farms have been affected. We're talking about affected from COVID. 
There isn't many strands right now in the world as it's more valuable to sell them as singles at this size. We won't be able to offer anything like this for maybe five years and even then it wouldn't be financially viable. Why do you think our pearl suppliers are being so closed, I guess, in that conversation? Well, they lost the majority of the pearls during the pandemic because the harvesters couldn't get out. So they literally were washed to the sea. Um, so that's why they're saying five to 10 years to actually to culture them, to mature the mollusks themselves. It's not something that happens overnight. We're taking these to Hong Kong, not just for the Asian market, but there's a huge demand from the West um, after the biggest jewelry house in New York has started buying these too. Everybody wants these pearls, talking about naturally colored pearls, and the farms cannot provide. These are all from the same source. Um, this is uh, a lot finer than I have seen on the market for size, symmetry, and shape. Okay, so they're talking about that one shape there in particular. However, if you take that message and you, that's going to be relevant for all naturally colored pearls. I have got two strands of naturally colored pearls to go alongside a fireball and a trio as well. Um, this is a photograph taken at Tucson, which the team are on the, are, are, they're on the eve, I think, really. Um, it's this week that they all actually go over to Tucson. Trip of a lifetime in terms of opening my eyes to the, the jewelry that we offer here at Jewelry Maker. Take a little look at number nine. Read the details. I show you this only because I don't want you to think that freshwater pearls are lesser desirable than saltwater. Uh, pearl necklace, cultured Chinese freshwater. And look at that natural color. Again, it's that beautiful beautiful intensity of purple color. I mean, these are literally caged um, and alarmed in cabinets with the security guards either side. And just so you know, um, as well, the red, the, that's a red coral necklace that you can see just behind the graphics that was owned by Sophia Loren. So we are talking about, we are talking about jewelry, gemstones of the highest, highest caliber. I'm about to bring you this parcel and we are going to promise it today at a close out deal a major closeout deal. There are only 29 available opportunities. Um, you're, not get, you're not just getting one strand, you are getting two, and you're getting the Fireball, and you're getting the Trio. You know, think of all the bigger shows that we offer you here at Jewelry Maker, Black Friday, Cyber Monday, cl clearance and then some, New Year clearance, birthday deals. Um, this matches, if not beats, all of those. I can say that for certain. So these are not dyed. They're all Mother Nature produced. Um, absolutely beautiful quality of colour. Again, that's why I show you those photographs a few moments uh, moments ago. Is so that we appreciate that these freshwater pearls are those anomaly of nature's, and you're not just getting the one clay. You're getting an entire I know. strand. I know. That's why our suppliers are actually saying, look, it's not impossible, but it's very, very expensive. Do you think we're done there, though, Claire? I don't think we are. Can I ask you to Yeah, answer? absolutely. Thank you. Um, oh, my word, Earl. Mm -hmm. <sighs> I know. It's being stubborn, isn't it? Oh, it's all right, okay. <gasps> it includes the fireball. Oh, Earl. <gasps> Look at that. I oh, know. It includes the trio. Look at how perfect these are. I'll just remove that little bit. Look at how perfect these are today. Just beautiful, beautiful quality. That's there are, exquisite, isn't uh, it? Look at that. 29 mm. available chances in the world. Once they're gone, they're absolutely gone. These are half drilled, by the way, so you've got three pendants there ready and waiting. I love that you've got all this. this uh, it's a collection, isn't it? It really is. <gasps> it really is. Look at that. Have you ever seen anything more beautiful on our screens right now? Um, never been a better opportunity for you to get hold of pills than today, honestly. The, uh, the quality, the deal that you're about to see is going to blow your mind. I'm just going to put it this way. You shouldn't pay it for that fireball pill. You shouldn't pay it for either one of these strands yeah. for sure. And possibly for the trio as well. All certified completely natural. Are you ready? As I said, we have brought you some absolutely massive deals. Um, this has to be up there with the best of them. I truly believe that. This is half drilled, half drilled, half drilled, half drilled. And then you've got a full strand of natural peach and purple. The auction is open now. You also do get that lovely little grey uh, pouch as well. Um, there are 27 available opportunities for you all, jewellery makers. 
major closeout deals. I buy pearls, not just because I love it. I buy jewelry maker pearls um, in, uh, more, 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 more accurately. Um, and <clears throat> yeah, you could literally just buy these and sell them on immediately at a profit. If you've got a retail, if you've got a business, if you are, uh, um, I don't know, maybe planning on starting a business, mm. then pearls is always a great idea because people recognize their value immediately. But then you can heighten that story with the fact that these are naturally colored and educate your customers, educate your audience. Or if you're not, if you're not a business, then educate the people that you're lucky enough to give to or maybe hand down to. Already at the first price crash, it's a closeout deal for everything that you are getting on your screens right now. The two, not one, but two strands of naturally colored pearls. That is a closeout deal. That's the, that's the reality. And they're all natural. You get absolutely everything on your screens right now. Could that be any more perfect? Seriously. It's wonderful, isn't it? Look at the, look at the colors in that. Obviously, it's not going to sit straight, but oh, oh. Oh, my gosh. Look at the colours. Yeah. Could that be any more perfect? The next price crash is still not your closeout deal. Remember, though, there is only 27. I'm, I'm down to 19. We're already over-allocated, in actual fact. Start checking out as soon as you can. Next price crash, they definitely will do, yeah, absolutely. I, uh, this has got to be one of the best pearl deals we've ever offered. Ever offered. That literally looks like gold silk, doesn't it? My goodness me. Not what you are paying. But that's amazing. Isn't, isn't it? it? Yeah. I saw at wholesale at Tucson, there was only a couple of pearl heart, uh, suppliers out there because of COVID, quite literally. They, they, they mm. lost so much of their farm um, uh, and, and their pearls. I saw fireball pearls at higher prices than what's on your screens right now. Individually, you are getting a fireball of big size, three half drill purple pearls, two strands of sizable natural pearls as well. And we are not even stopping here. Valerie, Anne upstairs, well done. Devon, Richard, well done. Janet, Nola, Kate, Surrey, West Midlands, Angus, Teresa, Dorset, Northumberland, London. I can see you all there. This is not your closeout deal. The next price crash, says Ross, always oh, teasing us this morning, isn't he? It's not even your closeout deal price point. I can't believe we're going as low as we are. But do the math. Two strands, one fireball pearl. Let's count the three. Let's count the three pearls as one component, which is mad that I'm doing that. But mm. four amazing items. It's the price of your split pay oh, per yeah. component. If you put this Baroque on a chain, I know it's a, a different color. I know it's, it's, it, it's Edison, whatever it is. doesn't matter. You're talking £1,100 and it's sold mm. on what looks like eBay to me. I don't know if it was eBay. Oh, it's on Instagram. There we go. There we go. But sold at $1,100. That's one single pearl. We've still got another price crash for you. Janet, Teresa, sorry, you've done it. Half the stock has gone already. You know, consider it this way, a full strand of natural coloured pearls at £37.25. pence. That's madness. Yes, it is. It You'd is. be hard pushed to get hold of white pearls, which is still lovely, don't get me wrong, um, but not as rare as obviously natural purple. Every single peach. every single component is a wow component, yeah. isn't it? Like yeah. I feel like those lovely three, the three pearls there, they're almost lost, aren't they? But they are they are stunning. Yeah, I Absolutely agree. Absolutely stunning. Well, you, you I imagine mean, the suite that you would make of those. Yeah. Beautiful. That's a great call. I mean, th that trio there that I've just literally hidden behind the graphics, sorry. Uh, that trio just there, even one on a on a chain, which we've bought yep. you diamond yep. cut chain already. Yeah, we have got to do any length. Yeah, yeah. That you could, I think, realistically, you could expect to pay just one individual pearl, sixty, seventy pounds in yeah. most places, if not more. If not more, if you're a jeweler. In five seconds, it is going lower. We're so over allocated, though. Some of you will miss out on this opportunity. I'm so sorry. This has to be one of the biggest closeout deals we've ever done. Has to be. 
Claire. I know what's coming on your screens. <gasps> and that, even at jewellery maker standards, is an amazing price for that one individual fireball pearl. Would you agree? Even That's at jewellery maker it. prices, it's, it, 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 it's got to be one of the best deals. It truly has. Everything, like you say, is standout. £129. You can get hold of two strands of natural peach and purple pearls, and they're not small. Three beautiful natural purple half-drilled pearls, and that fireball. And it's, you know, when things are just all, they're so, each component is so lovely that your eyes just flip from one to the yeah. other to the other. Because, Can't choose. I mean, that fireball pearl is incredible isn't it but then the strands are incredible do you know and the fact that you get two strands yeah that for me would be a sweet and do you yeah. know what i would do yeah. graduate the pearls nice and yeah. have the fireball at the bottom, the bottom. Oh. can you imagine yeah. that as a necklace yeah. um hello june treated myself oh, the pearls lovely. are just fabulous wow 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 well done june yeah you, you deserve love them. it my you lovely love them, june. they are breathtaking so i think uh, mm -hmm. yeah marion um i have two of these they're beautiful they really oh, are yes. aren't they I've, uh, the, the quality of the pearls and i know i always shout about it i always talk about it the quality of the pearls that jewelry maker brings our audience i genuinely hand on heart believe are some of the best in the world mm. i genuinely believe i've got two chances Oh my That's gosh. it. Susan, Jackie, another Susan, Barbara, Johnny, Susan, Valerie, Janet, Sue. Oh, that lots of Susans. June, Janice, sorry, you've just got yours. I've got one left. Who's going to get that last one? There's Neil and Linda, there's Janice, there's Maker, there's Cambridge, there's Elizabeth, there's Miss, Mrs. Wenda, Teresa. Uh, Johnny, you've got yours, haven't you? Sorry, James, I can see you there in London as well. Has it gone? Well done. Well oh, done. Beautiful. I'm sorry if you missed out. You can always wish list it. And I would encourage wish, li wish listing on that. Because if, if they fall back into stock, our call centre will give you, a, uh, give you a call then just to tell you. I mean, look at those, Claire. Amazing, aren't they? Just stunning. Just amazing. Absolutely stunning. So beautiful. Shall I have those with the uh, pink mean, amethyst? Yes. Thank you. Hey, oh, that would be lovely with the pink amethyst. Yes, I'll have them. Oh, amazing, 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 amazing. Um, okay, right, moving on. Well done, everybody, because we've got Claire's gorgeous kits. They're all available on the website for pre-order. Um, and plus, if you shop there, one of you might be in a chance of winning a goodie bag. Oh, yes. Claire's birthday. How yeah. Nice that. Um, we haven't forgotten about the Wall of Fame. It is coming up, I promise you. If we can, we'll try and squeeze it in this hour. We've had a few technical issues, which meant we couldn't bring it, but we will bring it today at some point. Um, if it's not in this hour, it will be in the what hour? In the 12 o'clock hour. So just stay with us um, and we'll do, uh, we'll do our very, very best. Can I show you, where's that then? Are these are the pieces of jewellery? Um, so this is called a bio calcedony, where you get these really lovely bi-coloured um, bi areas of these wonderful warm, warm reds. You've got beautiful levels of oh, translucency. I adore calcedony. It's a little bit aquapraise-esque, I think. Yes. You've oh, got... my gosh. Look at it. Yeah. It reminds me of a blue aquapraise. Stunning, absolutely stunning. Levion, yeah, yeah. Eddie Levy, Eddie Levion named uh, um, Aquapraise as the gemstone of the year in 2019, I think. Don't quote me on that. Um, with loads of the biggest designers, uh, design houses using it. This is like a blue version, mm. different gem. I'm not saying it's the same. It's a, well, these well, shapes actually, are incredible to see that um, for that gemstone. Yeah. Aren't they? These are amazing. Well, Aquapraise is a calcedony. So, that. yeah, this is like the blue variety. Um, but, yeah, we'll learn some more about that with Dave. It's coming mm. up at 10 o'clock today. Claire, Gorgeous. your beautiful kids. Oh, so these are just a joy to work with. Absolutely. No, Absolutely. Now, on pre-order. Um, well, talk us through your jewellery first. So, um, it, yeah, lovely Sam, um, who's really, really good. And, we, and so we worked together um, on, on going through basically anything things that I loved and loved working with, um, which is sterling silver, um, wonderful charms, gemstones as well. It's, they've just been a, a joy to work with and to have the, I think the variety as well of the, the solderable accents, the different gauges of wire has been brilliant. And I think when you've got that, it just means, you know, if maybe you've not tried soldering before, you've looked at stacker rings mm. and you thought, I like them, you know, you see them in shops, have a go because you can, you can do this, you can absolutely make them. And the, and the more choice you have, um, I think the better results that you get. But the great thing with all of these solder black scents, if I, if I hold up something like this, I'll show you a couple of pieces. Don't forget, when you, know, when you, when you get things like this, you, 
use them as they are, which is flat. Oh. Um, but also, you know, work with some of the, you know, the lovely tools that you've got. So if we look at, um, so that little heart there, which, which is, um, you can see is more 3D now, it's domed. So you can see if I show it from the side. So work with your, um, your dapping block. You know, um, you can dome it like that. If I, I've done the same with the, with the star there. Um, you know, use a couple of the different accents together. So again, I've domed and, and textured the, the heart that we've got, added a little um, star. So all of these, and I'll show you now in the demo how to add the jump ring if that's what you want to do with them. Um, and you can add them in. And then there's this one is my I favorite. Love the little I love it. Oh, there should be a fairy underneath. There should, there. shouldn't there? Um, How lovely is that? But, but also I mean, these rings that you've Absolutely. Made. So again, if we look at them, so you take them as um, maybe if you're starting out and you want to make some stacker rings, you know, the, the detail on these, so you've got the sun here, um, you can see the, um, and these are, so just as they've come off, so I've not done anything with these, so you could shape them if you wanted to, but you're soldering on, you're doing stacker rings. I mean, you know, stacker rings are well. so popular. Yeah, what, sorry. you could stamp on those. Isn't Absolutely, it? yeah. Yeah, and you could shape them as well. So if you want to take something like that, so maybe you start off with that, and then you go to the next step where you're, so if I bring this one in, and we look at that one. So essentially, same sort of techniques. You're just shaping it a bit more and adding them. And you, because you've got the variety, you, you can make them, you know, it's completely unique designs, isn't it? So you can see there's a heart there, the, the little leaves that we've got, the flowers, you've got a bit of granulation, and then this amazing, I mean, if you look at that, wow. how lovely is that structural wire there? Gorgeous. Well, we're going to be bringing all of these components yes. to you all. We're going to start, though, with that amazing, solid, Piece of sterling silver to make that beautiful bangle. Yeah. Everything is available on pre-order, so you can actually shop uh, shop ahead. Um, massive gram weight. It's the first thing you'll notice when you hold it. What was that? <laughs> <laughs> Who's these <That's> <laughs> then? Who's that? <laughs> that was the biggest sneeze I've ever heard. Do you know what's funny though? Who did the sneeze? It, what's making me laugh right now is how 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 irrational. outraged. Ross uh, is. Yes, get out, Ross. Do you not like sneezing? Sneeze, sneezes. Dry. He says he, he hates the human sneeze. You can't you can't help it. Oh, I bet Adam Just feels great now. It. Oh, do you know what then? To, uh, you, should, you, you don't want to be with Tom because I'm always worried about Tom when he sneezes. I'm like, you're going to burst a blood vessel. Because he hot, trying to contain his sneezing. <laughs> that is so funny. You shouldn't let it out. And then it it's a lovely like a feeling. Little, it sounded like a little doggy though, Adam <laughs> sneezed. <Did Adam? laughs> that one? Yeah. That was huge. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I mean, Adam is, is big, isn't he? But yeah. He's a big bloke, yeah. Yeah. He's a big bloke. Anyway, back to the sterling silver. Have you seen the... Um... Oh, my goodness me. What? Oh, we haven't, haven't even talking about it. <laughs> Didn't even speak about it. So I'm so sorry. Claire, talk us through. Talk us well, through. Well, it's just... So, so you're going to get something like that, and you can see there how... I mean, look at that, and it's beautiful to wear. So I've shaped this a mixture of... Um, with so around the bangle mandrels if you've got any of those uh, and your nylon jaw pliers it, it, you know it takes a bit of work How do you get that texture in? and and then i've hammered it so okay. if you hammer all the way around so you can see there i mean look at that that is a solid it's a lovely how was that 29.99 crazy absolutely crazy Amazing. so lovely well it's sold Beautiful. out shall we bring you what what next roscoe let's bring the the coily <clears throat> one so this is sterling silver yeah yeah. So what would I use? So this, for this, this, so the two bits that I've used this for, and this again, you can see the the difference there. Again, beautiful, beautiful structural wire. You can see how it's. So we've got on the ring shank there, and so where it's just it's polished and plain. And then you can also do your bangles with that, wait, where I've I've hammered and, and textured it. Wait, Claire, you stretched out that bangle from this coil? Yeah, they've got a lot there. I know it's coiled up like that, but yeah, I think both of those came from that that one that one. How piece. amazing is that? Yeah, because you've got, yeah, you've got 30 centimetres. I know it's all sort of coiled up there, but... Yeah, yeah. you automatically assume rings, don't you? But yes, actually you yeah. you can stretch it out. Yeah, but you, because it's that, it's that lovely 1.8, so don't forget, yeah, and, and when thick. you texture, see, when you use your hammers on your steel block, that hardens it as well. Awesome. Um, OK, 7.75 grams of sterling silver here. We're not talking about hollow. We're going to do this in one price crash. How many have we got, Ross? 
100 okay cool and anybody can solder you don't contrary to certainly what i believed anyway um i was like oh yeah i need lots of i need lots of tools i need like a full-on workshop you don't do you no Funny no, enough, I've got don't. one of these. I got one from my mum's house the other day. Did you? A torch? Yeah. Oh, lovely. So well, we can, when we've done the power knotting, then we can... Um, we can get on to soldering. Yeah, yeah. How amazing. One price crash. Here we go, says Ross. Here we go. He's calmed down after the opportunities. <laughs> He's recovered. It was his reaction. His reaction. <laughs> get out! <laughs> wow. Forty ninety nine. Is that is that is that good then, Claire? That is brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. It's a big gram weight, isn't it? It's heavy. How? What was the gram weight on this too? But that's a lot of. My point is just a lot of sterling silver across those two components. That's so good. Shall I show you? Shall I show you with that one? I'll show you. It's very very simple stacker ring. Yeah. Take it away. Well, take it away. Literally take it away. And then I'll show you how to set up if you want to do the. Um, yeah. So what you're looking at. If you, um, so if we look at something like that, you can see, so there is my original, um, that's where I've done the original uh, solder. So it's just in here, you can mm -hmm. see, so it's sort of hidden. So when you're looking from the front, obviously you've got no, um, no join in the rest of it. So if we have a look, so I'm gonna show you how you would, so you'd be sizing and there are different calculations um, uh, to work out. Um, the, the size of your ring and you can look at those online so you want to know like the the, um, uh, uh, the dimensions of the wire that you're working with because this is quite a, a thick one so you'd be looking at the size so if I just get my uh, ring mandrel which is here so I'm just going to start and form to get a rough idea okay so I'm just going to cut that so I'm what using my flush cutters okay so then I'm also going to now if you've got your d-shaped pliers that would work really well I'm just going to bring this in so we can see at the moment it's not a round but it's a nice way to start so either work with your um if you've got your d-shaped pliers brilliant or your nylon um you know to protect them or you can put tape around pliers that you've got. So I'm just gonna take off a little bit of the edge there. Basic soldering, what you, what you want to have is you want to have um, the, the best, the neatest seam that you can, because that just means, if you think about it like a jigsaw puzzle, if it fits together really well now, we can use less solder, and it means we've got less cleaning up to do. So I'm just gonna take little bits off, and we're gonna get that so we've got a neat join. Again, just take a little bit off there. And it's always like, if you think about stages, so the, the, the better our job I do at this point, the less work I'll have at the next stage. So if I get a nice, neat seam, that should work well. Okay, so we're gonna pop that down. I'm gonna take, if you've got the, if you've got borax, you could use borax or, or depending on what flux you've got. Use a little bit of this. So I'm going to put that on here. Just move that there. So the next thing I'm going to do, and there are a couple of different ways you can do this. So if uh, you can either work with your pallion of solder underneath, so it would literally go, we'd place it under here. Um, if you can see from the front there, that's great. So we place it on the board over the seam and so that it's touching both sides. Or if you, when you feel like, if you feel like um, having a go at this, this is a, quite a nice, neat way as well. So I'm gonna pick up with my chain nose pliers and I'm just gonna open very carefully and slide that oh, okay. in between. So it's sort of like, that, like a sandwich effect in there. Now that's quite a big piece of solder, but it's getting a balance, so hopefully that you can you can see it as I do it. So again, I'm gonna pop that down. And because I've handled it, so I'm just gonna put a bit of a bit more flux. So if we when I heat it up now, let's have a look at that at that section. I love there. this bit. Okay, so let's have a look. So I'm gonna start, just move it off here. 
Sorry to move it. There we are. Okay. Okay. So if we start and we look Perfect at the front. View. Yeah. So I'm going to go all the way around, getting a bit of heat into all of it. So a bit at the back. And then I'm going to focus and concentrate on the front. Remember, what we're thinking is that heat, we want it to act like a magnet and it's going to draw the solder up. This is chunky, nice chunky wire. Same principles if you're going to do the bangle, just on a larger, larger size. I'm going to con really concentrate on that area now. Let's get some heat in. Looks like I might have to refill the, the torch. So starting to work. There we are. That's, there we go. Do you see? Ooh. Yes. So let's bring that round. There we go. And hopefully that should have filled the filled the gap. Right. There we are. So I'm now going to pick it up, pop it in. Don't use your fingers. You can once it, once it's gone in there. Don't pick it up. Obviously off the off the no. board. Once it's gone into the water and you've heard that, psh, you've quenched it, and that's cool. So now if we look at it, we can see here. So we'd use quite a chunky piece of solder, but because we've sandwiched it, we've got very, very, very little yeah. of work to do. And that, that work now would be, um, we need to obviously file this off, pop it in pickle, um, then, and then file it and, and get, get rid of that, that solder there. Same principles if you want to. So if you've got your, you then shape it on your, um, if you've got, um, you know, on your ring mandrel. And you can see, so I'm going to start and work these. And you can see how that's going to then go into once you've got all, all your different um, different hammers and you could texture as well. And you can see how then that's going to go into the ring shape. If what you want to do is you want to have those those lovely, lovely charms that we've got coming up and you wanted to add them to it. You can see on my board. So if you look from the if you can see from the top. I've got a little section here and all I've done with that is get a needle file and dig that out. And then you can. Add your, get some jump rings, which you can make yourself out of um, different wires. You can pop that in. So it's just gone into the recess. So if you can see a lot of it is sort of is disappeared here. And then what we can do, if I take one of these and it's just thinking about setting up and prepping. It's the same, same principles all the time of getting that nice and clean, good seams, good joins but then thinking about your board and different ways that you can set it up. So you work with paper clips, pennies, anything like that, potatoes, whatever you want. Potatoes? Potatoes. Anything that will be like a, a heat sink. Okay. So you can see, so if I sort of show you, you'd line that up and you can use your Sharpie and, and different pens there. It'd probably be easier if I didn't have such an old raggedy board. And then you're just going to get that. So that's set up like that. And then your solder is going to go just in there. Uh -huh. And that gives you this effect here. So you can see that would then give you oh. that one there. Claire, they're so beautiful. Brilliant, isn't it? So good. Soldering is, is incredible. Absolutely incredible. So beautiful. Um, okay, should we do these charms? Yes. Should we do it? Um, going to bring you some amazing prices on this. Remember, everybody, um, anybody, sorry, anybody that purchases between nine and twelve o'clock today, twelve or one, one, um, between nine and one o'clock today is in with a chance of winning Claire's amazing birthday goodie bag worth over a hundred pounds. Um, and there's no sort of minimum spend. For example, um, we have the goodie bag right now. Oh, in a lovely basket. I haven't seen baskets like Ooh. that in a very long time. Oh, it's like a lovely rainbow. Oh, look, Claire. There's, There's a birdie in there. What's in there? What's in there? Oh, this is so pretty. Oh, you got some beautiful tumbled <gasps> stones. You got abalone. I was only talking about abalone the other day and the fact that we haven't we haven't seen it in ages. Let me tilt it. Oh, forward. this is lovely. Look how nice all these are. Here you go. One of you is going to win this. Pearls. What looks like Morganite. Yeah. One of you is... Oh, oh, look! Is that the little birdie? It's a penguin. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at him. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Threads in there as well. Abalone shells in here. You can't see those, can you? You've got a load of those. And why were... There's loads. One of you will win this. Um, we'll announce at some point. Are you ready? 
So let me show you these beautiful charms. I'll leave that just there. Um, these beautiful charms, Claire, what your favourite? Oh, I love it. Toadstool. I love, love, love Toadstool, this. Toadstool, sorry. Yeah. Um, so you're getting the Christmas tree, you're getting the leaves, um, and the, oh, I say Christmas tree, it's not Christmas tree, is it? It's a little fir tree. Yeah. Um, and the toadstool. Wow. I mean, if you made a little pendant. 9.99. That's amazing, isn't it? That's so I've used that, so I've used the, um, you see one of the little leaves there on the, and, and they are, you can shape those little leaves too. So if you see on the ring, you can see, so oh, yeah. they work beautifully um, you get like that. Them. Four of those leaves. Perfect. I'm just thinking Pandora, how much they would be in Pandora, yeah. this kind of thing. Yeah, absolutely. But I mean, a, 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 that's a wonderful pendant, isn't it? Oh, I love How sweet store. would that be? I oh, know it's my favourite. I've seen my lovely friend Claire from Warwickshire. Ah, oh, shopping with us today as well. Yeah. Susan, Merthyr Tickle, Bristol, Carolyn, Alison, Anne, Hampshire, Hampshire, <laughs> Hampshire. Sorry, uh, Susan, Claire, Mary, and Jerry, London, Jenny, Vivian, Ruth, Caroline, Mary, Susan, Susan, Sarah. Hello to you, Fiona, Diana. I can't keep up. Um, how many do we have then, Roscoe? We had a hundred available opportunities. Hello, Margaret. Um, I soldered for 30 years in an electronics industry. I'm learning a lot of great techniques. Thank you, Claire. Aww, How thanks, wonderful Margaret. is that? So you're Thank very you. accomplished yeah. there. Yeah. How amazing, Margaret. Um, let's bring you the next, the, the next selection of, uh, of little, little charms or solderable accents. Shall we do the ones with the little suns? So you've got the... the yeah, the one that Claire was literally just... Oh, yeah, the stars too. So you've got ten, is it ten? Four, eight, sorry. Eight of the suns that Claire was just showing you in, in terms of how to make the pendant or stroke charm. Uh, so eight of those, plus you get your hearts, which are just... I mean, here. these are great, aren't they? Absolutely yeah, great. You get. And all those stars. It's a big, It's a big bundle, this one. So you're getting... Ten of each, I beg your pardon. So you're getting ten of the suns, ten of the stars, ten of the hearts, all of which are 925 sterling silver. And they look so lovely. And these these are the exact ones that um, I use on the, when I do the stacker ring workshop. So they are yeah. really, really lovely to use. Well, then they, they, they naturally go with each other, don't they? They do, well? and they're, you know, really popular, um, you know, motifs. Um, but you know, shape them. You know, you can shape them as well. But look at the detail on them. Fourteen ninety nine, as if yeah. You know, one of those rings. We've brought you the wire as well. Just a little bit of technique and know how from our lovely Claire, and you could be making these wonderful pieces too. In terms of tools and components, Claire, what do I need? Uh, so block? I would get, I'd get your solder block, um, your torch, some some flux, um, and then you've got obviously you know your pliers and your ring mandrel, um, things like that. But you know. Uh, have a, and have a look online as well for um, things like um, looking, uh, you know, like pound shops for emery boards, you know, nail blocks. Those are really, really good. Um, you know, so look, just look around. There you go. Yeah. Oh, speaking of your friend Claire from yeah. Warwickshire. Hello, Claire. Happy birthday for Sunday. Oh, thank uh, you. See you on day. Tuesday at your workshop to celebrate your birthday. Ah. And lovely you. Oh, oh, how sweet. Thanks, lovely Claire. She's so lovely. Honestly, so uh, again, this is, Warwickshire. this is wonderful. Yes, we're both from Warwickshire and we're both um, on, with an you, I and an E. Um, are you that's sure not that's me. Not we're you. not the same person. No. Are you sure? No. Are you just She's sending lovely. yourself a little no. message? I've got enormous hands and Claire has got lovely, delicate, delicate <laughs> hands. Yeah. But yeah, so Claire has, has learned how to solder and is, I mean, the work she's been doing is so beautifully neat. It's, it's brilliant. Amazing. So yes, you know, have a go. Have well a go. done, Claire. Yeah. And what a lovely message. We are yeah. only joking, of course. Fourteen ninety nine. We can make thirty charms, pens, yes, yeah, rings. That's it. Can we do the maths of that? I can't. My head doesn't figure that out. Fourteen ninety nine divided by thirty. Fifty p, and then nine two five sterling silver. Crazy, absolutely crazy. Okay, let's bring you some more goodies. Um, Ross is saying I'll follow you. Okay, hang on. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Claire, they're saying that I'm messaging uh, myself, telling, saying how good I am. <laughs> and really, you're shopping so you can win that goodie bag, aren't you? Um, uh, let's do, let's do these. Ooh, these are great. Hey, aren't they? this is like like a deck of cards, yeah, isn't it? So you've yeah. got this is yes. really good. You've got your aces. 
Oh, it is. Yeah, look. Yeah. Clubs, diamonds, hearts and spades. So what's that? Spades, not aces. <laughs> You can tell I. You can. You can tell I. So again, if you if you wanted to, um, if you wanted to um, do the same with these, because look, you've got a lot of silver there. If you wanted to do the same, you know, working with your dapping block and and shape them a little bit, you could do. That would look nice. Can you imagine a bangle with the? Um, it'd be quite cool, wouldn't it? So cool, Claire. I might have to borrow your overhead because we can't quite. Oh see yes. These, can we? Yeah. Um, you get ten way. of each. Ten of each. So you've got your clubs. I've gone completely blank. Clubs are the ones which look like four-leaf clovers, aren't they? Yes. Yeah. yeah. I don't play cards very often, that's the thing. Um, spades. Diamonds, hearts. Diamonds yeah. and hearts. Ah. Oh. These are lovely. And look how crisp each, each of them are. Can you imagine doing that? So if you, if you soldered your jump rings at the side, you could yeah. do full-on uh, bracelets and necklaces, couldn't you? Amazing. Absolutely love that. £19.99, pence. that gets you four of your 90... Uh, sorry, four packs. Ten of each, 40 in total. Um, 925 sterling silver, soldable accents, but they're not teeny weeny, are they? No, no, no they're, they're not. They're focus if need be. Yeah. And are these the ones that you've actually shaped? Yeah, so you can have a look. So if you look at these, because like I say, so there's a lot of silver there. So if we look at, and it doesn't change it. I don't think it changes it that much. So that's, I think, the heart. So you yeah. can see, so that you're getting it there in the, in the flat, but then if you just add a little bit of, of shape to it. Yeah. It gives you and, gives and you know, damaged, polish it up. Yeah. Yeah. Add your jump ring. And then again, if you want to just have it so that it's in the in the ring, in that's the ring. what it looks Beautiful. like. If you're uh, if you're think, looking at these as well, I don't I personally don't well of course I did see the de the deck of cards, but you could use the hearts as hearts, couldn't you? You can use the the, mm -hmm. the clovers or, or if you like the clubs as clovers. You've got the diamonds. Yeah. You can yeah. mix it up for sure. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, let's Love do... Um, yeah, I do too. They're amazing, aren't they? Okay, let's do next lot of your accents. So these have all been available on your pre-order now, lovely jewelry makers, and they are proving to be extra popular. Um, don't forget to send your entries into the Wall of Fame as well so we can admire and Speaking of, oh, we yes. haven't forgotten yeah. about the Wall of Fame. I promise you we will play it. Most likely going to be in the midday hour now. Um, okay, so let's now do. Oh no! Oh, making a right mess. I am Claire. Um, let's this is now. So many. There is so many. Oh, let's do that flower. Oh yes, these are lovely. These are really, really pretty. Because I saw that on your lovely jewellery. Yeah, with the little tidgy flowers. Almost sold out already on pre-order. So we need to be quite quick with this one. Here you go. That's what you're getting. And lots of tiny little, little, little flowers. Those little flowers, I, I, I love those little flowers. Here you are. Let's show it here. Oh, they're so sweet. Oh, it's sold out, Claire. On to the next. Amazing. Well done. Look at that. How exciting. Uh, let's watch what we do now. The bumblebee, because it's just here. Is it, is it a ladybird? Oh, so oh. these are lovely with your um Oh, it has a ladybird. Let's bring that over there because you can see it. Yes, there, yeah. Oh, look, yes, yeah, so you can put half-drilled pearl in there as yeah, well. Yeah, so these have got... So I can solder that, right? Yes, yeah. So this is where, you know, when we, I say about the potato. So the potato, what I've done, so if you cut a potato in half, because you've got gemstones in here, so then if you cut your potato, turn it over. So if you have a look yeah. there... And, and, and sort of oh. push that into the potato and then you solder from the back. What the potato does is it sort of cools uh, the front and allows you to, to heat at the back. So if you wanted to... You or are literally talking about a spud. An, an actual yeah. potato, yeah, potato, yeah. Yeah. A, 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 a raw potato. OK. Um, and the, if you look on my guest designer page, there are photos on there. And then you've got that lovely post here. Oh and again, there's a post, a post there for pearls. So, you know, some of the half-drilled pearls we've got. Um, you, you could work with those. I can't believe that's fourteen ninety nine. So, I mean, you are getting all of these. The flower, the ladybird, that lovely, f another flower. Look at that, look at that detailing of the bee. All it's that gorgeous, isn't it? I wonder if I've got any um, to sort of show you. Um, I mean, soldable accents are brilliant, absolutely brilliant to work with. So many different ways that you can... And they all mix up together, Yes, they do, they? yeah. All mix up together. Here we go. Let me show you the next lot. Oh, this is pretty. Sorry, I'll take that off you in a second, Claire. So this has got the uh, crescent and the star. Um, oh, I love again, this. this is embellished. 
and then you've got another little solderable accent just here so again perfect if you want to put um things like your uh your half drilled gemstones have we brought the wrong one on? okay no problem i can swap it over um okay hang on hang on this one is it this one you've got russ a star and a moon yeah i like these together have you worked with these okay. yes that is i think i mixed I think that's those two. Yes, that's those two. So the star is slightly different. Um, so you can see. Oh, I'll lovely. show you. And I, so I mixed and matched. So it's those two there on the back. Oh, Claire, they're so pretty. Look so, and when you polish they're them They're lovely, up, aren't they? they? Come to life. Yeah. They're, they're flying out. Literally, oh, they've gone, sold out. Let's do the ones that I just had. Um, so it's literally got your star and crescent moon already connected, but you also get that additional embellishment. We're going to go straight down to it. You've seen how busy we are with um, Claire's amazing kits. There's the little solderable axe. And that's the back. little one that I've used on the on the moon here. And that is, it looks like it's, it looks really tiny and it is really delicate, but the detail on it is gorgeous. Let me see. It's really, it's a really useful, it just adds a lot of... Uh, you know, it's it's delicate, isn't it? But I think if you, I mean, that's why I've I've taken that one and added it onto the moon there. I think the detail on it is is beautiful. Oh, so that's that. Yeah, one, can oh, you it's, see? Oh, it's Just, it sits it sits beautifully, doesn't it? It's and it holds its own against. You know, I've I've textured that that moon, and you can still see that lovely star detail. That's gorgeous. Six ninety nine. Incredible, isn't it? Amazing. And then you've got the other one again for your for your pearls and other half drilled gemstones. Yeah, absolutely. Right, let's bring you uh, the last. The last of the accents, anyway. So you've got oh, it's so hard again, to describe gorgeous. these. Oh, you're getting two There's, of them. Yes. So with these, you can again. So what I've done with these on, on other pieces, if you you can fit them together. So you know when we talk about like thinking about your soldering as a jigsaw. So pop them together yeah. and solder on top. You could use them as um, shoulders to rings as well. And then you've got your lovely stars. Ah, perfect. We can see them there. Yeah. There yeah. So you can see they're really um, really nice sort of edges to. To pieces I as well. see. So if you had maybe I don't know if you had a certain shape and you wanted to create almost like a tapering, you just, that yes, shoulder, yeah, around something. maybe if you if you do tube setting or something like that, um, or on rings. And so the other way is I've just pushed them together, uh, sort of like that, and then you lay something on top as well. So there they are again. These 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 little tiny ones. They're so delicate. The detail on them. You know, it takes such a long time to make anything like this and get it uniform when you yeah. want it almost in a pair to be neat. Yeah. But they are, although they look quite small, they're so useful on delicate jewellery. Absolutely. Really, really lovely. Absolutely. And obviously perfect stars there. Lovely. Beautiful. Thank you so much, Claire. And well done, everybody. Um, I've got some wire. 0 0.8, 0.6 and 0.4, so your essentials. There are only 30 chances available. 12 have already gone on your pre-order as well. Thank you, Claire. Um, if I put that one over there. I'm trying to keep this as organised as possible for our lovely Dan. There we are. Um, okay, so so if you want to make your jump rings, yeah, so these, Yeah, these are... Um, uh, aren't they great gauges of wire? I would say you need to have, you know, your structural, bigger, chunkier wires like the like the bangle, um, like the the 1.8. Um, those ones. these wires are really good for if you want to do you make your own jump rings, um, rosary linking, wire weaving. These are really really good for that. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Which of course you can still solder. Yes, yes, and still, still polish. Use your liver of sulphur, things like that. Yeah. Amazing. Um, we've only got a limited quantity of them as well. Solid 925 sterling silver. We're going to bring you a big saving on this opportunity. Should be, what did you say? <coughs> Individually, it comes to £25. Today, because you're getting it as part of Claire's amazing kit hour, you're getting it for £17.99. But if you look, that, that's a 0 0.8. So if you, I don't take that off. So if you look at, so that ring there, Mm. So, on the, so on my thumb, you think about, you know, and I wear on both thumbs, that is, so one's a one mil and one is a 0 0.8. So you can absolutely, if you're going to hammer as well, mm. you can use that 0 0.8 to, um, to make stacker rings as well. They're very fine, but I, I don't take those off. And so you think of all the, you know, the practical things that I, you know, I work with my hands and that, you know, they never come off and then, you know, they're not misshapen. No, or, not know, at all. And they, they, you know, they will hold their own at a 0 0.8. 
And how many of those rings do you think you could actually make? Oh, gosh, lots, couldn't you? If uh, yeah. you've got a metre there, yeah, absolutely. Well, you're getting yeah. all of that. Well done, on the verge of selling out. Now, we do have these lovely collects. I know. These are, again, some of my favourite things. So, again, these uh, beautifully with... Um, because the, how they work, the, the gemstones on, on these are incredible. So they're, they're surrounded by um, sterling silver, so mm. they work really, really nicely with the, um, the wire that you've got. You can use them in lots of different ways. So if I show you, so you can see that one. So I've taken a little bit off that one and just added it to, um, oh, to a bale. Wow. So you can see, I mean, look at the gemstone on, on that. That's gorgeous. It's amazing, isn't it? So it doesn't have to be literally that they wrap around leather. No, you can use these for, for loads of other things. Um, I've, I've worked with them in rings, in wire work as well. So if I, if I just show you from the reverse, that you're looking at a smoky quartz there on Claire's design. So if I show you, you've got that wonderful halo of 925 sterling silver. And then if I show you the reverse, just in case these are a brand new product to you, um, you have those two posts, if you like, of wire. Um, that Claire, you launched these, didn't you? And they literally wrap over leather. Yes, sort of yes. Fold so you in, can do that. You can in. fold them in. Yes. But yeah. if you wanted to create the bail out of that or solder it to something, you absolutely can. That's a genius idea. They are on the verge of selling out. Very, very popular. So you've got smoky quartz, peridot. You've got a really lovely sunstone and also amethyst. Um, amazing. Again, flying. Um, I've got one more set of collets. These are big stones. Really big stones. And the fact that you are getting all of them in 925 sterling silver, these aren't base metals. They're beautiful, aren't they? Yeah, really lovely. Oh, look at those. Absolutely stunning. And you can, so you can see here, so if I, I show you, these are slightly different stones, uh, but you can see another way to work. So if you take the demo that, that we did, and mm -hmm. rather than using and making a ring, if you turn the ring on its side, uh, you cut off one of the posts on there, and you hang them off, you can see, so you've got, you've got those effects there. I mean, how, you know, really, really quick. So you'd have made a stacker ring in the same way we did. And if I turn it round, so if I just turn that round, you can see. That's amazing, what a genius so you, idea. You take one off, take one of the posts off and turn the other one into almost like, well, it's technically like a bale, isn't it? And it hangs off there. Amazing, Claire. You're awesome. Beautiful you are. pieces. You're awesome. Well Thank done, you. everybody. They are getting quite limited, those kits, if not already sold out. Um, make sure you do check out on those because, uh, yeah, it's been very, very busy. And remember, everybody that's shopping with us today between nine and one o'clock is in with a chance of winning amazing birthday goodie bag for our lovely Claire McDonald. Coming up just after the break, we have got the fantastic Dave Troth stepping into the studio to launch a very exciting new gemstone. It is stunning, absolutely stunning. Can't wait to show you all. Don't go anywhere back after this. Here at Jewellery Maker, we're always looking ways to make your shopping experience better. That's why on certain items, we've got split pay, where you can spread the cost over two, three or four months at no extra cost to you. So you can buy your way with split pay. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewellery Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. It's a new year, so that can only mean one thing. It's time for those new year resolutions. And it's the perfect time to start a new hobby. Jewelry Maker, Sewing Street and Hobby Maker are here whether you're starting something new or advancing your skills on a current hobby. With all the tools you need to start, as well as expert demonstrations from our great guests. Are you starting a new hobby this January? Share your new makes with us by tagging Jewelry Maker, Hobby Maker or Sewing Street using the hashtag New Year New Hobby. And watch us every day from 8am to 1pm on Jewelry Maker. On Hobby Maker, 6 to 8am and 1 to 6pm. And 8am to 1pm on Sewing Street.
want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Jewelry Makers, we have a mega sale on our website right now. There is up to 70% off items with over a thousand items available on all the W's at jewelrymaker.com. So pop along, take a look and start shopping. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. I'd like to say that we've seen most gems out there. I agree. I've never seen anything like this. No, this, well, exactly. It's a, it's a kind of new discovery into the market. There was rumors about this, you know, small uh, fragments of this kind of mineral specimens uh, just over 10 years ago. But it's not a, a discovery in the truest sense, it's a rediscovery. This is a gemstone, um, which, you know, we're gonna find out together has been revered for thousands of years. Uh, was was very prominent in in kind of the the, the Roman era, um, and essentially we we knew about its occurrence at some point throughout history because of the artifacts that were found throughout ancient Rome. Okay. Um, when when they went through the ruins, when they went through some of the incredible uh, ruins that were preserved under the Vesuvius you know, ash cloud uh, in Pompeii, mm -hmm. uh, Villa de Papri uh, uh, is an incredible. Um, ruin that was preserved by the ash that sat on it for hundreds of years Amazing. it was julius caesar's father-in-law that owned it and it was literally in the bay of naples and, and many of you probably know this story um it was buried under ash they rediscovered it in the 17th century and they started trying to excavate it and they left it and more recently they've they've, they've gone through it and um, you know it's so well preserved that a lot of the artifacts now sit in the getty museum in california in malibu and that's how we know that this material once was on Earth, that it once existed, and no one really knew the true source of it. You know, there was certainly none of this material that's ever been found in Italy, mm. um, none of this material that has been found in Greece or modern day Greece. And so they were looking at the ancient kind of trade routes that the Romans had uh, with different countries around that time, like 2000 years ago. Um, uh, and, you know, there was people thinking maybe it's from Ceylon, maybe it come up through that ancient maritime trade route, maybe it came across the ancient Silk Road, mm. maybe it came from, from India or, or further afield. And it was really kind of in 2009 that they put the pieces together and they found these fragments. Now this is, it's a mine, but it's also uh, an archeological dig, this yeah. area now. Wow. And it is in Anatolia, it is in Turkey. And, and this is in part why Aquapres was so exciting when that was discovered. When Acropres was discovered, it was the first kind of blue-green chalcedony. Yeah, okay. it's got similarities. Yeah, well, you, you've got ex well, it's the, pretty much the same gemstone, but this is the blue variety. So when you look at this article back from 2015, when Yoni Malison covered this uh, material in Africa, they, they, they're keen to call it or to put blue in the name. They're like, you know, it's a new natural bluish-green chalcedony, and we know that it's gone from strength to strength. We know that... Um, this material with those wonderful modeling of colors with those mm -hmm. earthy tones coming through. We know that Boucheron are working with it, which is yep. incredible. We know that Lavienne are working with it. Um, and then, you know, in 2009, some archaeologists found evidence to suggest that this, the primary deposit for this material that has been found in all of the, the, the Roman emperor's kind of jewels that have been kept in museums came from Anatolia. And this is one of the articles that came out. It's the Australian gemologist. And it talks about this ancient deposit of blue chalcedony 
in Turkey. And you, you can see in the yellow box there it says, uh, this deposit is the largest and richest deposit of blue chalcedony in Turkey. The reserves and the grade of the chalcedony gem rough remaining in the face of the present mining operations are reviewed. Uh, since its extraction uh, is historically began in the Roman period, uh, some of its cutting and polishing characteristics are also discussed. And this is one of the articles that was you know, promising back in 2009, but nothing really came to fruition. Um, over the last two years, they started mining this material and they found a new vein in the same primary deposit. And we are literally giving you one of the gemstones that was supremely valued in, in the times of, of the, the Roman era. And I'm going to show you some of these pieces and it's identical to what we've got. Uh, pieces like this that make their way to Christie's. Oh, wow. A Roman uh, blue chalcedony bead necklace. Yeah, that's back in 2003. When no, back then, really, no one even knew where this came from. If you go into the lot details, it doesn't give you an origin. No one knows because no one's seen blue chalcedony like this. You know, we see blue lace agates. Yeah. We see other gemstones. But this chalcedony that is translucent, like you said, has the similar characteristics to aquaprase, has the wonderful kind of earthy tones mm. within it. No one knew where it came from. So like the, wow. yeah, the, the, the Romans had access to this material. That's the only evidence we know of its existence. But for the 2,000 years that, that have passed by, no one's ever found a blue chalcedony a natural translucent blue chalcedony. Wow. And you can see the, the, the Romans, you know, work with this. And I mean, it's, it's amazing really to me that this is, you know, around the second century AD, which is kind of unfathomable in terms of a passage of time. But look, look at the detail. Yeah. You know, it's not, it doesn't feel rudimentary. It feels cutting edge. It feels modern. You know, you've got the polishing, so it's extremely smooth. It's almost photorealistic in, in its carving process. That was taking place thousands of years ago. Like literally, um, I wouldn't, it's very difficult to get work like that even today outside of somewhere like Edar Oberstein. And, and I'm looking as well, Dave, but when this auction took place. Yeah. So consider what it would sell for now. Yeah, exactly, 1970. And even back then it sold for uh, you know, in excess of 17,000 US dollars. I mean, that's back... God knows. Yeah. God knows. I mean, what would you get for 20 grand back in 1970? A house. House, yeah. Yeah, literally. But this is why this material captivated people. Because imagine, it's one thing to find something, you know, of, of, from the Roman era. You know, we find coins, mm. but you can still find bronze today and gold and silver. We find kind of garnets, we find other gemstones. But when you find a gemstone that is just confined to that one era, yeah. exclusively used in, in the timeline of history, exclusively used by that era, those unbelievable jumps in technology within, within the Roman era, and then it just disappeared as the Roman Empire did. And no one really knew where this material came from. There's been thousands of garnets mined in that time from different locations. Pretty much any of the gemstone that the Romans favored. In fact, I would say every gemstone that mm. they favored. And of course, they favored many. Um, they were the richest civilization in the world. Uh, they traded with many other countries, many other civilizations. You're talking about the Greeks kind of inter, you know, interlocking at the same time, mm. the, and then the Egyptians. They all traded amongst one another around that Mediterranean area. And um, all of those gemstones, you think about the turquoise that the Egyptians used, Cleopatra's emeralds. Yep. You know, we've seen turquoise, we've seen emeralds, we've seen every gemstone, but this is the one that evaded everyone. And this is why, like you said, quite rightfully, every time it appeared on the market, it was you know, selling for, for huge, huge price, these princely sums. You know, 17,000, you're quite right, in 1970 is astronomical. I don't yeah. even know how to work it out, but it is a lot of money. It's a lot of money today. Um, again, you see this, um, this wonderful blue chalcedony bead wow. necklace. Again, second century BC wow. or AD. They, you know, th this is what they're talking about. $2,000 back in 2013. And like, we have that material for you today. We have that material for you today. We're at the very, very cutting edge. We're at the front line right now of bringing the renaissance of this material back to the world. And we, we could literally, and you know, you'll probably see it elsewhere, price to any sum. You could price this whatever you want. Mm. Imagine, you literally, if you wanted to be really romantic about it, you'd say, you know, it's the lost treasure of the Roman Empire. But we're not we're saying, look, this is this chalcedony. It's a rediscovery of, of what the, the, the Australian gemologist that are, they're writing about it are saying it's an ancient deposit. Wow. The only ancient deposit that has evaded everyone. The only other similarity you can make, realistically, is that of, of the Olmec Jade. I'm just thinking about now, can you imagine yourself just sort of basically walking onto an, a, 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 an archaeological dig, mm -hmm. picking up, I don't know, whatever it is, an ancient artifact. Yeah. Just saying, okay, I'll buy this, thanks. 
That's essentially what we're doing. Uh, essentially, yeah. So, so the the original deposit, which which is a vein that is exhausted, is extremely close by to this deposit, and there are archaeologists digging that site right now. And obviously, they're not digging for for any no. commercial supply of this material, but they're they're digging for evidence of the ancient trade, How um, which is you know really exciting and really uh, special. And then you know the the miners in the area, just like I said a few feet away have found a viable vein that is producing the exact same material. In fact, this is the material that was missed by the Romans. It wow. was there then. You know, it's not like it's, it's no. suddenly, uh, uh, um, you know, metamorphosized over the last 2,000 years. This, was, this has been in the ground for a million years. Wow. You know, it was just missed by them. And you have the opportunity to acquire this material today, a material that is, you know, never, ever came to the market. And like I said, the... The, the, the only similarity, the only kind of analogy that I can make is that of the Olmec Jade, because that material was lost for 500 years. Mm. Um, people didn't know where it was from. They knew the Olmecs used it, they knew the Mayans used it, and the Aztecs, but, you know, obviously with, with you know, the new world and those civilizations perishing and dying out, mm. so did the knowledge of where the mine was, and they yeah. couldn't find it. And then, obviously, we know uh, Jay Ridinger and, and Merrily Ridinger back in the, the 70s rediscovered this mine, vindicated vindicated in the National Geographic uh, articles. But the, the key thing there is, just like with everything else from the Roman Empire, there is other jadeite mines. Yes. Yeah, there is not another blue chalcedony deposit. Wow. That, that is why, in part, one of the really, really exciting reasons that Yanni Malas discovered this chalcedony back in 2013, back in 2014, you know, got it certified as like, this blue-green chalcedony, this translucent. Everyone lost their minds. Everyone lost their minds. So, you know, this incredible material. And I'm showing you the material now. Look, again, um, this is back in 2008. Persian blue chalcedony, scaraboid, 5th century BC. Um, and you're seeing the, the, the wonderful carvings, these incredible seals using, and again, all of the gemstones, thank you, Dan, all of the gemstones that you can see laid out here. Every single one of those gemstones, there is other versions of that have been yeah, found. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, whether it's carnelian, whether it is garnet, whether it is again, agate or jasper. Yeah, 2008, 12,500 pounds. Look at the estimate. Yeah. The estimate was two to 3,000 pounds. The largest and most impressive piece, I think we can all agree, is the wonderful blue chalcedony blue, camel. Yeah. What's interesting is even you know, back then, they were using it in very much the same way we are. If you can really look into that camel, you can see this halo of light running through mm. the center. That's, a, that's a, a drill hole. Oh, really? Yeah, you can see just passing, you know, literally through the camel in the back, um, in the central portion of that, going from left to right is a shallow portion of, that is void of the color. So that, that would have been maybe on a chain? 100%. Wow. It would have been on a cord, a chain. And we are very, very excited. And those are individual stones. Yeah. You know, you effectively, Dave, are offering parcels of each of these cuts. That's, that's exactly what we do. These are parcels of every single wow. one of these huge, unique, wonderful stones. And we never know how these things will play out. We never know how they're going to go. We're going to price these um, at the very lowest prices today. When we get a great deal, you get a great deal. In fact, I'm going to say it right now. Everything, everything I'm going to offer you, regardless of carat weight, regardless of anything, the shapes, whatever it is, is going to be under £100. So it's all going to be double figures. Really? Any single thing you want. Yep, that's double what we're doing. Double figures? Yep, and I want to let you know that when the time comes for us to replace this material, I don't know if it will then be £200. I don't know if the price will go up. Mm. It's certainly not going to come down. And we are in early, and as we always do, we're offering you this chance. Now, I'll be honest, you know, we refer to me as a gem expert, whatever it is. You know, I'm, I'm not by any means at all. There's a lot of you that know a lot more than I do, but we're all very passionate. I'll tell you one thing, though, I'm not, I'm not a historian, okay? I'm not an archaeologist. Um, you know, I'm fascinated, I'm sure we all are, with, with kind of those moments of history, the mm. exciting ones, you know, like the Roman Empire. Um, like the Egyptians, like, like the, the Greek. I think you're doing yourself a disservice. No, but the, re the point I'm making this is because I'm seriously not qualified at all to price this material. Mm. Not qualified to price this material at all. As a gem expert, we get a market gauge. Yeah. But, like, you know, an archaeologist might look at this very differently to what I am. Yeah. You know, yeah. Uh, or a historian. Well, especially given everything. And I don't think, like you said, it's going to be undervaluing yeah, well, it's, it's going to be the opposite, one more thing before we get into it the Getty Museum in, in Malibu which is until this moment or until this new scene was discovered probably had the biggest collection of natural blue cow yeah. in the world and that's because its founder John Paul Getty who was one time or another the richest man on earth yeah you know um, British American was involved in you know oil and petroleum 
amazing uh, uh, empire that he built. And he was fascinated with antiquity, right? He used mm. to travel uh, and was like blown away by the cultures of, that happened in Europe. Okay, he was like, he couldn't believe that there's that much history. So a lot, a lot of Americans feel like that because yeah, it's absolutely. quite a new, absolutely. right? So he used to go, you know, the, the richest man, the, the richest individual on earth. And he went to Villa de Papri, which is, like I said, Julius Caesar's father-in-law's house um, that was uncovered um, in the Bay of Naples. Okay, they say it was the most beautiful uh, house in the whole of the Roman Empire. Wow. Um, and there's reconstructions of what it would have looked like. It is absolutely stunning in the Bay of Naples, looked out. And unfortunately, it was destroyed when uh, Mount Vesuvius erupted. Like I told you, the ash covered it. And so it's one of the few deposits. I mean, I don't know if you've ever been to Pompeii. I haven't. I really want to. But it's one of the few places that is completely preserved because wow. no oxygen could get to it because it was sat under feet and feet and feet of ash. And then that was compressed with earth over thousands of years, right? So when they rediscovered that, he was one of the people that went over there and he essentially bought it. Amazing. Because right? he was blown away and he wanted, this is what started the Getty Museum, right? So he was like, I want to buy it. And I don't know if he invested in it or he bought it outright. But essentially, he said, I want to rebuild this villa. Okay, I want to rebuild the whole villa. Wow. And I want to take all the fragments, all the, the, the artifacts, whether it's the mosaic tiles in the courtyard, I want to take them all, lift them, and take them to Malibu and just rebuild it, you know, as, as much as I can, brick for brick, authentically, with the actual materials that came from wow. it, right? And if you've ever been to the Getty Museum, I'm very fortunate to have been next. My brother used to live in California. It is the villa. Everyone said he was crazy. It was his life's work. It was his life's work. If you ever watched, like, a biopic on him, whatever it is, he rebuilt that. And basically, all of the artifacts, all of the, the valuables that were acquired that he bought from there, he's displayed them in there. So it's like, yeah, it's a museum, but it's like a living museum. You, even the, the fact where it faces, he wanted it to catch the same sun that it would have caught in uh, Incredible. And he, Just that it, level of detail. Yeah, yeah, and of course, he was probably the only person at the time that could have done it. Everyone said he was crazy. It took him decades, by the way. Yeah. Um, you can get it up, you can look it up, but essentially he went there. If you go there, you'll find these ancient garnets. You'll find like these unbelievable vases, some of them broken. Wow. And of course, these natural blue chalcedonies wow. that no one else in the world had. And so really, the, the point that I'm making right now is until this moment, until jewelry making, and I'm sure there's other people selling this material right now because it's new, but until this moment in time, the only way, other than if you were alive in the Roman Empire and were an emperor or something, <laughs> the only way you could own this material was if you were the richest individual alive. Wow. It was like the highest bidder. So, so until this, this moment, unless you were one of the wealthiest people to have ever lived, you could not own natural blue chalcedony. Wow. And, and, we're not, and by the way, in the Getty Museum, when you leave the Getty Museum, they sell synthetic blue chalcedony. Really? For more than the price you're going to do for you today. Really? Yeah, like, and it's open about it. It's like a souvenir, right? So they'll yeah. be like, you know, you, you just walk past an exhibit of this incredible lost blue chalcedony that, you know, will have a little... Uh, uh, a little a plaque by it that will say, you know, no one has ever found this source, blah, blah, blah. You go into the gift shop, essentially. By little and there'll be, there will, there'll be like uh, glass uh, garnets that will wow. like, made to look like scarabs. And there'll be these kind of organic cut blue calcedonies. Amazing. And it'll be like, oh, yeah, take a bit of this for me. It's incredible. You got the real deal here today. It's not a synthetic. It's not an imitation. It's from the same, same damn mine as, as that material was mine back then, which is just so incredible. And we are bringing it to you, and we're going to bring you an incredible deal. But I don't know what's going to happen with this deposit. I don't even it's exciting, know. Yeah, and I don't even know, to be honest, I don't know how the international laws work. I don't even know if this deposit at some point will be shut down. Like, and it will become an archaeological dig for a moment. But you have the opportunity right now. I'd urge you to take advantage of it. The last thing I'm going to show you is this. That's incredible. This is it. So we saw 1970. We saw 2008. Back in 2019, this incredible, beautiful tabloid seal with the three swans, um, which, which, which came onto the market. Blue cow said Again drilled. But again, look at the estimate. 50 to 70,000. Look what it sold for. 118,000 yeah. US dollars. And you get the opportunity... Very, very slim, very, very limited opportunity today to acquire this sensational, natural, translucent blue chalcedony from the Anatolian mountains, which is the same material that the, the Roman emperors were trading for back then. Um, Ross is saying these are all extremely limited. Yeah, yeah. I guess they're going to be, aren't they? Yeah. But we're also, I've told you, well, everything... Yeah, well, well, this is one individual bead of that course. we're looking at right yeah. now. But remember, everything you're about to acquire 
is double figures. Wow. Promise you. And I'm going to do a 30-second clock, please, um, Adam, and we'll put everything on pre-order. Less. Everything on pre-order. Because if you want a piece and we're this limited, then your best chance will be at getting these. The clock has started, then we're going to put it on, on pre-order. Um, here they are. So they're, wait, they're wait. already up. They're already up. Okay, they're already up. Amazing. Amazing. They're already at double figures. Yeah, they're already there. That's your start price. What do you mean start? That's, like I said. We're, we're going lower than this? Yeah. You know Seriously. how it works here. Right? You know what we do. I know, I know, I know, but it doesn't sit comfortably. I was no. just expecting it to be sort of lot. And I have to tell you as well, you've not seen the blue colour so well on the website. Look at this wonderful colour. Yeah, and the translucency. Oh. The drill hole through every single piece. That's We're going to start with this. Day. This is 65 carats. Devon, Dorset, what Essex. What a fascinating well done. story Absolutely. as well. Yeah. Fascinating story. So this was, you know, one of the most valuable treasures in the Roman Empire. Well, yeah, I mean, for sure. It was certainly one of their valuable treasures. Um, it would be hard to ascertain which, which they valued which they the most. Yeah, of course. But the, the reality is of all the treasures in the Roman Empire, this is the one you haven't been able to acquire. Yeah. This is the one that no that. one knew where it came from. Wow. That's what's so exciting. A gemstone that was lost to time. Now, we've got less than 50. In fact, we've got less than 40 of these. Wow. Let's bring in the price on from the website, £98. That's amazing. Yeah. That even there is mm -hmm. amazing. Yep. I love the stories that you see within this stone. I love, yep. I, I, I love the, the markings. Yeah, very re uh, Le'Veon reminiscent. I am thinking yeah. of the, you know, the launch. For sure. I mean, you know, we think about Acrobrace, how exciting that was. This is on another level for yeah. me, for me personally. Yeah, I agree. I I'll take a 30 second clock again, guys. Uh, we're nowhere near done. Uh, but in the same respect, yes, it's going to be incredible deals. Everything is available for pre-order. But remember, there's no big quantities. Less than 40 of these ever made. Ah. It's because it's still extremely early days for this deposit. Uh, and we just wanted to get what we could whilst we could. We didn't want to wait because the price might go up. I remember, I remember you saying about uh, sort of your, uh, your Brazilian Paraba. Imagine if we were there, yeah. or, you know, and buying Brazil, we're able to buy yeah. Brazilian Paraba. When, when it was first um, discovered. Uh -huh. You know, we are as close to that, but- We're, we're gonna half the price, we're gonna go to 49.99. Really? And I'm nowhere near them. Nowhere near, so we're going 49.99 straight away. Uh, please, please, Adam, when this um, price comes on, let's put another 30 second clock on. Okay. We'll give everyone the incredible deal. This will give you an indication of how fast you're gonna have to be throughout this show. No, uh, yeah, these are- 10% of the stock's already gone, well done. Uh, 25 seconds. Yeah, you need to be quick on this one. We don't have the big quantities. Uh, that, that's the thing. We, could, we are literally on the tip, yeah. on the point yeah. of, of, of this gemstone's legacy. Mm -hmm. um, so that's exciting in its own self, in its own right to actually yeah. have... Greater London, um, well done. You've just multi bought on this. I think that is the way to go, if you can. Uh, not all of us will be successful in that because of how limited this showcase is. It's very unfortunate, but it's very exciting. It's a showcase that I would not miss for the world. No. And what we're going to do right now, again, let's just show you the piece that made its way to Christie's. Um, you're talking about this, 2013, two grand. Yours today, half the price again, please. Half? Yeah. And then you have to be extremely fast now. I was expecting these to be split pay musts. Yeah. I, I wasn't expecting double figures even, to be honest. No. Cal Sydney, you know, even when it is dyed, Dave, yeah. is quite right. a considered stone. Yeah, I mean, like I said, you know, you see Bouchron working with it, you see yeah. Lavien working with it, you see all these incredible jewellery houses working with this material, but you get the opportunity right now to acquire this, to put it into your collection for £24.99. Crazy. And it's a giant caraway, and it's translucent, and above all else, it is that ultra-rare, beautiful blue colour. It is it is stunningly beautiful. Uh, it just glows, doesn't it? It's got this lovely, quite heavenly, whimsical, ethereal-like colour, and I guess that's why those uh, those pieces that we saw a few moments ago yeah. um, have been carved. It kind of takes that ethereal look on, doesn't for it? For sure, 100%. So limited, though. You need Greta Linda, you've multi bought Tracy in Norfolk, you've multi bought Linda in Hampshire, Linda in Staffordshire, uh, uh, Aminia in Hertfordshire, Maker in Devon, Kath in Tynaweir, Richard in Dorset. Um, we've got a lot of you with it in your baskets. This is the deal, this is the incredible deal that we are making available for all of you this morning. Wow. Wow, and that's something certainly our jewelry maker audience could recreate. Oh, for sure, and I know. think I think that's the beauty of this. You know, take your take that kind of uh, inspiration from antiquity. You know, yeah. create these wonderful timeless pieces. 
amazing. It's uh, very close to selling out now, so well um, only a couple of them there. We keep holding those yeah. of you with it uh, on the phone lines. Um, make sure you check out. Remember, every single item, I think this is very bold, Dave, Yeah. Um, is, is available on pre-order. Yeah, uh, well, look, I, I know that sometimes I go on and waffle on. And I just thought, you know, I'm not going to you stand in your way. Uh, I'm not going to stand in your way if you just want to get your piece. If you already know about this, if maybe you've read about it and you want to get it, then I just wanted to make it available. Well done to those of you that are just successful on that. If you're on the phone lines, I don't know if you have been successful, but stay holding. A lot of multi-buyers there. Congratulations. And we move through this epic renaissance, this collection, and uh, this piece here. Yeah. It's perfect for that look. Yeah, for, for that look that we saw from the second century of BC that went to auction in 2013, this wonderful translucent glowing blue chalcedony with those earthy tones. Wow. Well, you've got that look right now in this incredible piece. Oh, it's beautiful, wow. isn't it? It's just, got, it's moody. That's what I love about yeah, this yeah. stone. It's got this moodiness to it's it. It's natural. See the gold's coming through. Yeah. Fascinating. Yeah. Absolutely fascinating. Larger carat weight here, of course. Uh, yeah. Let's go to 98 pounds. Let's just get it on. Let's get you this price. Richard, you're on the phone lines already. You well endorse done, it. Congratulations. Richard. I don't know if you already got in on the pre-orders, but if you did, well done. There's a, a, a queue already forming. We are nowhere near done. We're going to give you a minute clock. A minute clock right now, and I'm going to go straight down to your final deal on this piece because of how busy it is this morning, because of how hotly anticipated this is. I think a lot of us have fallen in love with, yeah, with this totally. incredible story. Right, 50 seconds. Apologies, I picked up the wrong one. They are ovals, but they're slightly different drill hole direction. So absolutely amazing. Look at those. They're beautiful, aren't they? Absolutely beautiful. And Anne and Sue, they've had a, a, a field day creating with this amazing parcel. Um, so, so, so exciting. Those moody areas, steel blues, sort of uh, dark uh, uh, tones, your coppers and even sort of your golden colours. 75 carats, one of the most limited acquisitions, launches, quite frankly, that we've ever actually brought to you. Cal Sedney, make uh, no doubt about this, Cal Sedney, we've brought you that in the past. However, it is usually treated. It is usually dyed. This isn't. It's all natural, which is, I love to hear the stories as well. I love to hear the history of this fascinating gemstone. The clock's run out, Dave. But I tell you what, this is going to be history. This is going to disappear. Look, we might get it back, we might not. It is one of those exciting moments. Do you know what we're going to do? We're going to do something crazy. Bigger carrot weight, isn't it? Big gem. Yes. Okay, £19.99. I said I'm going one big crash. That's what we're doing. This show is going to take it a little turn right now. And it's those what of you that you are here... What did you discuss when you went in there? I went in there and I said, we looked at how many people missed out on the first one. We saw how busy it is and we said, maybe you're waiting, maybe you're worried, maybe you're concerned. We understand there's no split pair. We're like, right, let's go, let's go flat low on everything. If you want to own one of everything, if you want to own two or three pieces, if you want to just get one, but you want to multiply it, then get involved. This is going to be the way the whole show is going to go now. Just like okay. What? Regardless, we are going to these rock bottom deals, these rock bottom prices on everything. Which means it's going to be extremely fast. It's going to be extremely competitive. Nothing has changed. You're still getting that incredible material. Richard, well done. You just got three of these. Yeah, You're well, not the only yeah. one. This is what happens. We're at 19 pounds. Yeah, that's crazy. 75 carats of the legendary natural uh, uh, blue chalcedony. I was not expecting this, Dave, at all. I, and, and nor should I either. Um, unbelievable. The reality is, Dave, I've brought chalcedony strands are died yeah, at 1999. Sure. Mm -hmm. You know, this isn't that. And it's, but this it's talks to that. that thing again that I always talk about. If, if we do get a great deal, you get a great deal. And um, today we are honoring that. This is what we do. This is all we do. And you are getting your opportunity right now at 1999 to acquire Madness. this beautiful blue cow sedney. Do you know, I'm really feeling that like this would be beautiful with some of your amazing pearls. Oh, yeah. Like I love the idea. Because it's Another got that kind of Another gemstone revered uh, by, the, um, by, by the, the, the Romans as well, the pearl. Do you know what? I'm going to go again. I'll take a 30-second clock. I'm going to go again. I don't even know where I can go from here, but let's say, do it. because you could literally make... You know, we have... We have Less a... than 40 of these ever were made for you. Yes. If this were... I mean, oh, actually, re rephrase that question. Are you putting this on gems? No. 
Do you not have the quantity? Well, you know, everything we got is here. Like I said, we haven't even got 50 quantities today. We haven't even got 40 quantities. No, yeah. Very limited. Like I said, we wanted to act really fast. We wanted to get this for you. I think the best thing would to, to do for me would to be buy one of each or something and mix the different shapes. Yeah, lovely. Mix that, create that organic, wonderful shape. I like uh, that. Uh, in your necklace. Well. Right, okay, uh, 14 99 It's well, crazy. £14.99. And then what we're going to do is we're going to give you a minute clock to close out on this deal. I, I, you said earlier on, and this is, there's a reason why I, t I gave that reference to the Prava Tourmaline story yeah. earlier on. That gentleman that bought like an, an oil, oil drum, drum yeah. for, for a lot grand. of money, yeah. hundred grand. But in the grand scheme of things, oh, it's not. Yeah, exactly. You know that we might be right there, right there, right now. Absolutely, and and you know we, we're always doing our best, but we're never really in this position very often, where no. we are first to, to, to bring something to market, or at least one of the first. And and usually when that happens, you get. Um, you get to be able to control the price. Right? Yeah. You, get to, you get the monopoly on the price, but we're not. We're just giving you the best deals. And you look, you've got 30 seconds right now. You've got 15 pounds to acquire uh, one of the most important, one of the most beautiful chalcedonies that has ever been. It, it really is beautiful, isn't it? It's that, I just love the mixture and the natural colors that you're getting within. Um, 14.99, madness. I'll be joining you on this because I think it'll be absolutely gorgeous with mm -hmm. some really lovely, uh, lovely white pearls. 10 seconds. Good 10 luck. seconds remaining. Good luck. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Make sure you do check out because, yeah, oh, I think it's gone. Okay. Um, okay. Oh, these beautiful shapes. I love, we, I love the jewellery that's been made up, I think, yeah. uh, showcasing, you know, perfectly what I was talking well, about. We're mixing that. the different uh, shapes, mixing the, the, the different pieces, showcasing that wonderful colour and those earthy tones coming through. Consistently translucent blue coloration here. Phenomenal material. Good luck to those of you that are getting involved. This, again, is going to be extremely limited, as you can imagine. Wow. Um, we've got Claire coming up in the masterclass with some what we call bezel strips, sterling oh, wow. silver sheets that you could literally just frame each and every single one of these. Treat them as cabochons if you like. They don't have to be uh, stranded. So if you stay with us in the 12 o'clock hour, Claire can actually demonstrate that using these as individual solitaires, whatever the shape. This has been extremely popular on pre-order, so loads of you are already getting involved on this one. I love them. I think they're absolutely beautiful. I, I, you, you're taking it to a price point I never even imagined, Dave. Like, like uh, Ross and I were actually saying, you know, we thought this was going to be split pay. We thought that, you know, and I wasn't even thinking 49, Ross. I was thinking triple figures because, you know, natural Cal Sedney, just, it, it, we don't see it. We don't ever see it. You know, I'm thinking about uh, once upon a time, you know, images stick with you. Um, Eva Longoria, the actress, was wearing Chalcedony on the red carpet and they were dyed. They were dyed Chalcedonies. Do you think they were 98 pounds? Do you think they were 29.99 or 19.99? Or what would we just do something silly like 14 pounds and 99 pence? We have only got 45 opportunities of this one though. Um, has been incredibly popular, this shape on the pre-order. So every single one of this amazing launch. Just to let you know, I'm gonna shout because I don't have a microphone right now. Okay. Quickly. Uh, I'm gonna stand with you. Yeah, come and stand with me, I'll yeah. Share your microphone for one second. Yep. But I am gonna promise everything right now under 20 pounds. Everything under 20 pounds in the whole show. Um, and have we already done a minute clock? I'll take a no. minute clock on this piece and I'm gonna give you a killer deal. Well done to those. I've got Linda who's just bought four, Devon's mm. bought two, Richard's bought two. In a minute's time, I'm gonna get a mic now and then uh, we'll give you a killer deal. <laughs> no worries. Oh, did you just say that? Every calcium. You didn't mean all strands though, did you? Every single strand. Every single strand? Yeah. So I can, sh of calcedony, uh, so I can shop ahead, way under 20 pounds. I can get like five strands on. Five strands for You can't now because you're going to miss out. Yeah, true. There is that. Unfortunately. Uh, hopefully you can hear me now. Um, we or hear you. Or maybe you're like, you know what, unfortunately we can hear you now, Dave. But we are going Never. under £20 on everything. And in 20 seconds you're going to see that even though this is 75 carats, even though this is proving to be the most popular. And we can easily see why. I think this lends itself perfectly to kind of that, that kind of... Um, motto, you know, less is more, you know, whether yeah, one of those beautiful. used as a bicolor pendant, whether you're talking about a pair of, you know, uh, 
earrings. Now, you wouldn't match the earrings. You'd have earrings that complement one another. Yeah. Framing the face. They're not meant to match each, uh, yeah. each other. If they did, then you'd know they were. 1999. 1999, last 14. Crazy. Apologies, apologies, apologies. It's going to be wild. It's going to be busy. Uh, and you can see why. Yeah, absolutely. That's what happens when you Shop give away ahead. Jewelry. Do shop ahead. Uh, Patricia's messaged you, Dave, saying, wow, these are just breathtaking. Love, love, love. And that's Patricia in Hull. A new watcher. Uh, Amazing. Patricia, don't expect this every week. <laughs> yeah, we can't new. do this don't every week. Don't think this is what we do. Don't think I'm an archaeologist. I'm Indiana Jones. We're going to these excavation sites. Uh, but if you want to keep up to date with anything new that is coming up, you know, uh, I'm on social media, David Harry Jules on social media and, and, and you know, always posting the new finds that we are discovering them. Just um, in, in less than a week's time, going to be flying out to Tucson in Arizona. Yeah, exciting. The world's biggest uh, gemstone show. So I'm going to be going live from there every day, showing you all the new discoveries and all the new finds. So it is David Harry Jules on uh, Facebook and Instagram if you want to follow along. But it's amazing to have you as part of the family, Patricia. I would welcome. as well, Patricia. If you're on social media, give them a follow because you get a lot of amazing updates literally live from Tucson. Um, we had another message then, didn't we? Sorry. Yeah, none of us read. Um, was that from Caroline? I think it was Caroline. Caroline in Greater Manchester? Yes. Yes. Uh, there Dave, you, go. you have a good eye, a great nose for sniffing out these gems. My collection is growing. My kids will love you in the future. Oh, <laughs> that's very kind, uh, Caroline. Um, just we, we, like you and, and like all of us here, we absolutely love finding these new discoveries, finding exciting, incredible gemstones. Richard, you've just bought three of these. these Mandy, are you've got it. Maker in Lancashire, you've got it. Minute clock. Remember, if, if, you know, if you missed it, because I didn't have a microphone a moment ago, I'm going to say it right now. I think it was sabotage on Ross's part. I think he's like, he's going rogue. You're going to cut the cord on his mic and make sure he can't say anything. But I found a way around it. But just so you know, everything in the whole show, even this exquisite piece I love this you, is going under £20. Everything. Oh, my goodness um, me. Dave, can you imagine these in earrings? But also, can you imagine them in the bottom of a tassel or something? Yeah. Or like a lariat style. For sure. For so sure. elegant. Quite 1920s. I've got kind of Empire State Building vibe going on. Yeah. And we're talking it. about... Yeah, talking about... Yeah, yeah. Very, very much so. What's that? You've got that 1920s. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Amazing. We see lots of random people walking around, don't we? Uh, across that glass promenade up there. People I didn't recognise. Was that who I thought it was? Who was that? I don't know. Go on, you can say, you can full name someone, it doesn't matter. <laughs> you can say it. I don't mind. Was that a previous employee? Oh, I don't know. I don't you know. probably shouldn't have said that. No. I mean, that's, I mean, <laughs> Have some decorum. <laughs> you know, don't forget where you are. I didn't know. I didn't see, but don't say things like that. <laughs> um, God, that's thrown me. 14 um, Yeah, let's do it. What have we done? What have we done? Okay. <sighs> that's a current employee. Uh, yes. But we there love was someone him. else with them, wasn't there? We love him. We love him. But yeah. there was someone else with him. I'm talking about Mark, am I? Someone else with him. That... There are, it's very busy today. It's quite distracting, isn't it? Or just a oh, it doesn't peripheral take much, vision. It doesn't take much for us no, to get true. distracted. I don't know why we have that big glass window before us. Fourteen ninety nine. Tracy, Mandy, Carol, Lancashire, Richard, you're there as well. Um, if you know, if if we went quiet there, it's because we were just like mouthing <laughs> to each other, which you can imagine, of course, just gossiping. <laughs> gossiping. Uh, but we're at fourteen ninety nine. I mean, it's yeah, ridiculous, incredible. It deal. is well ridiculous. Done. This is my favourite shape, Dave. I like this one. I like these a lot. And again, look at Anne and Sue. Everything under created. twenty pounds. I know. I love it. Amazing. This is why I said earlier. I think mixing those wonderful shapes, mi mixing the different sizes, gives you know. That, that kind of aesthetic that we kind of desire with this wonderful oh. ancient, and that's the term as well, ancient material. Yes, yes. Let's do the triangle, shall we? Yeah, let's do that. Or trillions, whichever. I know technically they're not. Oh. Minute clock. Tessellate Minute these. clock. Remember, everything is extremely limited, less than 40 of everything available. And if we do run out, we've got something really special coming your way towards the very end of the show. But for now, I'll try and get anything wow. we can in this incredible showcase. Dave, when you were talking about the um, the palace itself, and you, t you mentioned about the, uh, the mosaics, yes. And yeah. um, the mosaics all perfectly preserved by Getty himself. You know, that's this is the kind of shapes that I was thinking. You can literally uh, sort of tessellate them together. So beautiful, aren't they? Look at that. Look how ethereal they are. Beautiful colors. It's a, I can't believe you've made this promise under 20 pounds. That's just, just, just madness. And we're going to want to. You're regretting it now. Yeah. 
Yeah. I am. Wow. But uh, I'm a huge fan of this shape. I think it really, really plays into the translucency of this material. Um, as you can see, it gives you that kind of window yeah. into the soul of the gemstone. The light is able to pass through. I think it lends itself to a wonderful suite. Uh, 14 99 Crazy. Hang on. Two, four, 14 pounds six, and 99 pounds. eight, ten, eleven. But they're all perfectly paired as well. So if you wanted to make these into, I don't know, sort of five pairs of earrings, you could do that. Yeah. Um, so easily. At literally a few pounds. Guys, we're at 14 pounds. It's and mad. Yeah, I'm not even messing around. Can we just do a minute clock to close this auction? Yeah. 15 pounds. 15 You can get, certain, no disrespect, certain Jaspers go for that price tag point. I Not mean, a gemstone. That, that would be amazing. I want about the fake stuff, the costume jewellery. Yeah, true. That you see in the supermarkets on the concessions. True. The Hello Kitty earrings, the phone charms <laughs> that are like 15 pounds. And the here break we are. after five minutes. Yes. Yeah. And here we are with these and they turn your ears green. I don't yeah. know, my ears aren't pierced. I just tell my daughter that so I don't have to buy them. Yeah. Um, turn your ears green. Your ears going to drop off. I can't get that. Um, here we are, 14, 19, <laughs> 34 seconds. Good luck. Tracy, Julie, You're Maker, so right, Dorset, though. Maker, Maker, Susan. This is outrageous what's taking place. This it, it literally is. I'll and be honest, it's because we're completely distracted here in the studio. We, yeah, that's probably my There's fault. There's people Sorry, knocking Dave. about. There's... That's about a pound. Just, it's not just over a pound per individual solitaire stone. Yeah. You know, if these were, I don't know, let's be conservative and say finished in sterling silver rather than in your gold. Yeah. With no additional accent. Yeah, yeah, stone. yeah. You know, it's not going to be fourteen ninety nine. Well, just it? the one, one at the piece. bottom. Let's say the best price ever would be thirty pounds on gems. Yes. Um, well done, and, and Claire's on. got those bezel strips as well oh, to yeah. show you in the next hour, in the 12, sorry, 12 o'clock hour. Um, amazing, amazing, amazing. Make sure you check out. So why, I mean, uh, there's no point waiting. Don't wait for me or Elle or for us to show you the piece. I've told you, Shop it's ahead. Going under 20 pounds. Everything is available online this is cool. or the app or however you want to do it. Uh, 75 carats. Guess what? Less than 40 of these available. This is my favorite now. Yeah, this and is You're going to see why. Adam's going to show you exactly why this is my favorite. This is how we value a gemstone, that wonderful, natural, beautiful, powder blue color, the, the, the wonderful, rich secondary tones coming through, the translucency, which is evident, the, the unique and wonderful shape. And I, actually, this is the one that I wish we had at least 100 of. Before. Yeah. Would this I, be the star buy if we did have that? Quantity? Let's make it a star buy. Yeah. Regardless of the quantity, let's make it a star buy. There isn't many, says... Uh, no, no, it's not a star buy in terms of quantity. In fact, it's not star buy in terms of anything I can do in terms of the deal. We're already rock bottom price. <laughs> but let's just make it a star buy. Good luck. <laughs> star buy. Uh, you're at 98 pounds. That's your star buy. Well done. Congratulations. <laughs> Let's do a minute clock. Let's do a minute clock. Let's get this deal really locked in for you. Greater London, you've bought three. Dorset, again, you've bought three. What yeah. You've got a better collection than John Paul Getty had right now. Yeah, I think I said that's it. the thing. Um, and I bet he paid more than, more than he did. £20. I think he did. I think he might have done. Mandy, Helen, Maker in Lancashire, Tracy in Norfolk, Linda in Hampshire, Yvette, you've just joined us. You were in the queue, but now you've confirmed. Well done. Mandy, it's open for you to do the same. Uh, June, you've just jumped on the phone lines as well. Well done. Um, this is, is I mean, look, I'll go live every day from Tucson for you until they throw me out of the show because I don't think I'm meant to do that, but I'm going to do it. And I'm going to find the people Are you that talking have on Facebook or are you Facebook on our show? I'll go live on your show, whatever, yes. I don't care. I'll, I will do whatever we can and I'll take you and we'll find this material and we'll see what the price is at wholesale, at trade. That's how confident I am uh, with the deals we're doing. That's why the trade are on the phone lines right now. Uh, Norfolk, you've just jumped yep. on the phone lines. Eight seconds. I can't believe you're, you're promising under £20. And these are beautiful. I love this shape. I agree with you, David. It's lovely. Look at that. It's, it's more the colour and the translucency, yeah. but I yeah, agree yeah. the shape is stunning. Keith, you've just jumped on the phone lines. £98 we're at right now. Um, how about £14.99? £14.99. That is, I mean, it's too good to be true, but it's real, it's natural. It's certified. You can print your authenticity certificate. Caroline in the Channel Islands, you've just jumped on the phone lines. Well done. There's eight individual statement solitaires. Statement, yeah, solitaires, yeah. You know, they're big stones, aren't they? We're not talking about teeny weeny piddly carrot weights here. Um, Gloria and Stafford just saying, incredible, love them. Um, I'm setting into silver clay. Wow. Amazing. What do you do with that? So silver, silver clay, clay is it's purer than 925, and wow. it literally comes like a paste. Mm -hmm. 
So uh, Gloria is obviously going to make some amazing one of a kind design. Amazing. Yeah. So not not like a Do calibrated mount. Yeah. Oh wow. So not like a calibrated mount. Gloria will literally make it. High, send that into the Wall of Fame so we can then show. Um, we can show. Dave. I've never seen the Wall of Fame. You talk about it all the time. Have you I'm not? Like, didn't you in the olden days? Didn't we actually Wait, have a we physical need to wall? Eight didn't we have a physical wall in the we olden days? We used to. Yeah. Bring it back. I agree. All this digital stuff. I've never seen. I it. agree. I agree. Make sure you tune in at eight o'clock. Having said that, we didn't, do, we haven't done it yet. We're doing it at midday today okay. because we had a few technical issues. Normally it's at eight o'clock in the morning. Um, but yeah. I never get to see your designs. Some of you do post them to me on social media, but I never get to see them. Uh, it's like you guys hide them from me, but I want to see them. I want, I've got all that shelving space over there. Yeah. With like just cookie jars of like gemstones. Rip it off. Get some pictures, frames on there with everyone's designs. Let's We're see with them. You. I'm with you, Dave. I'm but with you. yeah, I digress. We've both been guilty of that today. <laughs> this piece now, bicolor, which is wonderful. Love it. Translucent, powder blue, tra uh, 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 natural, 100% natural, from the Anatolian mountains, like from an ancient shape. deposit that the Romans were, were huge, huge advocates of. I mean, they were trading for this material. And now you get the opportunity. We're in double figures. Let's do a minute clock. How amazing. Thank you, Adam. I love that. They are like little windows. It's Don't play a game. Let's play it? Guess the Price. I wonder where it's yeah. going to be because it's been so random, hasn't it? It's, there's been no uniformity. But it shouldn't be it. under 20, firstly. No. You know when you look at like a window opal? Yes. And you kind of, it's like, it's like you're on another planet, the spring planet, running it? through it, the cord running through it, just yeah. like we could with the pieces at Christie's. I absolutely love how, how beautiful the, the um, earthy tones, yeah. you know, how, how beautifully kind of random they are, how asymmetrical they are. Some of them look like these wonderful scatterings. Some of them are like bicolors. It's like piebald, chalcedony. Carol, you're in. Guess what? Richard in Dorset, you're back in. Congratulations. Christina in Cornwall, you're in. I want these. I think they're really cool. I love that lovely shape as well. Um, again, it, it, what do we call that shape? Half I, I, I don't know. But I love it. They're cut for the beauty of the, yeah, of the stone, sure. isn't it? Yeah. Highlighting the translucency in those patterns. Six seconds, Dave. Mm -hmm. It has been so surprising today. Mm -hmm. £14.99. £14.99. Hmm. Which is phenomenal. It really is. Look at that. I, I, I don't know why. I really want to see them some big statement Keshis or something like that. Oh, yeah. I mean, yeah something else organic. And, uh, you know, different, in shape, yeah. asymmetrical, like you said, keshis, maybe souffle pills, maybe baroques. Oh, yeah. Because you call it half moon, but it's, 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 it's more of a baroque, I think. You know, it's um, that kind of... You're, you're talk speaking of pearls, I was, uh, the, our viewers know this. The other day, so I'm sat talking about the... Minute clock to close pearls. out this deal. Sorry, guys. Apologies. I think it was one of your strands, Dave. Yeah. Tom, uh, Tom, Tom from Worcestershire came and bought them for me, didn't oh they? Oh my, what a what romantic. A good, I know, he's a what good What a guy. One of, there's some of your pills as well. They'd look beautiful with this strand, wouldn't they? Yeah. Oh, Absolutely damn. amazing. Um, this is to the clock to the auction ending, jewelry makers, so do make sure you check out. Um, you are about to have the penultimate. Yes. So, uh, this was probably one of the smallest parcels that we've ever acquired. Yeah, like I said, you want to get in early. Sometimes we wait. We'll be like, okay, can you make 100 or 200 of these? Yeah. But the, the problem with waiting is, especially with Tucson closing in so fast, yeah. if this hits the market, it, it affects the price, and I didn't want to take that risk. So I said, we'll take what you've got now, and we'll see the guys in Tucson. But in all honesty, Dave, by bringing them to a pre-Tucson as well, you know... Um, well done. The, the the world around us could uh, uh, could be, be, could be seeing those price tags. That's why I said the Prava story yeah, earlier. No, on. I get it. It's completely. Uh, um, the last, last two, two strands, pieces, yeah. super popular on pre-order. Yeah. Well done to you guys. Oh God, it is actually. Great London, you've bought three of these already. So what I said, don't wait for us. That's the beauty of us being having that facility to be able to pre-order or the app or however you guys do it. And that's brilliant actually here, more so than even on Gems. You guys are so a fay and, and with the app and the web that you know, we kind of negate the cues, especially when something's this busy. A lot of you do check out on the web and the app, which is great. I love these colours. Me too. Absolutely love these colours. These last two, and I would use them together, Dave. Yeah, show them, yeah. Look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you imagine just literally alternating those mm -hmm. two 100%. to recreate that necklace? Hundred percent. Oh, that. Let's be do so a minute gorgeous. clock. Okay, you know what I'm doing, so I'd buy both right now. In yeah. fact, can I say this right now, Ross? Sorry Wait. if this is a problem. You can get both of these for under thirty. I knew it. You were going to say that. 
Do you know, I posted something on my social media the other day. You, I think you saw it, actually, which was like uh, old fashioned saying. Yeah. And like had a lot of fun with it. A lot of people saying some really funny old things. A lot of them I hadn't seen before. I was thinking this morning, I, I saw, uh, well, I was tricked this morning. I was driving to work and I've got this thing where I have to salute magpies. You know, yeah, I do that yeah. too. And I'd been caught out by a bird that was not a magpie. And it was <laughs> annoying, you know, because I saw it flying. I always have to do it because it'll be on my mind all day. And I did it and I saw it as like some sort of pigeon or something. I was like, oh, I'm so annoyed. It happens every now and again. Um, he tricked me. Um, and good for him, he did it. It's fine. <laughs> but do, do any of you guys... Right now, that right pigeon's now? like that. Yeah. No, oh, was a magpie. He's a magpie, didn't you? Yeah. <laughs> 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 but I wanted to ask you guys, have you got any other, uh, any weird superstitions? Another one I've got, and I don't even think this is a superstition, I think it's just a OCD thing, isn't it? You, you probably see, I always f flick off the plug switches everywhere. Mm. If they're in the on position, not when something's plugged in, that would be annoying for people, but... <laughs> yeah, watching like, and TV, hospitals and Dave things just like turn it off. <laughs> but I'm on about like, uh, just when I see a, a vacant plug and it's on. Yeah, I do that. Off, and I have loads of things, loads of weird kind of yeah, things. Yeah, like yeah. When I lock the door at home, I check it like seven times. I'm going to break the handle at some point because <laughs> I know it's locked. I locked it. I don't, I think, don't think that's, that's, that's OCD. It might yeah, not be. It might be a superstition thing or whatever. Conscious. Yeah, maybe. It's, conscious. It's annoying. But if any of you guys have any, 14.99 by the way. Oh my Sorry. goodness. I've just put this together. I mean, I just seem to so happen to find. I know. Is that what I think it is? Yeah, that is 100% natural. It's very limited. Type A honey jade eye. I'm going to make... I'm just gonna so you know, uh, Elle, I've never, ever offered that for sale next door. That's what, how the I honey, yeah. honey jade eye? The only people that have ever had that are the people here at Jewelry Maker. And what? that is your oh. legendary ice white type that's, A jade eye. That's the best I've ever seen. And me. And me. Ever. Usually it has a secondary colour. Yeah. Uh, minute clock, sorry, Adam, uh, to close this out. Apologies. Well, we're bringing you this strand literally as your finale. And get your superstitions in up. or your, your weird little traits. Do you have any? Else? Um, superstitions. I don't step on the cracks either. Oh, Willow does that with me. Mummy, stop stepping on the... I'm not bothered about that. Um, right, with the magpies, similar to the magpies, but I say the rhyme. Yeah, yeah, so do I. Well, well I don't actually... No, I don't do that. that I mean, that's... I know. Long-winded. Is that... I, just, I actually say something that's nothing. I just say, salute Mr. Magpie, which is strange. <laughs> like, like it's a children's TV programme or something. <laughs> And I do that, so I salute it, and then I, I don't know where this comes from. It's just something I've done forever. And then I have to break the circle. I don't know, oh. that must be part of a rhyme. Maybe. So I salute it, and then I do that. But like, if someone's in the car with me, I do it. I, you know, it's on the snide, so I just do that, and just do that. But so they, <laughs> they don't know. Style it out. Just, but they don't know, I just go out. <laughs> Let's do the last one. Yeah, Let's do it. the last one. This white. Fourteen ninety nine. No clock. No nothing. Fourteen ninety nine. You know, I said both of them under thirty. Mass hundred carats. Sorry. Uh, oh, sorry, Ross. Oh dear. Sorry, Ross. Ups are days. We're gonna do it anyway. That is Ups a nightmare, and I apologise. You guys knew that was coming. You knew like that I'd made an, an, a grave no, error here. Right. Yeah, I've made a yeah, mistake. Look, I've made a ahead, mistake. Haven't they? So uh, they've shot ahead. I uh, not so much su superstitions. I can't leave things on the floor. Like if there's, I can't leave clothes and things if I go to bed. Yeah, that's good. I have to pick it all up. That's good. That's really good. It's, I don't know if it's, it's superstition, so. Does Tom have any? He likes to leave things on the floor. Oh, yeah. You, <laughs> opposites attract. Takes yeah. to compliment each other so well. Yeah, basically. Ross, Adam, you guys have any? I don't know. I probably do. Everyone must, right? Everyone's weird. Um, Adam won't walk over drains. That's a, yeah, me too. Uh, three, I won't walk over. Two, I will. Three drains? What's three drains three unlucky. Drain Two drains is good luck, yeah, good luck, I think. Is it? That's what I've heard. Under a ladder, obvious, but I don't think, again, that's superstition. That's just, I think yeah, that's, that's just, sense. just Yeah, that's just <laughs> being conscientious of the guy up there. But. You what, sorry? You have to roll over the third drain, literally. <laughs> what do you mean, roll over the third drain? He does a little cat and bolt. <laughs> oh, yeah, imagine. <laughs> 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 That's a good one. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So I hope that Ross. catches on. Um, we're going to do some what? Ross is desperately trying to get us back to the gym. Yeah, sorry, mate. I'm Bless sorry. you, Ross. Um, okay, we're going to do this this tea bar of absolute. Oh, look at them all together. Okay, though. right Seriously. now, right now, I just want you all to know. Congratulations. Let's do a thirty second clock to close this auction, if that's all right, Adam. Yeah. Although I think it's already sold out. Might not have done. Caroline in the Channel Islands, you got three. Caroline Devon, you got two. Linda in Hampshire, you got two. Richard got three. Anne got two. Thirty second clock to close this out. Good luck. And then, uh, oh, yeah, you, you did. Uh, uh, show everyone the wonderful um, honey jade up. I'm going to show you something right now. The reason I'm making a point of showing this, I know we showed the white jade out as well. You see this wonderful 
graduated Taipei so multicolored jadeite. And by the way, this color here is as close as we will ever get as collectors to imperial green. Mm -hmm. It's all translucent, it's all amazing crystallizations. You've also got the honeys in here as well. Um, this is a massive, massive closeout. In fact, I'm gonna be as bold to say, this has to sell out today. Has, has to. to go today. Does it though? You send the mood on me. You send it's the mood true. on me. You, yeah, yeah. Even though we've got the honey, even though we've got the white jade, this has to disappear today. So don't miss out on this. Oh. Massive, massive closeout. Well done to everyone who got involved in the wonderful uh, blue material. So we've got uh, 80 of these. It's a massive carat weight. It's 240 carats in total. As you can see, you've got all the wonderful colors. That's and it's so graduated. Um, I'm going to let you know right now. And the, re the only reason I'd say this is because of how good the deal is going to be. I'll hand it over to you, Al. Um, we launched this at £199. Which is awesome. Yeah, that's great. Absolutely awesome. We've also sold over 100 of them at that price, as you can imagine. Yeah. And I'm telling you that because that's not where I'm going today. Look at that. 82. We know how busy it is. We know how many of you are watching. Look at how beautiful that is. It's even, even if you just restranded that. Yeah. Look how beautiful. Mm -hmm. It is like the Mason K colour wheel, isn't it? Yeah, that's, that's the, 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 the kind of route we went down. We wanted to bring you all the colours in one, uh, you know, one incredible auction, which is what you've got here. 240 carats, 82 chances available. I'm going to bring the graphics in right now. I'm going to bring this available to every single one of you right now. Translucent, incredible, top crystallisation, type A uh, jadeite from Manmar. The material you can't get anymore. You've got the kingfisher green, mm. you've got the apple green, you've got the white jadeite, you've got the russet tones, you've got the honeys, you've got the graduation of sizes, you've got the wet look finish, the polish, you've got the translucency, and it's a massive monumental watershed moment, a closeout deal that we're going to go and do today. I've said to you, it has to go today, it's going. So are you suggesting then, Dave, that this is maybe multi-viable? Um, I'm saying to you right now that it absolutely should be a multi-buy opportunity. In fact, I think anywhere else in the world, something like this is about, you'd be lucky to get, even wholesale for me. Yeah. Two and a half grand. Really? Yeah, easy. I mean, that's wholesale, by the way. So I'd have to sell that, I don't know, for three, three and a half. Yeah. So let's go to two and a half thousand pounds if that's okay, Ross. Okay. And, and that's, that price is going up every single day. I want to see 82 of you on the finance. If you trust, I closed this. I sold over 100 of these at 199 pounds, which was an amazing deal. Today, it was a year ago. I'm good. Yeah, today I'm going to go absolutely rogue. I pulled this from the vault. I brought it in for you. I've got 82 could... available. I'm telling you everything you need to know, everything you wanted to know. Is it natural? Yes, yeah, Taipei. Is it Myanmar? Yeah. Is it Jade? Yes. Is that Imperial Green? Not quite, but it's borderline. Apple green, kingfisher green, graduation of sizes, wet look material, white, russet, and green uh, uh, colors. The color wheel, essentially, the yellows, the honeys. Uh, Dave, 82 available, 240 carats, literally sorry. Literally just shy of a year. Yeah. We, we earlier on did a major closeout deal on some pearls, and we were like, this has got to be like better than like your Black Fridays, your Cyber Mondays. You what know, day is it today? Wednesday. It's Wednesday. Is there a good name for that? Um, Wild Wednesday. Wild Wednesday. Let's call it that. It's Wild Wednesday. Wild Wednesday. Um, this is your deal. This is your one-time deal. I don't do deals like this very often, for those of you that tune into my shows, particularly you, Patricia, if you're brand new. This isn't something you can expect. This is out of the ordinary. I'll give you a minute clock. If you trust me, you're on the phone lines now. I've got someone trying to buy there. nine of these. Well done. I'm, I'm totally, totally there. I would not even reference. Genuinely, you know this. I, I don't legally have to tell you that I've bought this to you before. I, you know, I don't have to say, hey guys, this was on a year ago. No. I'm just say, look at this incredible, I'm telling you, because I'm not just going to beat Christie's and Bonhams, I'm going to beat my own jewellery maker price on this. So, by a mile. Um, and a year ago, yeah. when it was, was more available. accessible, it, yes. it, was, it was available, it was available. It was available, you launched it at 199, which is madness. Yeah. Now, even though now it's not accessible, no. you're closing it out. I am closing it out, and do you know what? I, I've, uh, I've got a jade weekend coming up next door mm -hmm. in Jampura. Nothing like this. I had jade the weekend prior. That's so the weekend just gone. Nothing like this. We very rarely get the opportunity to own the multicolor variety because it's more lucrative to the wholesaler, to the dealer, to actually sell them singularly, as we are here. Honey, all together. White, all together. all together. But to put all these different colors together. Can you, but you know what, Ross? Well, let's go to 199. 
which is my clothes price, that this is sold at. That's the, and like, not like a few, I'm talking 100. And I want to see all 82 of these allocated right now. Yeah, me too. And I will do you a crazy, crazy low close out one time deal. Put me Never down for two. Never will this be on your screen. Yeah, go for it. I'd have two of these and I'd be literally creating like a rope. Yeah. Like a long line. You'd be mad not to. Head. You'd be mad not to buy two of these. And I'm saying that to you as a friend. I can't, I can't say that to you guys at home. I can't say you should multiply on this. But if, you, if you're my friend and I'm saying, and you're asking me, yeah. I'm just going to tell you, yeah, you should be, the deal I'm about to do on this, you should be buying two. And there's a collector on the front line too. They're trying to buy 10. That's fine. You've got to yeah. check them out though. I had, I had 82 available. I don't have that anymore. No, absolutely not. This colour, th this strand is, it's memorable, isn't it? And, yeah. and I think you said earlier on, you know, that particular, the, the strong, deep green mm -hmm. um, is the closest we'll ever get to actually have an imperial green on our shows. For sure. It's what we call oil green or green dragon jade eye. Um, I'll take a minute clock. I'm, I'm just, I'm going to shout to you right now. I am going to take off a massive amount. Do I'm you not kidding. 10%? I'm not, I'm not trying to mislead you. I'm telling you. Why is this price on your screen? Because that's what we sold over 100 of these out at. Yeah. Why am I telling you that? Because I am going to destroy the price. It's a closeout. Sometimes these happen. This is something that is irrepeatable. I'm not even going to talk about price. I'm not even going to say, oh, if I had to bring this back, it might cost me three grand. I'm saying we won't bring it back. These multicolors, yeah. these incredible natural colors are not coming back. You've got half a minute to capitalize on this. I'm saying that because I'm going to take this to a rock bottom price and every single one of you that isn't already confirmed and I guess is going to, to miss out. I need another 20 of you on the front lines before I do this. By the way, I'm gonna, you know, at the very least, just so you know, at the very least, I'm gonna be halving the price. Oh my goodness. Of my own price. That's, That's why you were saying do. multi buy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's so, uh, so, uh, Adam, if it's I don't want to be too annoying, but could we put an extra 30 seconds on again? Because I've told you I'm gonna I'm gonna at the very least I'm gonna half the price. I need to see another 25 year on the phone. So you are talking about Yeah, you know. You know. Double figures. You guys at home know. That's why everybody's yeah. all of a sudden said, well, I'll have two. Good look. Three. Uh, that's much. why that collector who wanted to get ten, I'll do wow. it. Wow. So yeah, all of a sudden, that's what Dave was hinting at, wasn't he? And I, and I didn't want to say it out loud. Can you imagine if you are able to multi-buy, knotting this continuous over the top of the head necklace? Um, oh, can you imagine that piece? With, with the reds, with those beautiful shades of green, with that level of translucency, with the pure whites. Double figure price tag. This very well, very well might be a sackable offence, okay? Just to let you know that right <laughs> I now. I hope not. Well, it is what it is. You know, we, we, we live by the sword, we die by the sword, don't we? And that's what we do. We like to make it busy, we like to make it fun. We've lost our minds this morning. But it's live TV. It's not always the most professional, the most no. gracious. It is what it is. We're, we're friends, right? Listen, I've seen Steve Steve do lunges with, in, with pants on. It is over oh, trousers. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Whatever you do in your private life. No, is, is on, on gym. Oh, okay. He lunges in his pants. He was selling pants. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, I, I, the only reason I asked is I saw him topless yesterday on his Instagram. Did you? Working out in the snow. <laughs> Honestly, he's like, he's like the liver king. Um, to every single one of you right now, I'm going to destroy the price. And I told you that. I said, at the very least, I'm going to halve it. You're all there. You're waiting for it. It's in your basket. You know that bit where it says, buy now? Just get your mouse hovered over it. OK, I'm serious. OK. And it's, uh, you, know, you don't have to, but just be ready. What's he saying? That's the Nearing. launch. Oh, that's, the, that's the launch. It's the only price we've ever done it at. £199. What's he saying? 240 for 240 carats, carats yeah. for Taipei grade. You're right, Ross. And today, <coughs> bless Excuse you. Excuse me. <laughs> 79.99. Oh my goodness. Good look. Good look. That's it. It's crazy. It's wild. It's Wild Wednesday. Um, we're only going to do this once a year, Wild Wednesday. Some of, yeah, that's what I like that. Let's make it an annual thing. Yeah. Let's do it. Make it an annual thing. So I can buy two with change. You should buy two. Yeah. You should buy two. Oh my goodness. And with your postage as well included. How beautiful is this strand? God almighty. 39.99. What am I doing? Well... Just saying. That's a, that, is, that is a sackable offence. They might, you know, be lenient with me. I don't know, but uh, that in any <laughs> Ross of says for all of us. You that's, but honestly, and you're probably me. thinking that's funny, Dave, and everything. Of course, they're not going to sack me, but I'm saying it is, it is a sackable offence. <laughs> like, they're not going to, but it is a, that is more than grounds needed for dismissal. Like, if they want to. If you worked to. at BMW and you went, oh, that car, it's usually 60 grand, but. Let's uh, give us 30. 30 grand today. <laughs> It's true. <laughs> Let me get out. Get Any, out. Any of the professionals. 
Yeah. Boop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's usually two quid. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just give me 50p. Today. Yeah. <laughs> and this isn't like come from the top down. Like that's fine if Tesco say, actually, mate, we're halving the price on this this week. That's just like an independent employee on the checkout making that decision for themselves. <laughs> just going, oh, half it, half it. Give you half off if you want. That's what that is. Get a club card. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I'm doing right now. As long as you scan your club card, yeah, that's good. what I'm doing right now. Um, but Ross is like, it literally makes no sense. It makes no sense. It also makes no money, is really what no, it's probably saying. I know. Plus uh, the Elle's, Elle's probably making it a bit nicer, but it makes <laughs> no money, is probably what he's screaming right now. <laughs> Which is fine, it's good. Uh, it's all good, Ross. Don't you worry. It's all good, mate. Don't you worry. I love the graphic. Well, I think, uh, Ross is in there right now when I said, oh, it's a sack of offense. He's going, I hope so. I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> Sending an email right now. <laughs> That's this. Oh, well. How many do we have left, Ross? Um, 30? 30? Are you having a laugh? Uh, oh, for real? <laughs> How? They should have gone. Right, let's do another clock. Second. Let's do another clock. Not a closeout Close. clock. No, 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 no. Give me the other one, another clock, what or whatever. You doing? This one, yeah. We we'll just you start all the right? clock. Not at all. No, I'm dosed up heavily on you know, painkillers right now. Oh, bless and, you. Yeah, it's fine. We, okay, we, so we, that's all right. Well, that's You're my excuse. That's what I'm going to use in the disciplinary meeting. <laughs> We're at 79.99. Where do you even go from here? I don't know. I'm making this up on the spot. We are doing it. It is for every single one of you. And just as I'm saying this, our finance director just walks past the window upstairs. Yeah, she did. With stay. a little smile on it her was face. A, it was a delayed stare. Yeah, with a little um, smile. Ross is also saying, I'm not doing anything until we see another 30 people on the phone. And then I need 30 people on the phone. Like yeah. that. That's what I need. Like, you know, help, help me out right now. We, I'm, I'm game to do it. I'm going to do it. But okay. Ross is quite right. He's, so, uh, he's, you don't you know, he's complicit in one. this, but he's saying, look, just, just let's see another 30 of you. See you there. You, even if you don't press your option one, that's how he justifies it, if, if heaven forbid. This is madness, is guys. I know we're all be having fun and we're all having a good time, and it is, it is fun. It is exciting. Yeah, I am just saying, aside. all joking aside right now, this is ludicrous what we're about. Oh, another minute. Yeah, let's do another minute clock. And how many do you want to see on the phone lines, Ross? 21 people, he okay. said. Before we start the clock, before we start the clock, I'm speaking to 21 of you that could take place in this auction. Thank you, Adam. Um, so, in thank you. I want to see 21 of you on the phone lines. I'm not asking you to check it out. I'm not, asking, I'm not asking you to buy it. Sorry? 14. 14 people on the phone lines. Start the clock right now. You we know what I do? See, By the way, you know, have... Ross, I never take £10 off. So, like, that's the other thing. I'm going to have to, regardless of the cost on this, regardless of everything, let's just do it. We are going to do it. 50 seconds. I need to see another 12 of you on the phone lines. I actually do. Otherwise, I'll just close this auction. Do you know what? It's a blooming good auction. Yeah. I close that, and it's like 199, and I've gone to 80 pounds. I'm happy with that. Oh, it's all good. Dear. But if we're if we're willing to all of us to get this today, I'll take a massive. Oh back dear. Off. Look at it. Look at look, look. You can feel the tension. Oh, Ross's hands is on his head. Adam's just there, just the passenger, just chilling. Just. <laughs> Yes. Yeah, all right. Well, you know. Well, like you, he's pretty dosed up as well. Oh, is he? Is he? Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Sorry to hear that, Adam. Richard, um, you got five of these. But Ross is lit. Oh, I, I can, I can almost hear yeah. the stress and anxiety mm, in his too. voice. Yeah, he's at boiling point. He says, "We're going to do it. They've got to sell out." Yeah, I agree. I agree. Four more people. Four, four more people. Four more people, and we can justify it. It's live TV. It's very different to a retail shop. If we can say, look, this is also very, people. also very different to any other live TV. This particular live TV. This, what we do is, I mean, you see live TV all the time at this time of day on the TV, and it's really professional and good and nice. And they have got their little cars. <laughs> you say we're not professional. And they, we're not, are we? We're not though. <laughs> like we're fun and we love it, but there's no, there's no, no moment of this. Can we call it professional? In no, the gallery, not. yeah, absolutely. And then the guys and the cameras and, and everyone doing that, that side of things. Fair. Very, very professional. It's me fair. and Al, what on earth are we doing? Who gave us microphones? <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Yeah. It's ridiculous. Um, ha, Ross, have we got enough or not? One person. One person I need. Al, get the app out. Goodness okay. sake, I'm just going to call the price. So just get the app out. You'll be the one person. Right you get it because we're going to make this happen. Right there. Righto. Um, hang on, I have to find it. Can I be that person? I'm literally going off. I don't the know. App now. Can she be that person? Can I do it or now? Is someone else there. What's he say? Come on then. I'm on. I'm on. Okay, I'm L's on. on. Okay, welcome, welcome to every single one of you. We're gonna go to sixty-five quid. Sixty-five pounds. It's outrageous. It's crazy. You're part of it. L's part of it. We're all part of it right now. We're going to sixty-five pounds. <gasps> it's 
240 carats. Yeah, of Taipei, multi Taipei, Jedi from Kachin State in Myanmar. My God. I know. There you go. Do that, is that a free phone number as well? That is a free phone telephone See, number. That's, that's where we're going wrong, especially when we're giving stuff away. We should at least have a premium rate number. Yeah. So we should make some money somewhere. Yeah. Like one of those that's like a pound a minute from you. Or maybe landline. postage per item. Yes, yes. But yes. we don't even do that, do we? No, no. You know, by the way, members of staff, if you are watching, you are better off buying right now as than Elle, you are. As Ella's done. Yes. Uh, than you are actually to, uh, uh, to purchase separately. Um, as a member of staff, uh, Teresa, wow, you're beautiful. more than welcome. Thank you. You're more than welcome, Teresa. Oh, uh, we, yeah, I don't know. Have we had our wheat bix this morning? I don't know if we've. Uh, I haven't. I had a espresso, a little espresso. Nice. A uh, handful of uh, medication. Okay. Uh, um, uh, a Barocca. Okay. But no wheat bix Maybe you need. Have you had substance. breakfast this morning? Yes, I've got to have something before what I did you have? there, because otherwise I don't eat until about uh, in the evening, really. What did so, you have? Um, I had, oh, a little sugared waffle. Oh, wow, a waffle? Yes, oh, very yeah. nice. Like a toaster waffle? Yeah, yeah nice. very nice. Anything on it? No. Okay. And a nice iced coffee. I uh, wasn't going to get these, I already have two, but 65 quid, I had to get another. Absolutely, Car uh, it's Caroline. It's a no-brainer, isn't it? It really is. It is one of those unmissable opportunities. This is the quantity that we have left. You can that still do it. You can still do it. Absolutely. You can buy three. Yeah. For the original price, Dave. Oh, wow. I didn't think that. Is that right? Am I working that out right? I can't. I can't work. Yeah, I can buy three strands for the original price of one. Yes, you can. How amazing is that? Very How nice. amazing. So now you are literally talking about ropes of the colour. I, I can't get... I'll, I'll just AJ. be really uh, frank with you guys. Um, I can't get you Type-C for this. Type-C is jadeite still, but it's dyed. Mm. I can't get you Type-C for this price. So, I mean, you're getting the real deal, the natural, the type A yeah. for, for £65, which is just one of the best deals we've ever done. Yeah, got One be. of the best deals we've ever, ever, Especially ever done that, in 12 like, years. You, you pay best part of that for the, if not that and above, for the red jadeite, the two sure? single one, red jadeites. 100%. You guys know own. that as well. If, if we're next door and we've got a pair of red jadeite earrings, just two stones. You're paying way more than that. Yeah. Rightfully so. So we talk about, I, I actually hate the I word I called it strand. a closeout. I called it a closeout okay. for a reason. I said they've all got to go today and we've still got nine left. So make sure you are getting Hello, it. Should we do the minute clock to close this now? Yeah, I think we should. Minute clock to close this. We're over allocated um, on it anyway. If you all check out. Oh. Good luck. Amazing, amazing, amazing. The colour is, or colours, I should yeah, say, that's are thing. truly beautiful. And I know this was very indulgent and very, you might be thinking, goodness me, Al, really? But how beautiful would that be if you were to that's put literally too much. It's the amazing. layers? Yeah. Can you, that's like museum worth, isn't it? Yeah. You went to that... Um, Getty that, Museum. Or, or was, it, was it the AG... Um, AGTA? Yeah, yeah. Uh, last year? Yeah. Can you imagine... Oh, that for sure, yeah. The AGTA, the GJX, yeah, 100%. You got half a minute if you want it. If you want to be one of the lucky seven collectors that can walk out of here with that wonderful colours of jadeite strand. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Down to the final seven of them. Yeah, we were talking about, I, and I showed the photograph that you took earlier, um, earlier on in the show when we had that Sophia Loren oh. coral necklace and everything. That's the kind of thing that I can imagine. Sure. Yeah, that, you, oh, the night of the museum. Yes, that's yes. it. Thank yeah, you. Over the rainbow exhibit, the private collectors put that together. And you're right, you had the, 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 the natural pearls, you had uh, the coral necklace that was worn and owned by Sophia Loren. It's just an amazing collection. That deal is done. If you're on the phone lines, I wish you the best of luck. There was like two left, I think. Amazing. Um, and now we move into more colours of incredible jadeite for every single one of you. Where do you want to go to, Ross? Can you pass me down that? The yellows, he said. The, oh, yeah. the blackboard. The blackboard. They are on the bottom. Right on the floor. There you go. Because Dave knows what I'm going to do. I know what you're going to do. You know, you know what I was going to do right now. Um, she's got two yellow jadeite strands. She's going to partner them together and create that one elongated, you know, rare rope of jadeite. This is all natural, it's all Taipei. Uh, many, many jadeite collectors, vendors, dealers, cutters don't even know you can get this colour. That's how rare this is in the grand scheme of things. And you are going to be afforded the opportunity right now to get this look, which is just the kind of, the kind of look that, that money can't buy usually. Yeah, that's, be that's beautiful, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Absolutely beautiful. Yeah, absolutely. Fun. All natural. All natural. Um, so we have these two strands coming up. Yep. I would recommend getting one of each and creating that look. 
uh, maybe interspersing some of the gemstones in there as well. Maybe the links uh, that we brought to you on the weekend of the, uh, the, the nephrite. Oh, that would be uh, lovely. To connect both of these, that would be special. That would be incredible. And there is that. And what about that dotted in between? Incredible top colour. Type A. Coming up. Is this the one that you did? You launched with Susie on Saturday? I believe so. It's that beautiful, pure, pure, mm. pure colour. Um, yeah, that would be lovely dotted in between. For sure. Love the this idea is the of six things. mil rounds that we're bringing you first. Okay, so the Type larger? A. Yeah, 140 carats. Okay. Glowing, beautiful, natural, top crystal, honey, jadeite, yellow, jadeite. How many do we have, Ross? There are 30 available Oh, that's it, right. Minute clock, one deal. One deal, 30 uh, uh, of these available. That is all we have. I don't have 100, I don't have 82, I don't have 60, I don't have 50. You know how busy it is today. You, you know how important this moment is. It's 140 carats of quite possibly the rarest jade on the face of the planet. A jade that we will not see anymore. That yeah. we will not see, the market won't see. It won't exist, especially, no one's going to put, if they have this material, no one's putting a strand together at over 100 carats. <laughs> it's far too much. It is far too indulgent. We got these whilst we could, and now you can't get them. They're not being mined, you're not getting these. No one's stockpiled it, and anyone with this material is never, ever, ever, I don't think, going to put over 100 carats in a, in, a, in a strand ever again. Well, when you first launched it with us, Dave, you were talking about, so, uh, and you were showing pieces that were sold maybe at Sotheby's, yeah, and yeah. Christie's and everything, uh, and they were literally pieces. areas. Yeah, pieces, tiny moments of yeah. this material, you know, plumes of colour. You've got 10 seconds, and this is, I promise you now, if you think it's been busy today, if you think it's been uh, uh, competitive on the phone lines, in three seconds you'll see how busy this is going to be. Yeah, it's beautiful. Over 10% of the stock's already allocated, already confirmed, already checked out. This, today, one price, £199. Can't believe we're even entertaining that in 2023 on type A, natural, honey jade. You don't find this material. Um, Adam, if you, I don't know if you can find the clip, but you know the Pillar and Stone booth? It yeah. doesn't have any sound. Uh, it's Roland Schlussel's booth. But if you yeah. go there, he has a couple of pieces of uh, what, what he calls honey jade as well. It's thousands, wholesale. But he's not got a sale. strand. He's not got a strand of it. And you have £66.33 on your interest-free split amazing. payments. Do not miss out on this opportunity, and especially if you want to create that <laughs> huge elongated look. Well, I mean, prime example, really, the colours of Jadex strand that we had just a few moments ago. Yeah. That had literally two. two. And none yeah. of them were matched. Look how matched these are. Yeah. Yeah, this is the Roland Schlussel exhibit. So you go there, this is Tucson last year. Everything's sold singularly. No one's giving you strands. Uh, you know, Imperial Jada, you've got two pieces there. Yeah. Incredible. You've got these here. Everything is type A, as you can see. They're very proud about that, as they should be. Um, this is unbelievable. There's the Honey Jada honey just at the bottom. And in a, here yeah. you go. That's the Honey Jada, just two pieces. Wow. And, uh, in a moment, he's going to flip over that. You'll see the prices. You know, it's the three bottom pieces that are Honey Jada. And there you go, look, 2,400, 2,600, and I think 2,800 for those. Honey Jada in the background there as well. Yeah. No one's bringing you up. Imagine if you had a 100 carat strand on that booth. Amazing, yeah. amazing. In your beautiful rounds, which is, uh, again, it's the history, isn't it? To yeah. see it in these wonderful... Without a shadow. Let's do a minute clock to close this auction. This is a wild, incredible, next level deal that you're joining us for. Kerry, Richard, Maker in Great London, Maker in Lancashire, Julie in Tyne and Weir. This is your opportunity, the ultimate opportunity, the only opportunity of this le legendary legacy carrot weight. Uh, we're talking 140 carats, six mil rounds in a full ready to go necklace of this matched material. Wow. Well, the five mils are coming up just afterwards um, as well. There was no yellow, no, not, not this color of the no, no, multicolor no, no, no. Uh, strand that we had a few moments ago. Um, but, I'm, <clears throat> but I'm just thinking, you know, we can, we can actually bring you the Imperial Green before we bring this. Yeah, Imperial Green is more readily available in the market than this is. 100%. See, I've seen more Imperial amazing. Green Jade Eye in my life than I've seen this natural canary honey colour. There are people that have worked with Jade Eye their whole lives that have never owned it, yeah. that have never procured it, that have never worked with it, never sold it. You get the opportunity to acquire it today in a monumental, massive carrot weight. Well over 100 carats. Wow. This Almost one's 150 coming up. carats. Coming up as well. Okay, now we go to the five mils. Again, we've got 30. Yeah, just 30. That's You've seen how busy it is today. Yeah. yeah. I'll give you a minute clock, and you're going to get a crazy deal. Uh, again, we're over 100 carats. It is that matched, exquisite strand mm. of this glowing, honey-coloured jadeite. This would look lovely. Wow. Uh, and I think I did it earlier on. Let me just find um, alongside these, I think. Can you imagine those yeah, together? I think phenomenal. 
Because you're picking out the honey tones, aren't you, within your blue chalcedony. I think it just works gorgeously. Oh, that recording, stunning. Look at that colour. Do you know what, Ross? I'm going to do a brand new low on this, a close out. Oh, he's gone very quiet. I've only got the last 20 of these available now. I'm going to go to the new low price. Never been this low. Uh, nowhere been, never been anywhere near the price that I'm about to call on this. So if you want to own it, if you missed out on the previous piece, if you haven't had the chance to get this before, then this is it. Amazing, yeah. amazing, amazing. Close 15 seconds. Out deal. I promise you now I'm going for the lowest price we've ever been on this. Never has it been this low. And we're not talking about a strand which is maybe, I don't know, 10, 15 centimetres. It's nope. a full 30. Or even a 10 carat strand or a 5 carat. We're talking yeah. about 110 carats. Lowest ever price, buy a country mile, £129. Wow. Good luck. Cool. Make sure you're checking it out. Multi buy if you can. Add this to the other piece that we just bought to you. Create that beautiful uh, uh, matched graduated strand from the two. Oh, it'd be pieces. lovely. So, I mean, yeah, you could make that piece of jewellery for what? Well under. Yeah. Um, well, I'm going to give a close out clock on this. I've gone for the lowest price ever. Never been anywhere near the price on your screen right now. You also get your split payments. Good luck to those of you that are joining in today. It is the closeout showcase event, I guess. And this is yours today for the, 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 the unbelievably low price of £129. You've got 50 seconds to get it. If you want to multi-buy, go for it. I've seen a lot of trade in today. I don't blame you. Yeah, I don't Take blame advantage. you either. I don't blame you either. Um, was, this, was this a planned closeout? Nope, deal? Nope, no, 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 it's not. Um, there we go, completely um, impromptu, yep. um, unscheduled. Half a minute, I don't even think yeah. we'll have enough to last half a minute. No. If you really want to secure this, I'd be very, very fast. I'm just warning you, because I can see the phone lines. Yeah, there's um, a lot of people there. We are very, very limited. And people choosing to multi-buy on this yeah. bit as well. That colour is just beautiful, isn't it? It's like caramel. You may never see that colour again. In fact, you won't hear. But I mean, even on my, you know, widely in, in the auction houses, I don't think you're going to see this colour again. Uh, Surrey, Cornwall, Dorset, Gloucestershire, Cambridgeshire, uh, uh, Anonymous Maker, wow. Essex, you've multiport, Derbyshire, Lancashire, Dorset, well done, Greater Manchester, Channel Islands, well done to all of you that are doing this. We have to move on. It is still available. If you can use Six. the website, then do it. Six remaining, so I'll leave that one with you. <gasps> well done. I have never, if we're going to do what I think we're going to do, is we that right? Mm -hmm. Ross, is it this one? Yeah. Should be, yeah. I've never seen jadeite nope. like that before. Right, so this is a level beyond anything you've seen. You know, when it comes to, uh, you know, imperial grade, this is it. Not imperial colour in the, in the green sense. This is imperial white. I've never seen that. How many that, of these that. do we have remaining, Ross? The 49. Okay, I'm joining you on this one. Uh, you have to. You absolutely have to. 30 second clock to the graphics on this. 49 available. Have you ever seen anything as pure? You've no. seen a lot of white jade. No. You ever seen anything like this? It is absolutely unparalleled. Yeah, I, yeah totally. And we're going to give you 30 seconds until we make this available. Do you know, but in mother na in nature, yeah. you don't you see don't that purity. level of purity, no. do you? Never. Never. 49 of these will be available. 49 of these will sell out. It's, it's totally and utterly It's brand natural. new, isn't it, Ross? Is it brand new, Ross? Once. Once on your screens. Once on your screens. I'm just trying to think of something in nature that is that pure. I can't think. In its white colour. No. Nope. Well, you think clouds are a bit blue? Yeah. Four that seconds. Pure just be white primed, colour. be ready, be on the phone lines. Good luck. Unbelievable, isn't it? Imperial white jade. And, and remember, this is jadeite. This is essentially the mutton fat variety of jadeite, which you never get. You always get a secondary tone, a secondary colour in jadeite. Yes, usually you surpass mutton fat jade in terms of uh, translucency mm -hmm. with the jadeite, but you never surpass it in the purity of colour. You have today. It's the best white jade I've ever seen. Totally agree. Like, I'm not talking there. about jewellery making now or Gemporia. I'm literally just talking about in my time in the industry. Really? In my time in Myanmar, in Hong Kong, in Bangkok. I've never seen white jade like this pure. I've seen white jade, uh, i.e. You know, your mutton fat jade, from the Kotan deposit this pure, and you pay the price for it. Um, but I've what? never seen, never, ever, ever seen natural jade like this pure. In fact, it's always oh, a good indication goodness. if jade like is this pure, it's always dyed. Not today, this is Taipei, it's natural. But whenever I see jade like that is this pure, it is exclusively dyed. So when Richard Hughes was talking about... Jadeite, yeah, he said. Your white hue. He said a single, 
uh, jadeite jade cabochon of uh, a pure white colour with just moderate translucency should literally be considered the finest of its type. That was back in 2008 that his book was uh, printed. Um, and that was the quote that he used. Uh, thank you so much, Ross. Uh, this is the quote we talked about. In modern connoisseurship, a jadeite jade cabochon of pure white hue, which is what you've got now. It's ultimately rare. We, I know we, we always call, when we have white jade out, we always call it white jade, but it's never pure like this. Never. We expect that. And with a fine texture, which what this has, because you know, I've talked about the translucency, yeah. it's imperial grade, and would be considered the finest of its type. The first price I'm going to put on your screen is a fair price. It's two thousand pounds. Yeah, totally. That's a fair price. Totally. Trust me on that. Absolutely. I mean, you don't see something like this Never. even in the auction house. Never. Um, always a secondary colour. That's always the case here at Jewelry Matron. We should expect that for a shop and TV channel. Um, even in the auction houses, there is a trade-off. Mm. Okay, I'm going to give everyone a minute clock. We have only forty-nine available. This is its second outing, and it is its final outing. Trust me on that. Um, Ross has just made me chuckle because he just said, I know, I think I know the price on this. Okay, well, we'll play a game. When gonna... this minute ends, Ross, because it's how confident I am, you bring in what you think the price is on this. Okay. Ooh. Ross and Dave off. And remember what, what the mood I'm in, Ross. R remember the mood I'm in. I want you to go, like, you can't go too low. Go as low as you genuinely think. Okay. Remember, we're dealing with 100 carats. Yes, be honest. Don't, don't, be, don't do a Ross price. You think you know what I'm going to do. So I want you to come in and be as aggressive as you want. Okay. okay? And if, it's, if, it, if I can't beat it, I can't beat it. Okay, it's fair. Like, either way, you're going to get an incredible deal at home. But he's going to come in. Amazing. He says, yeah. right, uh, uh, this is as low as he thinks it's possibly feasible for something of that quality to go. Okay, uh, that's the man with the Nobody numbers. Nobody would guess it at what he's about to show you. Okay, and that's, that's good. That's what I want to see. And look, if I can't beat it, I'll simply bow out and say, do you know what? That's an incredible deal, Ross. You can be in trouble <laughs> He's for confident it. he's going to show you up, he said. Oh, that's good. That's good. That's what I want. Because ultimately, you guys win. This is the man, Roscoe. You can see him in the gallery right now. You know, very do? confident, waving, happy. Let's have a little look. He's feeling confident. Oh, he should do. Yeah, he's the man. Okay, you have gone really low. <laughs> yeah, okay, mate. You can be in trouble for once this time. Okay, you can take the flak. It's 100 carats, mate. It's 100 he carats. He's going to do he's one, done it for, two, nine. But it's then a pound a carat is what he's done for you right now. Richard, you've just multi-bought. But I don't like to be upstaged. <laughs> so I'm going to do a minute clock, and I shouldn't do this. If you saw me bring this before, you know I shouldn't do this. We're at 99 pounds. He's done an incredible three-way split pay deal for oh you at 33 pounds. We only had 49. Do you know what, Ross? You have gone so low there. Awesome. You've gone so low. He's blaming you. He said you pushed him. Yeah, and I get it. Look, that's not Ross's pricing. That's Ross trying to preempt what he thinks, how low we're going to go. But for everyone tuned in right now, you are going to get a phenomenal deal, okay? And I'd never like to just take £10 off, so bear that in mind. Okay. You've got 100 carats of it the purest white jadeite that I've ever encountered in my life. Do you know what, what word it was that triggered Ross? Go on. When you said aggressive. Aggressive, yeah, that's, the, that's what he's doing, right? Aggressive, you are Absolutely. then. Absolutely. And, and do you know what, we, we, we haven't even put this in the context of a white jade show. And I'll be honest, and I'll tell you why. Because it would upstage every white jade I've ever bought to you. Yeah. Right, it would. So we've had to put it in multicolours because it's so unique, it's so different, it's so pure, and it has the translate. It's imperial white jade, not jade, not to be confused with nephrite. Ross, mate, you've done this to yourself, okay? You've made me do this. You went to double figures off the bat from two grand. I'm gonna half the price. I'm gonna half the price. Just this once, let's do it for everyone at home. We only have, uh, we only had 49 of these, bro. It is still okay. 100 carats. It's still this pure. It is translucent, top texture, top it's crystallization. The, the purest and, and, and finest white jade out that, that we've ever seen. And even when we go back to Secrets of the Gem It's trail, whiter than your top. Yes, it is. But that's down to me washing, though. It's just terrible. But, uh, I can't keep white. Uh, Richard W. Y. wrote back in 2008, just the cabochon. Forget 100 yeah. carat strand. Uh, mo in modern connoisseurship, in the modern age, 2008, a jadeite jade, which is what you have, jadeite jade, it's not nephrite, of a pure white hue with a fine texture and a moderate translucency. It's just moderate would be the finest of its type. How about 100 carats of pure white oh, type A the, jadeite jade? Look at the jade. split payment, though. Oh, silly. Look silly. at the split payment. It's silly. It is silly. 
Susan, you've got four. Richard, you've got four. Anna, you've got two. Lancashire, you've got two. Pat, you've got two. Uh, Susan, you've got two. Unbelievable. I you're don't one of these. If you're buying one of these, you're going to kick yourself. Um, can I just... I know it's indulgent, but can I be a little bit... Can we, can, can we just top this up? Yeah, there. Right. There you go. Sorry. That's all right. It's, is it sold out? But can we just do a little tot up to see, imagine what this kind of piece of jewellery well, would... Sorry, apologies. Well done to everyone who got involved. 65. You've got 140, 110, that's 260. About 360 pounds. plus 240. 360 plus 240 is 600 carats, 700 carats? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. In total there. But it costs you about 400 pounds, just over 400 pounds. 450, all, all the rarest pounds. and fancy colours. Everything oh, type A, everything natural, well done. If anything's still available, get on our web, get on the app and get involved. Um, we've got one more auction with okay, you. Okay, I'm excited. You um, know, Ross, when we do one auction, I don't even have to tell you this, I guess I'm telling you guys at home, when we do one last auction, we'd like to go out with a bang. Okay. Okay, I do anyway. Oh, hang on, this one. Can I change the chain? I've just noticed. We'll imagine, we'll, 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 okay. Hang on a sec. Oh, my God. Black jadeite jade. Yeah? Imperial jadeite. And at the base, you've got natural turquoise. Now, I don't have my book with me for once. For once, I don't have my jade book with me. But um, thousands of years ago, jade was a term that was used for the, the finest gemstones for the emperors, right? And uh, originally, jade was an all-encompassing term. They didn't know what jade was or jade it was. No, yeah. And there was four great jades. Okay. One of them was serpentine. One of them was mutton fat. Yeah. One of them was this legendary turquoise from the Hubei province. And you've got natural, this isn't Sleeping Beauty, this is not compressed, this is not treated. Those are a trio of natural turquoise. Then you, then you have, whoa, 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 whoa. This is from Guatemala. What? That's black jadeite from Guatemala that changes everything. I've never seen black. Right, that's imperial black jadeite, which I'll be honest, everything I've read in that book and everywhere, everything I've ever been taught, even I'm learning this live, has told me, you only get the piano black imperial omphacite jadeite from Myanmar. There is something known as galaxy jadeite from Guatemala. And the reason they call that is because it is black jade, but it's got flecks of pyrite within it because it's a coarse crystallization. Okay. You never, ever, ever get this legacy grade imperial piano black, natural type A black jadeite from Guatemala. This is Olmec Imperial Black Jade Eye with a trio of ancient turquoise. So this is the ancient launch. Ancient turquoise. It's the first time I, I realised. I've that. ever seen, yeah. Oh my goodness me. Right, can we, can we go to a, a 20 second break? Is that possible? Yeah. Okay, we're going to go to a 20 second or 30 second break when we come back. How many of these do we have available, Ross? 40. Okay, we've got 40 of these. Um, all of them are going to sell out today. I'm going to do an absolutely ridiculous deal. But in 30 seconds, we'll come back and give it to you a good look. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Okay, we've just got the certification, but it is definitely the Guatemala material. Uh, the certification is so, so, uh, important, so integral here. Certification for this is um, talks particularly about the jadeite. It calls it the blackish green jadeite. Yeah. When I mean, we talk about onsite jadeite, where it's an over imperialized green. Yeah. Right. So when the light gets behind it, you should see this green come through. And the lab has stated that. I'm sure it's live. I don't know if we can dim the lights. I don't know if it'll help. But. Yes. Yes. You see the green coming through this material. This was jet black in the daylight recording. And then you see the green coming through. Wow. This is sensational. 40 of these available. Yeah, if I just tilt it, 
You see the, sorry guys, yeah. you see the green? Yeah. This is special. It is and then that, if you see it in the that. daylight, like Adam's got, it's jet black. It's You'd never black. know. This is why we send everything to the labs. This is, jet, like, I'm going to do an incredible deal, but I'm telling you now, it's one of the most important jadeites I've ever offered for sale. Genuinely. So, uh, so the colours of Guatemala are, are normally just blue, aren't they? Yeah, so it's a blue jadeite, but there is a, what's known as a, uh, there's also a, a, an opaque sort of coarse lavender that comes from there, and what they call the galaxy jade, which is a very coarse black jadeite with flecks of pyrite within it. They don't get this. They shouldn't get this. They have got this. It is Guatemalan. It has the ancient Chinese turquoise as well. We have 40 of these available. And That's uh, let me tell you something right now. I'm going double figures. Even wilder than that, I'm going under 50 on this. Going to do it. Uh, I'll take a minute clock. I'm just going to call one price. And if you're fast enough, you'll get it. I love that this is from Guatemala. Under 50 pounds. Sorry. Under what? Under 50 pounds. For this? Yes, it's happening. You know, the imperial black, piano black. If there on are only Jedi 40. From Guatemala. There's only 40. Only 40 of these. Dave, I'm looking at the, the, you know, the three beautiful turquoise. Yeah, all nice. And, and the story of Guatemala, funnily enough, Claire and I were talking about it this morning, mm. just saying how much we love the story of Guatemala and Jade. Yeah, yeah. And for me, it is that past, present and future. Mm. That little, the, the, the little trio sure. of, I love that. I absolutely love the design of this as well. Super exclusive. I mean, there's nothing Even else like this. So if you want to multiply like Richard and buy three, you can create your own earrings from this. Oh. But I, there's chances of us, I mean, Genuinely, the book on jade doesn't even talk about this discovery, this, this legendary material. And on for site jade, it's new that this is coming from Guatemala. How amazing. Yeah. How amazing. You did say under... Under 50 pounds. 50. Yeah. It's happening. It's over-allocated in that Okay. 29.99. Good luck. 29.99. It's been... Cr I said, you know, when we finished, when we did the final auction, we was like to go on, you know, in a big bang, and this is that. So thirty pounds Look. gets you this. That's wow. just craziness. Yeah, it really is. Absolutely crazy. So beautiful. Mm -hmm. So so beautiful. All that sterling silver, with the turquoise. Mm -hmm. But most importantly, it's that Guatemalan. It was the onfosite jade from Guatemala, which I didn't had no idea existed. No. No idea existed. How exciting. Um, limited. It was always going to be limited. Yeah, yeah. Again, double figure opportunity. Um, in terms of price point, and I love, way I really lower do than love I the expecting. juxtaposition with what you're seeing here that Adam's showing in the daylight, where it's just, like I said, that piano black, yeah. that tight crystallization, that wet look, that unbelievable luster. And then when we showed you with the light and the green within the body of it, that is, that is kind of the story of that jade. It was once upon a time imperial, mm -hmm. and it's revealing itself. You know, that, that is what happened. That's, gone past that. Yeah, that's well, the hangover of its, its formation, essentially. Amazing, absolutely pounds. amazing. We are down to the final six, six opportunities. So it is yeah. going to be an on-screen sellout. Well done. Um, absolutely amazing. Dave, thank you, thank you so much thank for you, uh, for joining me once again thank on the you studio. Very much. I always love our show. I love them as well. Uh, also. Informative, but also we have a giggle. We have a giggle. That's the most important thing. And uh, I know Claire's coming up with an incredible mass class. Claire, it's your birthday, isn't it? Yeah. Happy it birthday. Is a Happy birthday. birthday. So um, it's going to be fun. It's going to be incredible. I know you've been having fun and great deals all morning. And the mask class is something I'm going to be interested in after what you were saying earlier that's coming up with the bezel setting. Yeah. So uh, I'll be Perfect. tuned into that. Uh, and to every single one of you, um, you know, I wish you, uh, you know, a good morning. And uh, I'll see you very, very soon. Ah, oh, wonderful, Dave. Bringing us amazing launches and opportunities to expand our, our amazing gemstone collections. Do not go anywhere though, because Claire is back. We've got an exciting masterclass coming up as well. Perfect with your amazing chalcedonies. Don't go anywhere. More amazing deals after this.
jewellery makers. This coming Wednesday, it's Claire McDonald's birthday show. Make sure you tune in for what will be an absolutely amazing five hours of treats. We have a mega bundle of soldable accents and gem setting bracelet kits. Your deal of the day is the beautiful blue chalcedony. Plus, anybody who buys during the show is in with a chance of winning a goodie bag worth over a hundred pounds. So make sure you tune in, join the celebrations for Claire's birthday. It's a new year, so that can only mean one thing. It's time for those new year resolutions. And it's the perfect time to start a new hobby. Jewellery maker, sewing street and hobby maker are here whether you're starting something new or advancing your skills on a current hobby. With all the tools you need to start, as well as expert demonstrations from our great guests. Are you starting a new hobby this January? Share your new makes with us by tagging jewellery maker, hobby maker or sewing street using the hashtag New Year New Hobby. And watch us every day from 8am to 1pm on jewellery maker. On hobby maker 6 to 8am and 1 to 6pm. And 8am to 1pm on sewing street. Jewellery makers, we have a mega sale on our website right now. There is up to 70% off items with over a thousand items available on all the W's at jewellerymaker.com. So pop along, take a look and start shopping. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. We're talking about sneezes. We're still on the conversation of sneezes. And poor Adam, who comes in to cover <laughs> breaks, director Adam from Harvey Maker, got shouted at for his loud sneeze. <laughs> poor Adam. And, uh, and then I sne It was very loud, yeah, but, you know, you can't... It was a good you one. Your sneeze is your sneeze. <laughs> your sneeze is your sneeze. And then I sneezed on air as well. And I was like, oh, I'll come to think of it. Ross didn't shout at me. He didn't, no. <laughs> and then I was talking about our Claire sneeze. Claire, you sneeze like your little dog coughs. <laughs> Achoo! Sometimes. Achoo! Achoo! <laughs> but there's nothing more satisfying than if you do a huge... Oh, it's lovely, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. It is. Have you... Yeah, I don't think you'd object to Claire sneezing, Ross. Hers is really cute. <laughs> I wouldn't be told Achoo! to get out. Achoo! Get out! <laughs> get out! <laughs> Achoo! Achoo! <laughs> right then. It's Claire's birthday! Oh. Oh, welcome back, beautiful lady. Thank you. How are you doing? I'm very, I'm very good, thank you. Uh, these look okay. very exciting. I know. So I know. I've a little sneaky peek. Coming love, up love, in the masterclass. Peek. Have you got the jewellery? Oh, yes, I have. Yeah, yeah, I have. Oh, 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 yeah, I have. So, hang on, is that what I think it is? Is that nephrite? Look at that. It is, isn't it? It's beautiful, isn't it? Nephrite Jade sold straight away. Beautiful tourmaline. And, yeah, you guessed it, tanzanite. <laughs> <laughs> Is this something in the air? Why are we all <laughs> sneezing today? I don't know. Oh, we've got sneezes here in the studio. Don't forget, as well, that if you are shopping today between the hours of 9 and 1 o'clock, then it is between the hours. Oh, is it today? Just today? 9 to 1 o'clock, yeah. Um, one of you will win. When we say goodie bag, it's more of a goodie basket, oh, yeah, I'm going to say. Nice, isn't it? Yeah? yeah. 
because you've got look little, little, little basket of joy you've got a nice little carved gemstone in there oh my gosh look at those oh some red onyx got some really beautiful shell you've got cords underneath as Love well this. i don't know if you can see that look abalone beautiful abalone you've got some lovely parcels of tumbles i had look let me turn it around a minute because you've got peridot you've got your lava rock you've got some aquamarine you've got some beautiful amazonite oh i love these shells can you see those one of you will be winning look at all those pearls one of you will be winning this look all because this. it's your birthday look at this <gasps> paparazzi sapphire oh yes my please gosh ross have you seen these? Oh, look at that. That's a pretty high-end trio right lovely. there. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Um, okay, so if you're shopping today, one of you's gonna win that. And we've got the Wall of Fame giveaway. And oh, yes. speaking of giveaways, um, you've got to shop ahead on this one. There's 300, it's a mega auction quantity. Um, we have tanzanite, smooth rounds, perfect with your kit, Claire. Oh, they're beautiful. See this one here? If you wanted to create, let me bring it across. If you wanted to create maybe some little, I don't know, little bubble style. Little bubble style at the top. Nice, yeah, because it's all it? about movement, yes. Oh, yeah. Claire, look at that, it's double-sided as well. I'm going to make a price promise. Vanadium rich in its colour. This tanzanite strand is guaranteed today because of your birthday. Oh. Birthday deal. I am going to say under 100, Adam. I am. I'm also going to say under 50. I'm also going to say it's only because it's your birthday. Under 10. <gasps> oh, don't do that. Is that what you said? I can. I've done it. Get out. Get out. <laughs> A two, a two, a two. <laughs> Sorry, that's how Claire sneezes. I was meant to do under 10, wasn't I? Oh. Oh, Tuna well, okay, brilliant. we'll do it, says Ross. So he didn't answer me yes or no. Never mind, it's done now. It's guaranteed. We've got 300 of them available. Guaranteed <laughs> under. Um, under 10 pounds. Sorry, Adam's trying to decipher that conversation. <laughs> right. It's all relating back to sneezes that have, has gone on throughout the course of today's yes. show. There's been lots of sneezing. I think maybe there's... Um, yeah, dust in the air, maybe. Yes, I think there probably is. Must be dust in the air. Yeah. Right then, uh, plus we've got the Wall of Fame and we've got your Masterclass kits. What do you want me to start with, Roscoe? The turquoise. Aww. I love this strand. And I have to say, it's another giveaway deal. When I was prepping last night for the show, I was like, gosh, that's ever so low. Wow. Um, for turquoise, because we expect turquoise to be, here at Jewelry Maker, between 50 and 100 pounds, would we agree? I think that's round about our price point, which is pretty well, amazing. Yeah, yeah. When you start looking outside of these four walls, oh, considerably more, considerably more. And I've shown you all those celebrities wearing their turquoise, haven't I? Oh. I've shown you your Megan Fox and your uh, Jennifer Lawrence. Oh, lovely. And your Sarah Jessica Parker. Um, oh, I could go on, Beyonce. All wearing their turquoise. And Was it Arnie one. as well? Ar Arnie, yeah, yeah, in his boot cut jeans. Yeah. Do you remember that? Yeah, Dan's, yeah, Dan's favourite person, wasn't it? Should we, get, should we just show him first? He does deserve it, to be fair. There he is. Look at that. That is, yeah. that is an absolute corker of a turquoise, isn't it? It is. It really is. I can't take my eyes off his shoes as well. Has he got Muhammad Ali on his on his T-shirt? I thought so. I thought so. Um, very cool. But I'm sure my dad had those sandals. Are they sandals? Are I, they? they look like sandals to me. Or are they brogues? I thought they were like those like crossover. Oh, I know, like a bit, uh, open, like woven, woven yeah. ones. Yeah. Anyway, I digress. Um, beautiful.
beautiful turquoise with that wonderful. We can't start. We can't just sit here talking about Arnie all day, can we? We need to bring you the deals on your beautiful gemstone. Um, anyway, this wonderful gemstone that forms in very dry and arid locations. If you can imagine, when the ground craves water, this beautiful gemstone is actually formed. Often found alongside sort of copper deposits. Um, we are most definitely looking at USA. Oh yeah, you can see it on your graphics right now because you have that very distinctive robin egg blue. But our expectations has never been complacent lovely jewelry makers you know even here to a uh, jewelry maker to be offering you turquoise at double figures is is is, is astonishingly good mm -hmm. you know um as dave next week literally goes over to tucson it really hit home to me the price of turquoise and that was in the state of arizona mm. yeah yeah in the state of arizona we're at 49 pounds and 99 pence Rounds is rare, as Claire pointed out, because... And that vibrancy of colour, isn't it? It's, yeah, you know, it's, it's wasteful, this colour. part. Yeah. You want to retain this kind of qual uh, this, this kind of colouring. Um, uh, incredible, at 49.99. We only have a limited quantity of these available, though, so it is definitely, definitely worth you uh, dialing through nice and early. Do you think we're stopping here, though, Claire? I, I'm going to say no. No. Should we? I think we should, yeah. I think it's a beautiful stone. Can we go back to the beginning of this PowerPoint for a second? Because... So let's just quickly scan through this. I'm, I've got 61 available opportunities. Um, while we're, we're, we're learning and absorbing all this amazing history about this gemstone, use that time wisely. Get yourself in a position to make your confirmations nice and early, because believe me, if you wait till when we crash, it will already have gone. Turquoise is a semi-translucent to opaque gem that ranges from blue to green and often has veins of matrix, remnants of the rock in which it's formed. Uh, this December birthstone has been cherished for millennia. The pharaohs and other rulers of ancient Egypt adorned themselves with it. Chinese artisans carved it for more than 3,000 years. Remember what Dave said about the original jade? It's literally turquoise. Um, the turquoise birthstone was thought to possess many beneficial powers, like guaranteeing health and good fortune. From the 13th century on, it was believed to protect the wearer from falling, especially off horses, and would break into several pieces at the approach of disaster. Hindu mystics maintain that seeing a turquoise after beholding the new moon ensured fantastic wealth. Oh. It is all positive associates with this beautiful gemstone. Um, and, and Claire said earlier on about that wonderful, intense red, uh, so that beautiful, intense red, what am I talking about? Blue color um, that we, uh, uh, we aspire to own. Mm. This turquoise birthstone also played an important role in the lives of Native Americans. The Apache thought turquoise could be found by following a rainbow to its end. Uh, they also believe that attaching the December birthstone to a bow or firearm made one, one's aim more accurate. The Pueblo maintained that turquoise got its colour from the sky, while the Hopi thought the gem was produced by lizards Ooh. scurrying over the, over the earth. Um, I, I love all that, the history of these yeah. wonderful gemstones. Um, well done to those of you that have already shopped ahead. We are going to do, like I said, you are going to get what is, it's already amazing at 49.99. Look at the carat weight. You look at 35 carats of spherical turquoise, which is almost unheard of. Six millimeters in their size. You're going to get it at a closeout deal. And I don't just mean a little cheeky bit. Cast, rewind time, if you like, to when we, not actually, but remember, when we broadcast out of Ivy House and we were part Ooh. of the immediate group, that would have had a one in front of it. Because that's a cla that is classic, isn't it? Turquoise is, is so popular, it's so well known. 124.99, it, well, it's still yeah. a great deal. That's not me being disrespectful to immediate either. If you, exactly, it's classic turquoise. If we look through the celebrities, Claire, yeah. that, you know, or, or all the pieces even, let's do that. Let's go through, um, here we go. Van Cleef, boom, Robin Egg Blue. Yeah. 249 pounds for a little slice. Slice yeah. of a slice, slice. I said, I said milk in Welsh then. Um, another slice here, 815 pounds. It's got gold. That's not even turquoise, by the way. It's not actually turquoise. 
That's not turquoise either. It's actually agate. Same as that. But it's that colour, isn't it? It's that that colour. people love. Not too bad. £149 for that cabochon. Look at Fabergé. Here we go. Turquoise uh, enamel. Yeah. It's an enamel ring. It's not actually turquoise. Possession open ring from Piaget, 2,900. It's that wonderful intense colour. Mm. We have the expectation of high price tags when it comes to turquoise, and rightfully so. Shopard, look at it, Shopard. Tiffany's right now. 129 for these uh, heart earrings. And across all the celebrities that are wearing it, it's this level of quality. Snap it up, that's a, literally, that's a rock bottom giveaway deal. I don't think we could even buy it for what's on your screens right now. Beautiful. Who's in the mood? For a mega auction. Yes, please. Uh, most importantly, are our call centre ready for a mega auction? Now, I'm going to give you a heads up. One auction, and then we're going to dive into your beautiful tanzanite. Ah, uh, this one. I saw, I saw, ah, uh, so pretty. Oh, look at that. Let's do a close out on this. And then we'll do a close out on a 300 quantity. I know, it makes no sense. Differences, 300 of those, under 10 pounds. 40 of these, 40. But we will still honor that close out deal. Imagine one little, little one little Tanzanite rondelle on top. Mm, yeah. How yeah. beautiful is that? It's natural color. They will all obviously be completely unique. These are Keshi pearls, so they're all organic gemstones. The reason why they um, are slightly flatter than your sort of baroques or your rounds or um, yeah, various other different descriptions is because it forms literally laying ag against the mollusk shell itself. They're pure nacre. Um, and what I mean by that is a pearl is made up of nacre that normally wraps itself and coats itself around the uh, nucleated bead. There is no nucleated bead, so this is the most natural cultured pearl that you can actually source. It also means that you are getting pure, pure luster and colour. This is going to be a close-out deal, beautifully half-drilled, so all you need to do is maybe get one of your pendant bales or maybe a little bit of sterling silver wire. Yes, yeah, make your own, couldn't you? What about you? with the gallery, with, the, with, the, with this bezel strip? Yeah, yeah, you could go, go all the way around, couldn't you? Set it, maybe do a lovely ring as well if you were going to do that, because the drill hole is, you could either use it or, or you could or it up with the, the bezel strip. Nice. I don't think you've ever seen that, Claire, you know. Bezeling a pearl? Yeah. I don't know if I've ever done it. It'd be lovely though, wouldn't you it? You should. Yeah. I think you should. Yeah. We're going to do this in what? Two price crashes. The first price crash, not what you're paying. I'll get it out of the box for you as well. Not what you're paying. Mm. Isn't that beautiful? I like it this way, you have that little... It's nice if you had it on a long chain, you'd see you'd have movement, wouldn't you? And then you could, yeah, absolutely stunning. It's all the other colours as well, isn't it? Beautiful. It is. It's the greens, mm, the purples. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pure nature. Look at that. Isn't it lovely? Now, where I'm holding here, that's where the drill hole is. So literally just glue it, leave it overnight. Hey, Presto, your job, uh, job done. Who wants a closeout deal? Even though we only have 40 of these available, 39.99 is already absolutely incredible. Perfect if you're thinking about pendants, earrings, of course, charms. Can you imagine setting, um, I'd go for like smaller stones. Can you imagine um, insetting your gemstones in like that and they'd sort of be in that, in that almost like it's a cup, isn't it? you know the round gemstones almost that yeah almost reminiscent of like um an oyster itself yes yeah sort of protecting oh beautiful this that's crazy 1999 it's a Gorgeous. close out deal it can't, does come um literally box like so i mean whenever i buy these which i do quite frequently um i'll usually just literally glue the the bale attach choose a chain and literally offer it mm. like so because you've got everything. You've literally got everything. You've got the packaging as well to actually gift it, send it, sell it, offer it, whatever you want to do, save it. 19 And if you've got the, um, the pink amethyst as well from earlier, oh, it would go beautifully with that, wouldn't it? All the pinky Stunning. tones, yeah. And your demo from the nine o'clock hour, Claire. Yes, yeah. And you could, you could do a beautiful ring with that as well, couldn't you? 
It's really working across the, both the nine o'clock kits, but also in the 12 o'clock kits. Yeah. So if you wanted to actually frame it, with some sterling oh, silver lovely. Yeah. Um, bezel strip. I think that would be really nice. Yeah. And using the wire that yes. you had earlier on too. We only had 40 opportunities, everybody. Well done. Um, whilst you're at it, if you want to get hold of your tan tonight, um, I definitely would because, yeah, it's guaranteed. I've made a price promise under £10 oh, for tan tonight. Yeah, you can rosary link your tan tonight and then have the pearl. Oh, that would be lovely to get yeah. there. Because when you actually separate them out, those little rondelles, they're, they're going to... Um, sort of lose a little bit of their colour, not physically, but to us, to us they will lose a bit mm. of colour. When you actually put them alongside the keshi, mm. it's going to retain it. Again. Yeah, yeah. Um, so really nice, beautiful. Yeah. Nineteen ninety nine. Well done, everybody. Richard, you've snapped up three. Amazing. Leslie, Oxford, Jan. Hello to you, D uh, D Delia. Sorry, uh, Toya, and you're there as well. Okay, I'm going to keep. Uh, I'm going to leave that with you. Keep dialing through. Are you ready for a star buy? Yes. Are you ready for a mega auction? Yes. Are you ready for tans and I under ten pounds? Yes. It's next. Can I ask Ross? Because we've got three hundred of these, and I've already I've been completely upfront, told you where it's going to. Would you mind possibly grabbing my tans and I? Thank you. Because it's so easy for us all, myself absolutely included, to slip into that area of complacency where you kind of think, ah, Joy Maker can bring down tonight at £10. And yeah, we might well do right now. Should we? Probably not. Moving forward, more than likely not. Because let's never forget those emotions and feelings that we had when we first launched Tans Night here at Jewelry Maker. And let's never forget, I walked past some lovely jewellers um, uh, over the last couple of days, went back to my hometown, and there's some really nice jewellers in that, in, in that area. And one of them didn't have any Tans Night at all. So let's not be complacent. I'm not saying you are, for, I'm not naming anybody, but it is, I'm, I'm reminding myself. Yeah, you know. yeah. So what is Tanzanite? I think most of us know, but let's enjoy this article. These aren't my words. It was written by another uh, website. It's 1,000 times rarer than a diamond. The unique geology, pressures, and intense temperatures of Mount Kilimanjaro offer you this once-in-a-lifetime deposit of intense blue-purple gem-rich, uh, gem-rich, gems rich in history. Sorry. With experts ranging the chances of finding it anywhere in the world at one in a million. Gosh, yeah. I was asked that question some time ago. Yeah, but, you know, it's one locational gemstone, so it's only found in one place on this planet. But what's the likelihood of it being found elsewhere? And I didn't know how, know how to answer it. It was actually this article that, uh, that, that helped me. Tanzanite is one of the rarest and most intriguing mineral uh, gemstones sorry, known to man. Experts have predicted Tanzanite mines will have given their last gem quality stone in 10 to 20 years. And you've got to consider this article was written a couple of years ago, giving it incredible collectible value. These factors have shaped Tanzanite as one of the most coveted stones, estimating to be at least 1,000 times rarer than diamonds. Tanzanite is known to hold uh, attributes of good luck and prosperity. The deep blue stone is thought to be a transformation stone which helps dissolve old negative patterns and habits, allowing the bearer to move on in life with a renewed sense of direction, purpose, optimism and confidence. All the key ingredients for prosperity. The gem is also believed to attract energies of good luck, wealth and success, propelling you into your best life. Uh, also known as blue zoocyte, the tans tanzanite is a stone of many properties. Beyond its unprecedented beauty, that's so true, isn't it? Mm. It's unprecedented yes, beauty. Yeah. Intense range of blues and rarity, tanzanite has often been associated with new life and new beginnings. The stone can be gifted for births and new milestones in life as a token of fortune and hope. 
It is a stone of fresh starts, rejuvenated health and protection from stepping into the world. This tradition is deeply rooted in the Maasai customs. Women would be gifted tanzanite stones after childbirth as a symbol of good luck. So I love that. Mm. I always assumed that it was tanzanite one that had started the new birth thing, a bit like De Beers did with diamonds, yes, but actually yeah. it wasn't. It literally comes from the Maasai people themselves. Uh, heirlooms are keepers of time and memories. Passing on uh, um, a piece of jewellery to another generation is a sign of love, pride and family, symbolising the passing down of a lifelong heritage. The rarity and beauty of Tanzanite complements this tradition as a perfect heirloom stone to carry through the future. And I think that's so true. It's true in this right in this current day. But imagine what that heirloom status is going to be when the Tanzanite mm. mine is literally all but mined out. And I think on this on this uh, PowerPoint, um, Roscoe, I've got the, the, the depths. Is that on here? Okay, because again, this is us being complacent. We almost assume that, I don't know, the gemstones are either alluvial mined or maybe they're big, vast, open pits. Um, many gemstones, uh, Tanzanite, absolutely, literally are down vertical shafts in extreme heats as well. Um, our founder himself actually really struggled, really struggled uh, sort of uh, with the Tanzanite mines. And now, do you want to know what depth they're at? I can show you. It might even be more, actually, because this is ever so slightly out of date. So you can see at the beginning of this chart, almost 100 metres is the equivalent to the uh, Statue of Liberty. Have you ever been up the Shard? Or maybe the Eiffel Tower? The Eiffel Tower is very high, yeah. Uh, Sears Tower? The Burr Khalifa? The tallest building in the world? Well, the Tanzanite mine is, is or maybe has overtaken it. Can you imagine no, I, ascending <laughs> down that distance It'd into the Earth's ground? It? Yeah. I, I mean, I don't think I could do it. I don't think I could do it. Mm. Physically, of course, but also mentally. Mm. And the miners do it. They'll go down once in the morning, obviously, and they'll do their working day and then come up at the end of the day. But obviously that time is becoming more and more and more condensed in terms of how long they have to mine the gemstone because it takes them so long to actually get down there. Mm -hmm. So it's understandable that we say, OK, well, this might have gone in 10 years. That's fine. Well, it's not fine. It'll be ever so sad when it does. But we can turn it, it will put a positive spin on it. It's positive if you own Tanzanite. Are you ready? We have a mega auction opportunity. I have, I have a fair amount of Tanzanite because I've worked here at Jewelry Maker for 11 years. But I still buy more because, again, when that news does break and is announced to the world that Tanzanite is no longer being unearthed from the ground, understandable to see why when you have got Burr Khalifa, literally that kind of level of depth... And then we make a promise of 20 carats of vanadium-rich, beautiful blue tanzanite for under £10. What did you say, Ross? 20 carats. A price promise of under 10 And so, I mean, so wonderful colour and so usable as well, aren't they? I feel like I haven't seen a strand of tanzanite for, for quite a while. It hasn't been, you're right. It has, yeah. It's been a long time. Do you remember when we used to do tanzanite days? Uh, uh, across Gemporia, we used to do entire 24-hour days, Tanzanite weekends. We don't do it anymore. Why? Burr Khalifa, there you go. It's literally the depth or the height of Burr Khalifa under the ground. £19.99, it would be great, wouldn't it? Yeah. It'd be absolutely amazing. We've got a 300 quantity opportunity. I buy this, uh, listen, I'll be honest, let's say it as it is. I don't need more tanzanite. I've got tanzanite, because I've got involved on unmissable strands like this before. I've bought tanzanite when we used to have the old shop. I've bought tanzanite from our sister, uh, from our sister channel. I've been able to treat my loved ones to tanzanite like so many of us here at Jewelry Maker. I buy it because it would be daft not to. That Especially when it's price promised under £10. Yeah, yeah. 
I was thinking all the lovely design. So at that, at that price, I mean, it's, you know, I'm thinking, you know, when we've done the lovely sterling silver bracelets, at that price, you know, can you imagine like a Tanzanite bubble style? Oh. Where it's unique, you know. It's, you it's, could, it's, couldn't you? But that, it's times like now, isn't it? When it's at that sort of price. Now is the time getting, to get it. Getting a few of them. And can you imagine, that'd be so lovely. And you've got that slight graduation as well. Beautiful. Be, yeah. Um, in 44 seconds, we are going to that price point. And I get it. Some people want to visually see that price drop. I totally, totally get it. Um, we, 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 so I've always described there's three types of people. There's those of you that are regulars, they shop, they, uh, they hear me say maybe a price promise or maybe hint, um, and they're in straight, like, straight away, even before we've even put maybe the first price on our screens. I don't want to dwell on price right now, but it's very difficult not to when you're talking about an under £10 Tanzanite deal. So they'll go, yeah, good for me, righto, check it out, however many I want. Then you'll have those people that just want to see it visually a little bit closer. That's a little bit closer on, the, on our graphics. And then you have got the risk takers that wait until that price drop, wait until the phone lines and the website is completely and utterly bombarded. I'm not, listen, you can be whichever one of those people you want to be. Um, but yeah, it's going under £10. Go, 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 go. Like I said, it would be a, it would be a gemstone that we will probably see in our lifetimes the depletion of tanzanite. We will see I mean, it. That's a great uh, forget jewelry maker for a minute. That's a great price for a, a, any stone, isn't it? Bracelet that you could quartz. Yeah, I'm not running out of Really lovely, and you know, it, it, that is a great price anywhere yeah. else. For that, the fact that it is, you know, it's tanzanite and it's a beautiful, beautiful strand. We're not going to run out of those, though, are we? No. We're going to run out of tanzanite in the foreseeable. But again, when you see that diagram, when you see the height, the, you know, the depths, mm. down vertical shafts in yeah. extreme heats, can you imagine how claustrophobic? It, yeah, it's, yeah, it's a... I, I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. And then we go, all right, then, I'll, I'll just pay a tenner. A tenner. It's mad. We're, we're not far off the height of Snowden. Under the ground. For a really you know, workable these are... strand as well, isn't it? If you yeah. think about how, all the things you could do with that. Like, like cut stones are incredible. You know, how beautiful that is. Have you ever considered this, Claire? Because it's just dawned on me how athletic the miners must, must be. Mm. You know, because, you know, yeah. climbers that climb Snowden, yeah. and I know it's different, I know it is, but they have to be physically fit, don't but, they? Uh, but like you said, physic it's a physical and a mental thing. You'd have to be... You'd have to have good control, wouldn't you? And, and know, I'm and to push yourself guaranteed. of, yeah. You know, yeah. if I do that, I want to come back with a pretty amazing Tanzanite. Mm. I've got a minute until we close this auction, then we're going to be showing off your amazing pieces in the Wall of Fame. And of course, you've got your masterclass. Don't forget that. And the draw, yes. All of your kits are going to be available on pre-order. Um, so there's only three kits, so you can choose your different gemstones, the colourways. You've got Tanzanite, that would be awesome with this. Wow. You've got beautiful nephrite, and you've got the most amazing tourmaline. Claire, as always, stunning jewellery. Oh, thank you. Can't see that one. She's thank done you. it again. Isn't she clever? So, yeah, um, you can shop ahead and pre-order on, on Claire's amazing kits as well. I mean, if you're getting the Tanzanite kit, I think you need I'll to get that, the strands yes. as well. Yeah, yeah. Strands like this back, God, I don't know, seven, eight years ago, you'd have probably been talking about £80, £70. Mm. I don't know. I'm guessing, I'm guessing. I know we could get... It depends on the price that we got the Tanzanite for at that point. I'm not saying every strand was that price point, obviously. We brought you star buy deals. But we would. it wouldn't have been single figures, would it? No, it wouldn't. wouldn't have been it single wouldn't. figures. Well done, everybody. Congratulations to you all. And stay with us because we're going to be showing off your wall of fames, your designs at long last. Technically, it's is sorted after this. Oh, I like <laughs> Adam. Oh, waffy, waffy, waff off. I love it. I love it. Right, starting us off this morning, number 10. Hello, Sue. Hello to you, lovely. Oh, that's beautiful. Speaking oh, of amazing girls. 
That's gorgeous. Um, Sue's saying, hi, this is a beautiful peacock necklace that I made a while ago. All items are from Jewelry Maker, so as always. Sue, stunning. Mm. We love that. Number 11 from Sarah. Good <coughs> morning to you. Not good morning. Good afternoon, Sarah. Oh, nice. um, hi, all. Here is my entry to this week's Wall of Fame. I used Jewelry Maker Ruby Zoocyte faceted beads uh, that I got at a bargain price. I made a stretchy bracelet and earrings to match a necklace that I made for my mum for Christmas. Oh, How lovely. lovely. Sarah. She said she loved them. Thanks for all the great deals. Oh, Love it. We don't beautiful. see enough rubies. No, outside, that's do we? lovely, isn't it? Congratulations. Uh, that's nice. Number 12, we've got Sarah. Hello to you, Sarah. Ah, oh, spot a bit of kiss cross Look here. Uh, this week's WAF entry is a first attempt at a kiss cross necklace and earrings using blue goldstone and sea beads, all from jewelry maker inspired by Mark Smith and his fabulous demo. Good luck to everybody, Sarah That's says. Well, good luck Sarah. to you. Um, I've got number 13, Michelle Greaves. Good morning to you, Michelle. That's Ooh, lovely. That wire work. Very neat. Uh, Michelle saying, here is a silver plate and coated hematite bracelet. All components are from jewelry maker. Good luck to everybody in the draw. Gorgeous, Michelle. Number 14 is from Abby. Hello, jewelry maker. Please see this over the head monochrome necklace. Oh, oh that's a bit of me, that is, Abby. Uh, with the chakra beads. The main necklace is made uh, with beading wire, pearls, and various gemstones. The chakra piece was made with uh, black tube wire, beads, and color selected 11 OC beads. I hope you like it. All from jewelry maker. Good luck, fellow waffers. And thanks to JM because. Because of you, my mind goes into places it probably shouldn't. <laughs> Abby, I don't know if oh, that's Abby. a compliment or not, but I'm guilty of that as well. <laughs> Sending lots of love. I'm going to pass these over to Claire. Oh, here we go. And I've got number 15, and this is uh, Vivienne. Oh, how lovely. Oh, isn't that pretty? That is very beautiful. Hi, all. Here is my necklace made with tiny sea beads and one labradorite cube. I chose this one as I can see a V shape in the cube. It's finished with a bolt ring class and a hematite star. Best wishes to all. And that's from Vivian. That is gorgeous. Vivian. Beautiful. I was thinking, Vivian, um, you probably like the showcase that we launched today. That beautiful blue cast mm. ending. Yeah, Amazing. yeah. Well, very well with that, wouldn't it? I've got then I've got number 16, uh, which is uh, from Karen. She, Karen says, hi, all this is my entry for this week. All components are from JM. I've only just started my chainmail journey. So these are a, a few more. So these are a few more weaves I've tried, including the beaded chainmail using six OC beads, which I love. Good luck to everyone. Fingers and toe, uh, toes crossed. Wow, look at that. It's incredible. Amazing well work. Done, Karen. It's lovely. Uh, then I've got number 17, and this is from uh, Michelle. Oh, they're lovely. Beautiful. Making me think of holidays. Uh, this week's entry to the Wall of Fame is a collaboration with my sister, who is a quilter with an amazing eye for colour. When she saw the sparkle tube, she was hooked, and I couldn't stop her. Good luck to all. And that's from Michelle, the gorgeous Michelle. Then I've got uh, number 18, and this is Christine. Dear JM, here is my entry for the Wall of Fame. Earrings and necklace with drops of brandidurite and fluorite with beaded sections of Guatemalan jade, which is a Christmas present. Fluorite and a beaded ring with fluorite. All items from JM except the earring findings. Good luck to all in the draw. That's incredible, Christine. Lovely. It's absolutely stunning work. Uh, and then lastly, I've got number 19, and this is Caroline. Hello, everyone. This is my entry for the Wall of Fame. It is a black agate and CB tassel necklace which was inspired by Claire. Best wishes and that's from Caroline. That is lovely. Yeah, Aww. she is an inspiration as well, isn't she? Oh, that's nice. Well, Claire. I know. All together now. Happy birthday to you. Come on, Liam, they can only hear me. Happy birthday. <laughs> to you <laughs> happy birthday dear claire Aww. happy birthday to you hip hip. hooray hip hip. hooray don't try and say out you quiet liam <laughs> you're never quiet last 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 time hip hip Hooray! Oh, we thank love you, you, beautiful lady. Mwah. Thank you very much. And right. thank you for this. I know. Tuck into that a bit later, shall we? Um, shall we make some people a little bit? Yes. I think you should do this as it's your birthday. Is that okay? Yeah, I'd please. love to. So, winner and runner-up from oh, yes, Claire please. McDonald. Do both. Do both. Thank yeah, you. it's your birthday show. Go on. Thank you. Right, right. ready, ready. Hope you're shopping ahead and pre-ordering okay. on your kits as well. 
Ouais. Mm. <gasps> Number 17. Do we... Oh, sorry. Oh, it's Michelle. Hey! Yay! Well done, Michelle. Did we read Michelle yes. today? Yes, we oh, did. Oh, the collaboration with this with yeah. oh, sister. Well lovely. done, Michelle. Congratulations. You're our winner, yeah? That yeah. was the winner. That was the winner. Runner up. Number five. Number f oh, low numbers. Two, sorry, five. Number five. Number five. Bronwyn, Bronwyn congratulations. Oh, well done, Bronwyn. It's amazing you're our runner up today. Get your entries in. Send us a photograph. You can email oh, it to the God. studios. Um, the only stipulation for the Wall of Fame is that, of course, they are using jewellery, maker, products. Right. If you pass me that tombola, I can pass it to our luscious Liam, who's right there. Sorry, darling. That's all right. Liam. Liam. Look who it is, everyone. Ah. Look who it is. There he is. There he is. He's still in ah. the building. I'm still here. Right, I'll be here soon. Are you? Yeah. Are you? Where's Ross going? He's going on holiday. I think. He, oh, he's off on holiday. Seventeenth, St Patrick's I think it, Day. I think it might be the three of us. Oh, yeah. that's going to be yes. a lot of fun, isn't it? Lots of fun. Yes. Right then, let's bring you your amazing masterclass kits so we can dive into this awesome demo. I can't believe this. I can't believe we're doing it. it um, spinach green is what imperial green is to jade. This is most definitely spinach green. Um, it's certified completely and utterly natural. The original jade, I mean, this is, nephrite is actually older than jadeite. Um, you're getting two beautiful, where's the jewelry? Let's have a little so look. So I've used, this one is for my demo. So oh, your demo yeah, with this one, this amazing. This one. Um, so you're getting the two, plus you've got then a strip of your 999 silver bezel strip. Yes. So it's pure of the 925. So yeah, fine silver, so it's gonna be lovely and malleable, and that's what we want to do that, um, to bezel around it. And that's a 25 centimeter strip, yes. which is what, uh, five millimeters in yes, thickness. Yes, so a nice thicker one. And then you've got this. So another piece of lovely sterling silver, uh, 925 unfinished sheet, five by five centimeters of the thickness of 0 0.3 that way. So is this what you do? So I've the made, back? The, yeah, so, so there's different ways of working with this. So you can use that as the backing. You can use that, um, so that's what I've made the feathers out of. There's loads of things you can do with that. Load. So it depends what... what Lots you, of sterling. Yes, there's an awful lot. And don't forget, so you'd plan that out, um, uh, you know, to get the most of it. Keep all the little scraps. And that will, that's where you do things like, um, you know, the... Your, this one. Yeah, is that the heart one? Yeah. yeah. And, and around the tourmaline. So anything like that, keep all of your scraps. Oh, I love those. The, and that makes the, the granulation there. I so love yeah, the those. heart out of it as well. You know, so all, all out of the sheet? Yes. Yeah. Amazing. Well, these kits are absolutely flying already, Claire. Um, on pre-order. You're getting two nephrites, two of these beautiful rose-cut nephrites within the box. Look at that colour. It doesn't get any better than that. You know, like I said, when we're describing your jades, whether it's nephrite or jadeite, the terminology is quite, ah, oh, let's say it's, it's, it's not the most romantic, is it? That's, that's mm. very much a Western thing. Mm. So mutton fat, not that pretty. Imperial, I would say, is a nice description, yes. I yeah. suppose. Yeah. Um, but when it can't, you know, so spinach is not the prettiest of description, but it is like, it is your imperial green in the nephrite world. And that's exactly what I see on your screens right now. How many do we have of this kit then? We've, oh, only 50. 14 have already gone on pre-order. Hmm. The sheet on its own is 20 pounds, yes. How much would I pay for these? Are you, uh, you're asking me. Oh, uh, I would have probably said more than that. I would have said maybe 69 at Jewelry Maker just because of the quality of that mm, colour. Yeah. 69 for, there's two, and the rose cut. That's 90 pounds straight. Okay, so I would say maybe this kit would be, be 100 pound. 99. Is that, would we all agree? Does that seem reasonable? Yeah. You know, if you were to try and buy a natural spinach green nephrite in a, in a single pendant, you ain't going to be paying £100 for one. Mm. Well, you can get the whole kit today. £49. 
See, I mean, I've, I've used mine. I've used mine as sort of a, a doubled up, so it's more of like a three dimension, but I mean, these are, because it's very, very rare that you get <gasps> two that are the same same size so that's what i wanted to do you know something oh like a bit claire that's different. amazing but if you think you know that is those are two identical so if you wanted to make more than one piece you absolutely could you know you could do half of half of it um and you just have the one side and then the sheet oh, at the back you could you, you could. know but it's really really lovely to get two that are that are the same you know so you can you can do a slightly more indulgent piece like that um, I but I mean, you, you think if that, if that was going to be a ring at that size and you bezel set it onto the sheet, it'd be incredible. Well, which you, which you uh, demoed earlier on this morning yes. as well, didn't yeah. you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We've been doing the mega deals all day, Claire. We don't think that your masterclass should be any different. Okay. In a minute. Oh, you're already getting a saving in my head anyway on the nephrite. That's spinach green nephrite. Pardon? Nefertiti, yeah. You've all... You, I mean, right now, that's £20 for the silver sheet on its own. Yeah. And I'm not talking and the about yes. the bezel strip. Yeah. But, and don't uh, forget that bezel strip is the, the thicker version. So we do a finer version of okay. uh, uh, 0.3. This is the, you know, the, the thicker one. So there's more silver. So it, it, more silver. So it means you can either, if you need, want it thinner, you can uh, cut it. So remember as well, when we've used it with the decorative scissors, it's ideal for that. Yeah. But you could also cut it in half if you're working with shallower cabs. But it's ideal for this because if you want to enclose both of them, you, you can just use one part, you know, that, that thickness of the, of the strip. Claire, mm -hmm. I think 49.99 is a great deal. Me too. But we've done quite a few mega deals today, haven't yeah. we? Yeah. It's your birthday show. Every single one of you that has shopped between nine and one o'clock oh. today is also in with the chance of winning this amazing goodie basket that we have here for Claire's birthday. We'll announce it on tomorrow's show. So uh, uh, tune in for that, Claire. We can announce yes, that I winner. Yes, I will, yeah. Um, the only stipulation is no minimum That's spend amazing. or anything like that. If you've shopped between nine o'clock and one o'clock, you are in with a chance of winning. Um, and look at what you can create. Do I need to be an accomplished silversmith well i'm going to show i'm going to show strength. you now so so what you might want to do is it, you might want to have it if you look at um so that one there so you can see that's the tanzanite one this is how it would look if you did you know the single and i'm going to show you with and demonstrate with that um well that i tell you what plate. um you take it away and then so, cue should we get me, going cue me when yes it's all available on pre-order anyway lovely um Perfect. but as and when we get a natural break i'll kind of bring the other kids, yeah thank you those, okay so. so i'm gonna i'm gonna talk you through the stages um and if you want to uh, replicate what I've done and I can show you and talk you through. You can also, uh, if you don't want to, if you wanted to make more than one piece of jewellery and you wanted it um, uh, two pendants, uh, we can talk through that as well. So if we look at the um, look at the piece, it's a three dimensional, that, that sort of that ball effect, even though we know it's of two halves that we've put together, but it's how we put it together. So if we look at the components, mm -hmm. so we've got our, our wonderful, um, the cabochons here. So what we want to do is we want to make a setting uh, that we can have both of the, the cabochons in. We've got nice movement here. So it's a few different stages of, of, of soldering as well. So we've got the soldering of the, um, the bezel strip, which we'll have a go at and you can see here, uh, and a few tips as well to get that the right size, which is then going to give us something that looks like that. We've then got, we've got soldering of, um, uh, like a bale and then like a, a, a movable one that, that we want to, um, it's, it's quite important so that we can get the most out of that bezel strip that the one uh, jump ring is soldered in that direction. So we can see that first one. So if I just cover that bit and then you've got this one that, that moves, so you get nice movement with it as well. Um, so you've got a few different stages, so three different sorts of, of, of soldering there. So you can see how that's all going to fit together. If you want to do um, like I've done uh, and you want to do a, a feather, um, I mean, I can't demonstrate that now. It takes quite a long time, but I can talk, talk you through it. So I just hand drew out um, uh, the shape of a feather, took a little bit of, um, if you take like the, the clear um, 
plastic and you go around, or you can draw around with your, with your marker, pierce that out, and then you can shape that as well um, and engrave on it. And so you can see, so that's how I've made the feather charms. But I mean, you can add absolutely anything else if you want to. I just like it when it's clustered uh, together. So the first thing I want to do is you're going to have your... Um, this is your fine silver, like Elle says, you know, so it's, it's, um, it's not your 925, it's your, it's your 999. So it means it's nice and malleable, which is exactly what you want for when you're going around those stones. So I have also annealed it. Uh, so I've just uh, given it a heat up um, and then I'm gonna start to make that circular shape. So if I just use this for the moment. So I'm starting it off. And then, as always, we've got two components. So we've got the setting and we've got the stone. So we need to make sure that they fit well. So I'm gonna just bring this round. So you would then, you can then get your permanent marker. Let's have a look here. And we're gonna go and bring that down. So with the bezel, it is a bit of a, like a, it has to be just right, you don't want it uh, too tight, too loose, you know, so to spend a bit of time uh, to just have a look, measure all the way around so that you, you've got a, um, a nice fit here. So I let that drop. So I'm going to use my shears now and we're going to cut there. Okay, so as with all our soldering, what we want to do is we want to get that neat seam again. So if I sort of bring this round, I'm just gonna fold it in and bring that back round. Okay. So if I pop it round again, we'll just do a last check before we do anything else and check that that is a good size for it. Okay, so what we're gonna do now, I'm just gonna go back and forth with this, a bit like with a, a jump ring or I'm just gonna move that round. And I can get my chain nose pliers as well so that I get a really good, you know, when we made the ring in the first demonstration, it wasn't round to start off with. And we can do the same here. We can get that seam really, really nice and neat. We can make it round afterwards. So I'm just gonna bring that in now. So the first thing we're gonna do, and I'll show you how beautifully this works. I'm just going to, so I'm going to move this out of the way and bring my soldering in. So that might be a good, have you got anything? Um, are you, could you bring something? Yes. Oh, while yeah. I set this up, is that all right? Shall we do the tanzanite kit? Because that yes. does make sense. One of these um, rose cuts has flipped over in the box, but they are both obviously that really beautiful checkerboard. Basically, the, the, the carrot weight is on the front as opposed to underneath the actual stone. You do also get the beautiful strip. I know it's not in the photograph right now. Um, and you also get the sheet, which is three by three uh, centimetres and 0.4 millimetres in its thickness. So each of these are thick enough, aren't they? Was this what you made that beautiful tanzanite necklace with? Uh, Yes, yes, that's the yeah, that's the sheet, isn't it? So yeah, that bit is the the feather. You can see so the feather in there. Amazing. In there. So you've got more. Oh, that's really pretty. So pretty. So you can make anything you want with it, can't you? you know, yeah. Do any um, any shape with it. So all of that, that that entire both of those pendants made out of this uh, um, this kit. Obviously, with, uh, with with silver left over. Plus, you're getting the two tanzanite rose cuts. You know, given everything that we've already discussed about tanzanite, I think we yep. already appreciate. Um, we're sort of well, not not only just appreciating. We're we're, we're reminded to appreciate um, the efforts and the depths that those miners are actually going to to actually achieve this gemstone. How many do we have, though, Roscoe? 50 again. These are quite limited edition kits. Yes, though. they are. They're quite exclusive, aren't they? They are. You know, you're looking at seven carrots. Both are 10 millimetres in their size and you're getting, uh, you're getting two of them as well. So if you put the two together, I mean, that pendant is literally 14 carrots of tanzanite. How Incredible, amazing is that? Yeah, yeah. How amazing yeah. is that? Yeah. Um, packed ourselves into a corner, says Ross. Should we match the price? Let's do it. Let's do it. Might as well. It's a lot of silver, isn't it? It is. It's yeah, and stunning gemstones. Twenty nine ninety nine. Yeah. Pretty amazing. 
You know, if the tanzanite's on their own, I think that's a fabulous deal. Or the silver on its own, mm. or the bezel on its own. I mean, there's only 50 of those opportunities, though. So, quite and like limited. I say, you know, I've used it and, and, and doubled it up because it's, uh, you know, it's quite rare to get them. They are so precise. So, yeah. if you want to repeat um, designs, it's a great way as well because you know exactly what size they are because they fit together so beautifully. I just thought I can't resist. You know, we always talk about like lockets or, or, or mm. you know, something that can move around. And this is a really, really good. I'm also thinking doing. about that ring that you sometimes wear with the with the reticulation on there. That's yes, a rose cut, isn't it? it? Is. And I, lo I love that. So when when I talked to Sam and when we made these kits, it was it was that a rose a rose cut is one of my favourite. I absolutely I love it. I just think it's a beautiful way um, of showing off gemstones. Um, and these are gorgeous, gorgeous stones. Um, anyway, take it away. Right, okay. make sure you check out. There was only fifty available. So what we're looking at now, so I've got the, um, I've got the, uh, the bezel here. So what we're going to look at, hopefully, if you can see from the front, so the seam, if you have a look uh, this side here, that's where we're going to be looking, down that, down that seam there. Yeah. So I'm going to set it up um, and then uh, hopefully you'll be able to see it before, before me. So I'm just going <laughs> to... <laughs> your 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 brush does make me chuckle. I think yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it is a brush. It's a good brush. It's, it's still got well, it's a well fair loved, bit of like, it? life in it. Yeah, yeah. I suppose you don't need it to have. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna get. I'm gonna start laughing and is try with a steady is hand. Is it actually like rock hard, Claire? That brush. Oh yeah, yeah, definitely. <laughs> So you don't clean it then? No, I don't clean it. Oh. No. Like, yeah, look, look, I think. Hang on, really hang on. We, need, we all need to see this because I think we're all, yeah, go on. Uh, you ready? Oh, it, no, but it's quite soft. Yeah, all right. Oh, no, no, look, I'm not going to be able to use that. That's, um, <laughs> yeah, there we are. So, so now I'm going to, I've put the flux on. I'm going to pop the that on top. So what we're looking at, ideally, again, all soldering, we want to try and get that that piece of solder under the seam, and we're going to use the heat as that as the capillary action. Use that heat as the as a magnet and get that solder to run up that seam. So I need to move the plastic out of the way. So if you keep an eye on the seam, and let's have a look. So hopefully it won't bubble away. So if I were doing this at home, I was, obviously I would have the seam pointing at, at me. But let's see where this goes. And if you can shout and let me know when you see it, okay. if, when it goes. So let's get, get the flame a bit closer. Oh, there we are. Did you see it go? I did. Yeah. Did everybody at home see it? Amazing. So let's have a look. So now. Oh, it's stuck. Let's have a look. So yeah, with this, so that's that's good. Uh, what I can see there, if you look from the front, we can see, so it's started, but it hasn't gone all the way, all the way. you see? So all we do, pop that in the pickle, uh, it's still got a solder on there, reflux, take it out of the pickle, clean it in water, uh, and you'd go, go again. And just that will then run down that seam. Okay. Absolutely no problem with that. So you've got that bit. So if I get rid of that, that then gives us, if I just move this over, that then gives us our bezel. I'm going to make a big mess here. Haven't I? Right, here we are. That gives us, so we've gone from this bit and it takes us now to, you can see, so this bit here. So you clean all of this up. If at this point it's a, looking like it's a little bit tight, so if we had a look and it, it wasn't really, it was struggling to, it was too snug. So what we can do, if you've got something like um, uh, one of the, um, uh, from the dapping block, and then you put it on, so if I bring this over, you're looking for like metal on metal. So if I bring that on and you start to roll, what that will do, that will stretch the bezel, the soft silver. So you just do it little bits, little bits, and that then can give you just that couple of extra um, uh, size that you need for it to fit in snugly. So you would do all of that, which then gives us this. 
Okay, so we know that that's going to fit in like that. And again, we try the other bit because we've now got not just two components, we've got three components and that's going to sit in oh, lovely. like that. So then what you'd need to do is you need to then go back. And do you remember how when I'd set up the, um, in the first demonstration, we were going to solder the, um, the jump ring, the bail onto the charm. So it's a similar thing here. So what we're looking at, and I'll set it up and then I'll show you how to set the stone. So we've got now a, a bezel strip that we need to be enough to set around two stones. We know they're the same size, same sort of depth as well. So we know we need to get that in the middle. So the first lot of soldering we must do is going to be, so you can see I've got a piece of um, silver here and I've just filed off a little bit there, which means I can then put that, set that up mm -hmm. to solder and that needs to go in the middle. So you can mark it again with your, um, with your uh, permanent marker and you can get a good contact there. So you want to go halfway and solder that here. Okay, I'm going to have something that then will look like that. Our next bit of soldering, so we've done one, two bits of soldering. Now, if you're really careful and you keep that first seam away from the solder here, you can maybe do two lots of um, with hard. Then I've got this one here, which I'm going to, I've, I've sort of formed the, the jump ring, but I've left it unsoldered. But then open that up. That's going to go through here. And we're going to close that up and then you're going to lay that onto your board and aim your torch so remember this one will be attached to here another bit of solder here so ideally maybe if you've got solder paste or the easy solder you would pop that there aim your flame here so you're just soldering this bit and not melting anything that you've done here and not melting the bezel strip that's then going to give you something that looks like that so if we look at that you can see so we've got our We've got the jump ring that is soldered in this direction and you've got the, the larger bale here. So you've still got nice movement and then you've got the bezel strip. So I've cleaned all of this up now, polished everything. So now what we're going to do is we're going to work and we're going to set these stones. So have you still got a kit? We've got yeah. one more kit. Can we I do just? It now? Yeah, is that okay? Well, I was just admiring this setting. lovely, uh, this lovely necklace. Um, so this is from the kit that I'm about to show you as well. Um, beautiful bicolor tourmaline you've actually got in here. How stunning, amazing isn't is that? It? Absolutely stunning. And that reminds me of the ring that you actually wear. Yes, yeah, With it's that lovely. style, isn't it? It's, yeah. yeah, it's my style. Really pretty, really pretty. Um, so again, sticking with the rose cuts. Rose cuts don't have to be round. They can also be sort of oval um, or rectangular or just kind of irregular like shapes. Um, they've got that flat bottom and then the bulk of the carrot white is literally on the top, which ma actually makes more sense than it does than a, uh, than a round brilliant cup. Because I love think them. about it, I love them too. And I know Jennifer Aniston had a rose cut, mm. didn't she, engagement ring. Um, because actually when we look at, say, I don't know, my engagement ring, for example, we're looking at bird's eye view. We're not seeing the Tiny bulk of the carrot yes, weight yes. underneath. Yeah. Yeah. Um, amazing. So you get this lovely parcel of bicolored tourmaline, fascinating gemstone that comes in a whole multitude of got lovely colors. Again, we've gone back to your five by five millimeter um, silver sheet, which is obviously unfinished. So um, you can obviously do all your soldering and you're getting your 25 centimeters. Can you see that there? 25 centimeters of your uh, of your silver bezel strip, which is 999, not 925. So it's actually purer than 925. Um, 29.99. I mean, that's pretty amazing. These it kits, is. by the way, were meant to be forty nine ninety nine, Which is, again, is a brilliant price because you think it's, it's really well, interesting. Well, that on its own is £20 yeah. from interesting. us. Yeah, unusual gemstones as well. Um, yeah. And then all the sterling um, and fine silver. Yeah, if you were to buy these components separately, that sheet, a sheet on its own will be £20. But you've also got the 999 bezel strip, which is what? How many? I don't know how many. I'm rubbish at metric system. 25 centimetres in inches. I don't know, 10? Looks about 10. Is it about 10? Um, and then you've got six carats of natural tourmaline. Amazing. Which are, I mean, look at that. So straight away there, I'd be looking. That, that's earrings, isn't it? If you look at the matching two that you've got, yeah. that's earrings. Oh, beautiful. Or a ring. 
Love that. $29.99. Have I got 50 of these as well? 50 available. Absolutely guess, stunning. Limited. They were all, uh, the other two kits are looking very limited now, so make sure you check them out. You've got a full £20 saving right back into your pocket. Back to you, Claire. Okay, so so we, we've, we, we know how we were going to make the setting now. So what we want to do now is you, the, you do all of your cleaning up, all your polishing, you know, filing polishing, everything like that that you want to do. So now, so I've popped the two in, and what you're looking to get is you want it so that if we look at like this, uh, what we can, we're trying to get it so it's as even as possible. So you can see both sides there. Okay, so get it so that it's fixed in and that you're happy with um, how much it is because obviously we can't see that seam, but we know they're um, pretty much the same same size. So if they're looking quite even from, from both sides, then we know that that is hopefully the, that where the join is is gonna be about halfway. Okay. So I'm gonna hold, hold one. And so I'm holding like this. And remember, principles of, of your setting, you know, bezel setting, we're now going to push this really lovely silver. And you can see it from, from, from that, uh, from the, if you look at it from the front there, you can actually see that little gap. Mm. And that's what we're going to get rid of. So we're going to use the pusher to push that, that silver over the stone there. So we're getting rid of that, that little gap there. Okay, so I'm going to start and I'm going to, I'm going to do... Um, do opposites at the moment so I'm just going to start and get yourself so that you know when you're when you're doing this sit down and be comfortable um, you know get into a good good position there it will start what will happen is it will mo be moving around and then it just at, 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 it will start to stop um, so it's going to be a little bit fiddly at first so I'm going to go around the the bale I do one side so that it, it doesn't fall out and then I go in and do the other. But all the time I'm trying to get a bit of pressure on so that I don't use all this bezel. Uh, so I'm trying to keep it so it's quite even on both sides. So we're sort of going to keep turning it round. And rocking and rolling over. Okay, so sort of gone from the round into the square and I'm going to go into that corner now so whether you um if you're working as well it doesn't matter it's the same sort of principle with the um uh say if you're going to work and do this uh, bezel set the tourmaline again with some of them because you've got more corners so you might go into um you know work into those corners uh sooner rather than later and then like longer edges as well just so that you're not left with a big crease in the corner. So you can see starting to get that and we're going to keep pushing. And what will happen is you're just trying to avoid getting creases and you're pushing that over. So hopefully if you start to see, so we're getting that curve. So if I now push, I don't want to push too hard, but I'm pushing from the back and that's already, it's holding this side in. So I'm gonna keep working my way and pushing that bezel strip over. And keep going like that. So you're gonna start and make, you can see, so when I, I'm pushing in one, uh, one direction and that might make it sort of come out over a little bit here, go a bit baggy, so I'd then work on this side, pushing over the side of the stone and you're looking to thin that lovely fine silver until it grips all of the, the stone. So what I did, I, I worked all the way around the one side. So like I say, this is now, if I hold it like that, it's not dropping out. So it's, it's nowhere near finished on that side that I've done, but you can start to see, and you can see there how it's, um, uh, we're getting that bit of a curve. And I'm gonna hold here and then I can do and go in and do exactly the same on this side. But you can see how quickly, because that's lovely fine. And I guess I was angles. just thinking about the hardness of these gemstones, Claire. So they're not, I'm not saying any gemstones indestructible, because even diamonds aren't, but they're nice durable gems. So yeah. you, can, you don't have to be too worried yeah. when you're doing this. Uh, yeah, and there are lots technique. of different, I've seen so, and people as well, sometimes will do it, um, you can do it with a toothbrush as well, if you're, if you're worried about that. Uh, that's a good idea, isn't it? So you can see, I'm just so, if you're really worried about maybe you've got an old toothbrush, just bringing that over, just the hard plastic. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Adam said, how do you get hold of his toothbrush? 
You can have it back when I'm done. Uh, <laughs> That's all right, isn't it? A few uses left. Where's the that. rest of it? Why is it only half? That'd be, that'd be silly to have a whole toothbrush, wouldn't it? Well, I don't really know why you've <laughs> I got... don't know where that bit's gone. I obviously didn't need that bit. I pulled that bit off. So you can see, you're just going over. But you can already see, so we've still got lots of work to do on that, but it's not going anywhere. And that's, that's what we're aiming for. So you'd push it all over the, the side and then you go in with your, your burnisher and you give it that lovely... And then that's going to give it that lovely bright, you can see there. So you can see, see there how nicely that's going to look. Beautiful. There we are. Claire. Absolutely beautiful. What's the matter? That's on the cake. No. No. What's that there then? What's this oh, here? When Dad Come brought on. it in, it must have just touched the box or something like that. What's must, this um, here? Because said when Dan brought it in, it must have touched the box. And there's like a little... This star left, shape. Left a star. <laughs> Was it lovely? Oh. I, mm. Right then, let's do let's do uh, the most amazing brand new diamond cut chase. Do you know when you see? I saw it literally being walked around the studio. I was like, "Oh, that's beautiful!" Oh my gosh! Look at the sparkle. Get up close though, Claire. Have a little look up close. Oh, she's getting on the table. What are you doing? Here you are. Just let, I can pass it over to you. Here you go. She was getting on the table then. What are you doing? So, yeah. So this is what I've used for the um, the lovely long uh, longer chains. Can, no, no. Can these. you see? There's like a there's a special link. The, you'd have to get really close. Oh. Uh, <laughs> there's a hundred of these available. They've got like that starburst effect. That starburst. Isn't that beautiful? 20 inches, so uh, it depends on your build, but it'll sit about mm. here on me. Is that there? Yeah. On you? Yeah. Just slightly longer length. I like a 20 inch. Mm. I prefer 20 inch to the 18 inch. Personally, it's all personal. I think thoughts. when you've got, if you're going to have a couple of um, different things, so the, the different motifs and pendants, I think it's nice that you've got a... Slightly longer length. What, was it, what have you just eaten? I had one of the stars. Mm. Mm. That's your cake. So nice. I can't really rumble you because it's your birthday cake. You're allowed to. Gorgeous. 29, sorry, 24 pounds and 99 pence. Those We've got a hundred. Links, they are brand so new. Um, diamond cut is literally as it's described. It's, it's, it's basically almost faceting your sterling mm. silver to give you that mirror-like luster. Can you see that wonderful almost sunburst effect? Huge at the moment in the jewellery mm. world. There's Masoma, there's Astley Clark, which are the two designers that immediately spring to mind that use this. And, and also I'm thinking back to those soldable accents. You know, the sun Her, that we yeah. had this morning at, oh, at gosh, 9 o'clock. Oh, it'd be lovely with that link. 9.99. Yeah. Oh, it's so much lower than I was and expecting. And the large, the large pearls as well would be fabulous with that oh yeah yeah we're running out of time make sure you do check them out we had a hundred did you say and don't That's forget so if you're good. purchasing with this you're in with the chance of winning um our lovely claire's goodie basket which will be announced tomorrow um there's loads in there there's two strands of abalone there's rubies there's sapphires there's pearls there's a penguin Morganite, a penguin um some wire some wire some tumblestone some shells yeah I mean, you're in with a chance of winning that as well. Never done a chain like this previously mm. before. It is brand new. Shouldn't be under £10. Uh, yeah. Ross has been oh, very... lovely, isn't it? has been very transparent about that. H half the stock has gone. Keep on dialing through. We are actually running out of time, but you can still get involved, of course. Not a problem whatsoever. And I would definitely be uh, stocking up on these. Mm. If you're looking for a heavier gram weight, but also something that is a necklace in its own right, you could wear this as a necklace in its own right. Yes, you could, right. yeah, with nothing on it, yeah. Nothing and having it look it, at yeah. the likes of Masoma and everything, because they also have this kind of sunburst. I always describe it as like mm. a sunburst design in lots of their I'm loving it, thinking with that soldable accent that'd, that'd be, be nice yeah, wouldn't it? perfect you need to get hold of this as well yes claire Aww. happy birthday I've had a lovely beautiful morning. i Thank dare you. you to take a big old bite out the side of that cake go Would on you? yeah okay. go on do it it's your birthday you're allowed just take a gigantic bite oh look at that oh, oh god the red, is it really good happy birthday beautiful oh. we love you mm. we love you love enjoy you your weekend away do you know when you're back 
Next week sometime. Next week. Have a lovely afternoon. Happy birthday and good luck, by the way, for the goodie basket.